do 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 Definitely not me uh, waiting for my arena refreshes in the uh, cookie run. Definitely not that. Definitely not uh, sitting on the couch. <laughs> but I had like a, but I had a, uh, a, like a half a pot of coffee that I need to drink. Okay. But here I am a little bit late. I interrupt your regularly scheduled programming with Roller Coaster Tycoon. <laughs> Some things are important to be honest. Yes. Oh, yes. And and Cookie Run is number one. But I have I have plugged my phone in, so there will be there will be no distractions. All right. No distractions. The phone is the phone is out of my reach. I'm pretty sure. Yes. I can't reach it. Who knows where my phone is? Not me. Oi, oi. How's everybody doing? Just casually drinks half a pot of coffee. Oh, well, it's a good uh, it's a good pick me up. Good, good morning, pick me up. And it tastes good. That's what matters. What matters is that coffee is delicious. Coffee helps my digestion. And it also wakes me up. It's liter. it's the miracle drug. It's what they were looking for. Like years and years ago, the ancient alchemists that were testing things in vials and looking for the, uh, like looking for ways to transmute gold and ways to like, uh, get immortality and ways to like heal different sicknesses. I mean, obviously we found like ways to vaccinate people and that's super powerful and amazing. But coffee is something that has been fueling humanity for like thousands of years at this point, I think. It's the elixir of life, yes. <laughs> Listen, let's be honest. This universe, it, it prones towards destruction and there's no way that our bodies are ever going to be immortal because the human body is made at its core to to break down like it wants to die our bodies want to leave but our our stay here on earth can be greatly greatly like improved by coffee and that's and that's why it's the elixir of life that's why it's so important and it, it sparked the into an intellectual renaissance indeed yes the the renaissance uh all the greatest things in life you can trace it directly back to coffee you you look at societies that don't have coffee and it, it's i mean it's it's quite clear that coffee is the reason why humanity exists <laughs> humans were in a way coffee was made for humans but in another way, humans were made to consume coffee. It was like assumed in our genetic structure that we would need coffee to be able to function. So it's it's all part of nature. It's all part of the tapestry of nature. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm done. I'm finished. <laughs> Just don't drink too much or it could fuel anxiety. I mean, I yeah, I think so. It can like add, it can add fuel to the fire. But as a generally, I mean, I used to consider myself an anxious person, but more recently, I would not consider myself an anxious person. And coffee doesn't really like give give me much of a boost to being anxious. But uh, oh wait, a hey, camera, camera's important. Oi, how's everybody doing? Okay, re the real stream started. I've stopped the the cof the coffee rant. Tsunami Slayer, how are you doing? What's up, Ahsoka? How are you doing? Ah, uh, Kimmick. Oh, Kareem, what's up? x -trait. Good to see you. <laughs> coffee is the elixir of the gods. Eerie Coffee, it's good to see you again. Hello. I'm always happy to see those little the little blobs going. Rawr, 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 rawr. The, the ditto is so cute. Seder Cascading, thank you for the lurk. I appreciate it. Seder Cascading's a good friend. Gonda, hiya. Uh, back to work tomorrow? Oh, no. <laughs> back to work. It's almost work time. Bubba, Bubba Ivy, how are you doing? <laughs> you said that you're a little bit buzzed, and that's, that's totally fine. You can, <laughs> you can, all adults can can do pretty much whatever they want whenever it comes to me streaming. The King of Squirrel, welcome to the chat. I don't think that I missed anybody. I hope that y'all are all having a wonderful day. Fluffy Giraffe, not good. Have rough day. I'm sorry that your that your day's been rough, my friend. I I hope that I can improve it just a little bit. Just a little bit with some with some good vibes. Some good vibes. Tay! Tay's here! Hooray! 
Tay, Tay is a gift to, to any chat that they are in. Buzzed? Tisk, tisk. I can't believe it. Imagine the other elixir. That's the elixir of death, but still, but still an elixir. Uh, <laughs> you're so happy to be here. No, Tay, shush. No, uh, you can't, you can't know you me. Don't know you me. Also, Calico, there's a bug in the room. Did I kill it? No, I think it got away. There's been, there's been two yeah, little bugs. Twilight Excel! Hey, can we get some hype in the I've chat? Thank you bit, so much. Super happy to be back. You've been gone smiley for a bit, face. but you're smiley back, face. baby. Smiley Thank you so much. Face. I've been gone for a bit, so no worries. We were both gone. We both left. Also, I saw Vio. Hey, Vio, how are you doing? Baba Booey. Baba Booey to you, my friend. Good to see you. Let me see. Somebody else I remember up a little bit higher was like, I've been gone for a while. I'm back. Who was it? Did I did I say hi to them? Tayaki san. Hello. So cute. Uh maybe. Oh, Champion of the Raven Queen. I think that I said hi to everybody. And Divey's here. Hooray! I miss Die. Die. Where have you been? Man, I I thought that we'd lost Die or something. Die. I'm so glad to see you. I'm so glad to to confirm that that you're that you're still coming to streams. How are you doing? Divey. I hope you've been well, my friend. I'm sure you've been working your buns off. Kim, how are you doing? Uh, you missed me? JK, JK. Oh, of course I missed you, Kim. I miss you. I miss you anytime that I turn off the stream. I miss you anytime that I, it, whenever I wake up, I go, where's Kim? Where's Kim? Uh, Lurk, gonna get back to my nap. Kareem, get some sleep. Get some sleepies, everybody. It's nap time. Ivy wants to party now. The wine <laughs> is taking effect. I, I don't know what that other word is. Sa, sa, sagritas? I, I, I don't know how to say that. I'm sorry, I'm trying my best. Is it Friday yet, Merp? I, it's not even close to Friday. Not even close. It is, <laughs> it is Tuesday, I'm afraid. Um, but uh, I, I guess we're, we're on our way. We're, we're, we're heading towards Friday. Cosmic Penguin, hi there! Hooray! It's good to see, it's good to see all of you people. I'm so happy to see all of y'all. Mm -hmm. Take my money's here too. Hey, take my money. Hope you're doing good. Mushroom Gal! Hello everyone, I'm gonna lurk while cooking dinner. Sounds good! Sounds good, sounds good. Enjoy, enjoy cooking your dinner. Have fun! I need to get better at cooking dinner. Uh, I have considered getting like a meal box or something. I have some friends recently that I stayed over at their house and they had, what was it? Hello Fresh or something like that. That would encourage me to cook, but I don't know. It's it's expensive. It's expensive. Uh, you're doing great, Dunai. You've, you've been doing the opposite of working. You've been chilling. Nice, good, good, good. Taking some time for yourself. Relaxing, I'm happy to hear it. Nice to know that you're not dead, Die. <laughs> die is not dead, dead is not die. Just how I miss you whenever you end stream. Like, where is Earl, Kim? I'm right here. Don't worry. Don't worry. I, I'll never leave you nor forsake you. <laughs> little Viking. Hoot hoot. Good to see. Uh, you know, you know, little Viking. I do. I do sometimes think back, especially recently. I've been playing Cookie Run and I had a friend that, that warned me. Don't play Cookie Run on stream because it attracts a bunch of children. <laughs> A bunch of stupid kids that'll be like, can you add me? Can I, can I like destroy your town, please? Um, and it made me think of Minecraft, which is the only game that I am scared of playing because children will show up and they'll be like, oh, this is Pog. Can you, can you blow up this entire villager city with, with TNT? So I'm, I'm scared to, I'm scared to stream Minecraft, but I always remember I got to I got to meet my friend Lil Viking through Minecraft, so it's not all bad, okay? There there are some adults that watch <laughs> that play and watch Minecraft, so it's not all bad. Poggers, have you heard of Dream? Please no. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. Uh, Leela, how are you doing? What's up, Can of Arc? I hope you're doing fantastic. Hello. It's good to see y'all. And Genius is back. Genius is back. I, as usual. I'm interrupting our regularly scheduled programming because there is no regularly scheduled programming. I just play whatever my little pea brain wants to play. 
<laughs> and I've been watching a lot of Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 content on YouTube. And I, I was like watching, I was watching a stream highlight last night and I watched it for like an hour. And I was like, is it, is this really that fascinating to me? It, do I really just enjoy roller coasters this much? I need to play some more of that. Most of what I watch on YouTube is Hermitcraft, people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's 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 a little bit different. Not all Minecraft streams are bad. No, 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 not the streams. The streams are fine and, and people playing it on their own. I was just saying, if you stream it, if you stream it as a streamer, there will be there will be children that show up. That's all. Just that's all. It's not bad. It's not a bad idea or anything. It's just well, um, if you want to find like friends on the internet, which is essentially what I'm trying to do, I'm trying to play games that uh, that that like-minded people play and that will like introduce fun people for us to hang out with. That's that's what I'm looking for. And most of the fun people to hang out with are over maybe, I, I don't want to call out anybody, but maybe over 15. There's definitely people that are younger than 15 that are not frustrating, but those people that are right on the line of whether they're allowed to have a Twitch account or not, they, they can be maybe a little, a little bit of a handful. That's all. Some of them, not all children. Hashtag not all children. Uh, ew, children, genius. That's not, that's not how we, that's not how we treat children. We need to teach them. We have to teach them how to vibe, I guess. <laughs> Leela, you're doing good. You had a chill but productive day and just got an email confirming a job interview. Hey, I hope you get the job if it's something that you want. I hope that the interview does fantastic. The Minecraft audience is bad, you say? That is not what I said. That is not at all what I said. Uh, be careful about Pokemon too. I've been playing Pokemon and I've only met cool people so far. Can you add me? I want to be part of your server. What's your friend code? Shut up, dying. <laughs> you got Cookie Run last week. It took you two minutes to get addicted. I didn't get immediately addicted to Cookie Run. I had a friend that introduced me to it. And I, I like, I tried it a little bit and I was like, eh, not, not really, not really for me, I don't think, but I'll play it a little bit more. And now, um, yeah, I uh, <laughs> I play it like multiple hours a day. It is so much fun. And Alchemic asked what my, oh, the you asked what my rank was on the frozen thing. I'm not very good at the frozen thing. I, I focus too much on a single team. So I have to like, I have to fish a lot further to find like the, the frost thing. Also, I didn't start it early. I, I've been playing arena mostly. That's that's the one that I'm focused on. And I am currently like as as, as the highest rank that I've ever been. So I'm I'm just crawling, I'm crawling up. I wanna I wanna make it into the masters if I can by the end. That that's why I'm playing Cookie Run, because I literally wanna be the best. I want to I wanna make it into the top, like into the top tiers of that game because it is so much fun. Oh, oh, spend my days with children. Uh, you spend your days with children. You don't want to interact with them outside of that. <laughs> At least children on the internet can hide. I do like, I do like that children on the internet can just like not mention it and be super cool. And then you're like, what? Your child? Well, you're super cool. Does it, does it really matter? Uh, like as far as interaction on the internet, age doesn't really matter. Just so long as you're like a decent person. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm not sure if I'll get the job, but excited to be selected. Ooh, Leela, it means something. It means that you're, yep. Listen, being eligible for a job interview means that you've got the stuff. You've got the stuff. They're interested. What is it? What does the exclamation point beans mean? I don't know what that means. Oi, Anne's here. Oh, oh. Somebody, somebody was saying in the feedback and, uh, what, feedback and raids that we should have a new version of, oh, I don't even have the cringe cat on Twitch. That's probably for the better. Mm, and I know you saw it. I sent it to you. I sent it to you and you responded to it. Uh, you're diamond three in arena currently. Yes, I am. That's as, that's as high as I made it last season. So we'll see. I don't know. Cookie Run's pretty fun. If y'all, if anybody plays uh, Cookie Run, y'all are totally, y'all are totally welcome to ask me what, well, maybe I'll post it in gaming, but y'all can totally be my friends. I'll send you, I'll send you gifts every day. And if you don't log in for five days, 
I'll delete you because the, because the uh, the friends list is very very small. Um, but yeah, if you want to add me over there, I I've def <laughs> I don't want to make a cookie run like a uh, Discord channel, but I might post some stuff over there if you've got questions. Yeah, lol. Sometimes you can tell, but it's cool when they're super mature and it doesn't matter. Yeah, exactly. And we're, and we're just hanging out anyway. And yeah, I mean, I guess if you interacted with a kid, you'd probably like in real life. If you've met up with like a group of friends that had like a, a common interest and you saw that there was a kid there, you might would interact with them differently. Like maybe you'd treat them like a kid and on the internet, it's easy to treat everybody the same. So they can just like, they can just integrate themselves into the community and they can just fit in. Yeah, let me download it, JK, JK. Don't do it, Kim, stay away, it's dangerous. Is the cringe squirrel gonna make you upsetty spaghetti though? No, I don't think so. I am I am far more mature than I was like four months ago. <laughs> Whenever I did have a cringe emote that people would post in the chat sometimes and it and it actually made me feel bad. Like, because <laughs> people would be like, you're cringe, bro. But I think I, I'm pretty sure that I'm better at like, <laughs> I'm more toxic than I was back then, so I'm totally fine now. Uh, you're not interested in Cookie Run yet, so good. Stay away from it. Don't touch it. Uh, I'll be lurking. I hope everybody has a great stream. I really miss these vibes. Leela, much love. Enjoy your lurk. This is going to be like a kind of lurky stream. It'll be, um, yeah. In fact, I say that we hop right into the game. It, it was really difficult for me to actually get this to work. So hopefully we don't have any problems. My mouse is weird. I hate it. It's very uncomfortable. I hope that we have a sudsy stream. Hey, one topic. Much love. One topic. I do. I do want to play games with you sometime soon. I've been a little bit evasive. I, I've been planning a trip to Florida. So it's been, it's been, my schedule has been a little bit janky and I've been trying to like reintegrate streaming into my life. So I, I, I have been a little bit aloof. I haven't been hanging out with people too much, so I I want to get back to it though. Maybe maybe before my trip, I can I can play a game with y'all. I would love to. I hope all of your coasters have a complete circuit. Don't end in the water. Okay, I will say right now we are not making a park where people die. We are not drowning people. We are not digging pits to put people into and force them to spend money on stalls. We are not building coasters that are going to kill anybody. No, we are not. Oh my God, Earl is gonna kill everybody. No, that is not what this, this is not the, the park vibe. We are not doing that. Not a death park. We are, <laughs> this is this is called Open Roller Coaster Tycoon 2, which is almost exactly the same, but it has some tweaks and I don't know what the tweaks are. So we're gonna have to figure that out together. I know it's better. That's that's the main thing. Also, who does human one? It's good to see you. How are you doing? One topic and human one. <laughs> Animal Crossing Alley, how are you doing? Monster, hi. What did you just say? What's the point then? If you're not murdering people, why live? Uh, <laughs> every stream is a lurky stream for some people. That's me, that's me. I, I am 100% lurk 100% of the time. <laughs> Another stream I know is 18 plus and there's 15 to 16 year old that's really chill. So whenever he accidentally posts his age, we make jokes about how he's lying about his age and it's actually 84. <laughs> I, I do like that. That's like playing Sims 4 and not having them play puffer fish roulette. What the heck is that? I I am not uh, I'm not hip to the Sims to the Sims content at all. Let me see if I can tune these sound effects. Can y'all hear them? I don't want it to be too loud. And I turned off ride music so that we can just listen to whatever we want. I'm thinking that maybe we will, for starters, actually do like a, 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 an actual scenario. I, I've never done the Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 scenarios, so these are all new to me. I've done a lot of Roller Coaster Tycoon 1 uh, scenarios, but these are all fresh, fresh. Hey, OT, can we not go to Kenny's theme park? What? And you don't, you're not accepting my, you're not accepting my, my invitation to my park. I am more toxic than I am back then. So I'm totally fine. Well, you have to, you have to be a little bit toxic. The world, the world is too toxic to be 100% pure. 
the, the world is too corrosive. You can't, you can't let it get to them. You can't let the suckers get you down, or whatever, whatever the saying is. You can't. Don't let them get you down. You gotta, you gotta have fun with it. You gotta learn to laugh at yourself for sure. Uh, maybe we all attend Earl's Park on roller co on, <laughs> on a roller coaster, and then we're all scared when it hits the drop, and then it's his artwork. My what? Oh, then it's artwork. Then it's Anne's artwork. Some cursed, like that horrible fish human that I hate so much, but I love it too. Uh, maybe that's why I became my cursed click mess because because of that. Yes, you're stronger than you ever were before, Kim. No, it's an actual emote. Oh no. I didn't know that Dipton Poison actually posted that. That's horrible. <laughs> the world is too toxic to be 100% pure. That <laughs> That's a very confusing quote. I love it. I love it. Okay. So the first scenario in this park is called Crazy Castle. Again, I've never played these. It says, you have inherited a large castle. Period. Uh, all right. So far, my life is looking pretty good. I might make it into the 1% yet. I've got a little bonus. Uh, your job is to convert it into a, a small theme park. They misspelled that. It's supposed to be S-M-O-L. A small theme park. You have, at you have to have at least 1,500 guests. Goodness. Uh, by year four with a park rating of at least 600. We may only do just one scenario. We shall see. You have inherited a small castle. It says that we need 1,500 guests in the park. So how, how much room do we have in here? Hmm. Uh, not much. Not much. This is this is a small castle. <laughs> I don't know how you're supposed to turn this into a theme park. I don't want to destroy any of the pretty castle over here. I do like it. I think it's pretty cool. So there's a path that runs around like the... I'm trying to remember what they're called. They're, these are turrets, I think. But they're just running along the wall, so... I guess we're gonna try to not touch those. How is how are we supposed to build a park in this tiny area? I mean, I guess we can get started with a flat ride to begin. What have we got? What can what can we learn? We've got a monorail, worthless. We're not gonna create uh transportation rides. Those are worthless. We got a bajillion gentle rides. We've got roller coasters. We've got, okay, so the roller coasters are probably gonna like go out of the castle and they'll probably like go through some of the turrets and stuff like that. Yeah, those are those are definitely gonna be swooping outside of the uh, the castle walls. Go on a little roller coaster ride outside the castle walls. See what it's like on the outside, but you can never leave. Uh, we got a, three little thrill rides, water rides. I'm definitely not gonna create, well, actually I could create boats over here. But boats don't make any money, so I, I don't know if we're going to do that. We got, like, all of the shops and stalls. Okay. Well, I haven't played this game in forever, so I'm not, I'm not sure exactly where we're going to start. Maybe we will make a little, a little merry-go-round. Hang on. First, let me look at, we got, we've got almost $10,000. $10,000 and a castle? Dang. So, let me first actually delete some these paths because oh wait how do i delete how do i delete paths <laughs> maybe i need to open the path tool to get rid of these oh wait oh uh maybe this yeah i think clear scenery that's not it how do i destroy paths <laughs> great we've already we've already hit our first our first problem <laughs> well i know that i can delete them this way this kind of slow <laughs> this is awful I don't want to do this. Uh, 10K for some roller coasters? Sign me up. Indeed. Let me, let, uh, give me $10,000 and I'll build you a little park. Come on. That's, that's for anybody in the chat. If you've got a spare $10,000, I'll be the manager of your new park. I'm here for you. Okay. You delete the, can I really not delete paths? This is land. Can I delete paths with this? Ooh, okay. But I can't, I mean, I can delete paths with, this a little bit but it doesn't cover like multiple whatever okay so we need yeah i removed a double path that was in there i need to remove this because people are going to get stuck in here from what from what i understand of the game people get stuck in in little like holes in the scenery like this like they'll just walk around in circles and be like where am i what's happening 
How do I how do I delete things quickly? I can give you ten thousand dollars in Animal Crossing. That's that's chump change. That's not that's not much money. That's that's hardly any. Maybe. Ooh, I'm pressing shift and it's doing different things. Ooh. Control does nothing. Alt does nothing. Okay, great. Well, I. I don't I guess we're just gonna... So, I think that we can delete multiple paths like this. No, we can't! This game! <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna... <laughs> as quickly as possible, delete everything here. We don't need any of this. We're on the struggle bus. Any roller coaster tycoon fans out there that can help me out? I don't know how to delete stuff quickly. Uh, I can give... <laughs> Sorry, I spent my last $10,000 on cheese rings and peanut butter. What? Peanut butter? How many jars of peanut butter can you get for $10,000? Now that's what I want to know. I'll be doing some aggressive Googling later, you guys. Just ignore the, uh, just ignore the click clack of my keyboard as I, as I Google how much peanut butter I can buy with my 10,000 stimmy check. There we go. We're just going to delete this. Nobody's allowed in here. This is this, this is a secret spot that I'm going to, I'm going to let my staff live back here. I'm going to make them a little, some little hovels to live in. I do remember that, like, some of the, uh, get over here, some of the parks that I went to as a, not parks, I can't remember the name, camps, some of the summer camps that I went to as a kid, they would have, like, the staff launching was so awful. Should I delete this? Are they allowed in the castle? That's what I'm wondering. Like, it's fun to let them in there, but I kind of feel like they're going to get stuck up on that wall. I kind of want to delete these paths so that they can't get up there. Sorry, kids. You may have gone to Castle Park, but I don't want y'all up there. Okay? Maybe, maybe we can figure out how to how to block them out later. It might not be 100% necessary. Okay. So we got a pretty, pretty clear land. Uh, I got some trees that I'll probably get rid of in a minute. It's too dangerous. Don't go in the castle. Some of the some of the walls are kind of falling down. I don't want I don't want y'all anybody to get injured. Okay? And it's because I totally care about y'all. It's it's not because I I don't want to get sued. All right? I don't want to get, uh, I mean, I don't want to get sued, but. Okay, so maybe if I. <laughs> I'm going to put the exit over here and then I'll open this up. This is just a little merry-go-round. We'll make some, we'll make some moolah. I'll have to see how the, ooh, this new version has made the path so much easier to place. That's kind of a short, a short line. Uh Oh, I forgot to check if the entrance has a fee let me see are they paying no 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 they're not paying to get in so that means that we're going to be charging for rides and i'm gonna try to push the money a little bit you guys i want to make some i want to make some mad cash so i'm at least gonna double like what the default is and uh people people that go to your park will complain if it's too expensive so i'm just gonna uh, let's see. Maybe, maybe I can make a thrill ride next. I think that thrill rides get people like, uh, get more people to come into your park. I'm not sure. Okay. I haven't played this in years. Uh, <laughs> there we go. I'm just going to make a little, uh, exit. Here we go. You miss playing this now? You should play it. It's like $2. It's a $2 game. Uh, the way that I'm playing it right now is that I got it from, uh, GOG. Oops. Uh-oh. I, I got it from GOG for like $2. And then uh, I'm using like a slight modification that fixes some stuff called OpenRTC. I'm using it because I saw, uh, I've, I've been watching a YouTuber that uses it. Should we keep these dirt paths? They kind of ugly. They kind of ugly. Do you like, do you like these paths better or should we do something else? We've got, what is it? Charcoal. We've got, <laughs> we've got charcoal. We've got this crappy dirt. We have like wood. We have cobblestone. Hmm. Uh, oh, no, I wanted to build some cobblestone to see what that looks like. What do you guys think? I think that the cobblestone is the coolest. What 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 do y'all want the park to have? Have you been a victim of Earl LTD? Call us now at 0800 help me for compensation. You may you may be eligible for compensation if you have been injured at an Earl LTD park. Cobblestone Mojang wants to know your location. Bing bong! Oh no! Not you, Mojang. Not you again.
To be honest, I will get it again now. Do it. It's literally $2. Jet Shepherd, how are you doing? What's up? Oi, oi. Claria, you've come to calm down from a different streamer playing the new FNAF game. You got spooked? I know that OT played it, right? If OT is still here, I'd be curious what he thinks of the new FNAF game. I know that uh, Human One also played it. It looks spooky as heck. I don't know. It's it's tempting for me to try it. I've played number one, two, three. No, wait, I didn't play three. I played one and two. And I enjoyed them, but they were a little, um, I guess, predictable. Oops. Oh, no. They're a little predictable. They're a little basic. Uh, and the new one looks a little bit more interesting. I don't generally like spooky games, but sometimes I indulge if I'm in the right mood. That MIDI music? The Emma <laughs> what MIDI music? Where? Uh, <laughs> you got a Wii Hostess cherry fruit pie? <gasps> oh, the, is it like in a little wrapping? Wait a second. Uh, is that, that's the one that's like a half circle, right? I love those so much. Oh, this is closed. I'm stupid. Oops. Excuse me. Dum dum. Dum dum here. Uh, okay. Is this too expensive? Or pe why? Why aren't people going on my rides, huh? What are you people thinking? They're just walking. They're just walking around. They're thinking. Uh, they're in. Some of them are in queue. Some of them are walking. What's the thought thing? I want to go home. This park is really clean. I'm not paying that much for the merry-go-round. What? Is it too much? But you guys, I. Okay, that fine one dollar. <laughs> I'm very easy to manipulate. Clearly, they're like, I don't, I don't want to pay for that, and I'm like, oh, so sorry. <laughs> Let's see, magic carpet, a large flying. Also, oh, I saw Darren was here. Yes, the mad nostalgia. I love this game so much. I love it so much. I worry about your pocket in these. Oh, what did I do? What did I do, OT? I don't remember doing anything wrong. We've got some new research opportunities. Okay, I didn't know how this ride works. I am going to... Can I rotate this? How do I rotate it? I want to move it. Okay, I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i just destroy it. Because I, di I didn't know that it could only be like on the front or the back. So maybe I'll put it back here. With the... I'll put the entrance over here and the exit over here. A little cobblestone path. And then maybe this will like... Oh, magic carpet's in the way. Okay, there we go. All right. And we can make these uh, footpaths different colors in a little bit. In fact, I think I'm going to do it by like little squares or something. You find that spooky games are too spooky for you. Well, um, there is... There is... Uh... I mean, you don't have to play them. You don't have to watch them. Uh, let me see. <laughs> I'm usually fine, but not today. Today is not the day of spookiness. Okay, we're gonna open up this ride. You guys hop hop on board. I haven't tested this ride yet, but you could you can be the first one to test it right now. The entrance and exits make me go mad. Sometimes figuring out where to put everything. Yeah, whenever the park gets too big, it gets it gets really complicated. Okay, we've got two exciting rides, one gentle ride. I kind of want to build a coaster because we still have $8,000. So what kind of coasters do we have? There's wooden roller coasters, wooden mouse, steel wild, spinning mouse. Oh, oh yeah, we should check what we're researching first. What is in research and development? I'm going to turn off no no scenery, no no shops because we already got a bunch of them. Oh, it's raining. Hang on. Oh, 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 oh. If it's raining... I want to put down a information kiosk because these allow people to buy umbrellas. You can't construct things while the game is paused? Okay, well, this is a trick that I saw on the internet. <laughs> you can charge people for their balloon, for their umbrellas, and I'm going to set the umbrella cost to $20 <laughs> because apparently they will pay that for umbrellas because they're worth it. And they will always, they will always buy umbrellas whenever it rains or like lots of them will. See, look, that sucker just bought a $20 umbrella. You fool. Oh yeah. If we're going to do this, do y'all want to pick out a color for the umbrellas? What, what color would you like to see? There's a small palette. There's a uh, light purple. There's bright green, bright red. There's yellows, pinks. What do you guys think? 
crap. That's what I forgot at work. My umbrella. It's yellow, pink, purple. <laughs> because I'm worth it. I don't want a wet head. That's why. Are there haunted houses or something? Yes. We will build a haunted house. We'll build a haunted house next. How about that? Uh, I see two people. Purple, pink, blue. Okay. You guys are all over the place. I, I want to make a... I saw on stream elements that there was something that allows you to like let people put hashtags in the chat to do really quick votes. I see what two people said purple and I love purple. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna set it to, what, did, what was this called? Just light purple, bright purple. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll make them bright perps, bright perps. You might consider going to my park have, okay, so that's a good question. Has anybody ever gone to a haunted house? Or or really, who has gone to a haunted house? I've never, I have never been to one before. I don't know what they're like. Do you, do you like haunted houses? I'm very curious about them. I was like told to avoid them whenever I was younger because my mom was like, they're evil. And I'm like, evil, <laughs> interesting. I was definitely the kid that like, if we got the Halloween magazine, I was like, oh, skeletons. <laughs> I like these. Oh, I feel like this is so inefficient. Okay, this this does not this does not give good vibes. I'm gonna redo this, okay? I'm demolishing the building. I would rather demolish buildings than make my park look gross and inefficient. I'm gonna make it nice and hang on. Where's the slide? Where's the slide? Did I just use the... Oh, there it is. <laughs> <Am I stupid? laughs> okay, I'm actually gonna make it over... I'm gonna let us see the entrance and them slide for fun. Even though it, it's totally unnecessary. Okay, and how do I rotate the view? Is there a hotkey for this? R? No, R is not that. E? Q? EQ? Uh, whatever. Uh... Okay, let's make these entrance exits. How short of a line can I make for this thing? Is that gonna is that gonna be good enough? Okay, you, you go away. I, I want the entrance to point towards the path, please. There we go. Okay, now we make the exit real quick. There we go. So that's that's pretty efficient. Let's turn it on. Let's let those suckers start sliding. You kiddos, start sliding now. I want to see. I want to see you going down there. I want to see you pay one dollar to go down a slide. What a deal! <laughs> what a deal! I like to keep it rotated this way. Uh, you've performed in a haunted house. I am the evil that your mother warned you about. <gasps> oh my, Divey! I'm scared. What? Oh, hello, Earl World. <laughs> PLS there, five left. All right. Oh, see, thank you for the 100 bits. I'm gonna, I'm that, I'm naming it that right now. Earl World. There we go. Everybody's invited. Everybody's invited. The entrance is free, so you can you can tour the castle for the low low price of nothing. Earl World. Yahoo! All right. But yeah. Okay. So yes, there are people that have been to haunted houses. I haven't been to one since I was a kid. That is, that doesn't seem like the time to go to a haunted house when you're a kid. Uh, you like, like an actual haunted house or one that people say is haunted. Oh, I mean like the entertainment. Have you, Alchemic, have you ever been to like the entertainment uh, attraction? The like, the, the obviously not haunted house. <laughs> the lies. Have you given in to the lies? Okay, I want to delete some of these paths because I want to build a roller coaster, you guys. And yes, I'm gonna let these people uh, walk around. I I don't care. They'll figure out their they'll figure out how to get back to the. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna delete this path here, and we're gonna build a coaster here that goes outside of the walls. We've still got seven thousand dollars. I think that we can build a coaster with that, but maybe we should build. A somewhat cheap one. I'm trying to remember which ones are super expensive. You've been to Hollywood Horror Night and not Scary Farm. Ah, oh, not scary, actually. I think that a wooden roller coaster would maybe fit in best with, um, what is this? Simulate the rider attraction. So I'm going to put it two back. Okay. 
This might take this might take a little figuring out because I, I haven't built a coaster in quite a while. So I think what I'm gonna do. I wanna check how many cars can go on this thing. So that's two cars. Maybe we'll make it a two-car coaster. And we'll make it maybe turn around really quick and go straight up. Let's see if we can let's see if we can get up without without hitting this building. Again, it's been a while since I built this. It's been a while since I built anything. Oh no, I broke the ceiling. I broke it! The castle's been destroyed! The Earl destroyed the castle. The Knott's Berry Farm does it every year, and it's and it's very fun. I went to um let's see, what is it called? It's the scary version of Six Flags. I think that it's uh oh, I can't remember what it's called. The it's called something fear or terror but yeah i went there one time but i a fright fest that's what it's called but i never went into any of the this is so ugly i don't think that i can do this you guys i don't think that this is acceptable because the supports look so weird 666 flags <laughs> 666 flags over texas let's see if we can get over this path not quite not quite okay I'm going to move this. I'm going to move it back one. I messed up. Let's start maybe back here. How many cars can I fit on this thing? Okay, that's still two. Let's see what we can do to get three on here. I don't know. That that looks pretty good. Let's see if we can get above the path now. What? <laughs> what? I'm going to destroy this path, I swear. I swear this path's getting destroyed. Okay. One more, one more try. This time, we've got it. It starts back here. Okay. Now, I just gotta fit all of the... Okay, that, that should work. Otherwise, I'm gonna become extremely upset and I'm gonna start, I'm gonna start yelling at this. Oh my god. I'm upset. I'm angry. I'm angry. He's getting mad. Everybody look out. The toxicity. <laughs> no! Why can't I get over this path? I want to go over the path. Let me up. Whee! Okay, there we go. Now we're rolling. Now we're cooking with gas. Is this the scary version of Six Flags? Six souls? Six souls over Texas. Okay, now now we're starting to warm up. So I'm gonna, what, go straight? No, let's, let's start going down. Let's get some speed on this thing. We need some excitement. We're going to go down and maybe... Can we do banked turns on this? Because if you don't bank your turns, then it starts getting a little... It starts getting a little rough for the people. Maybe wooden roller coasters don't do banks. Maybe I should have started with something else. Well, whatever. We'll make a curve there. Ooh. I kind of want to loop all the way around just for fun. I wonder if we have enough height for that right now. Okay, maybe, maybe we shouldn't. These curves are so big. Now we'll go forward. Or we'll... Oh, there's a super heavy slope. I want to do that. So you have to you have to start with like a gentle slope down. And then you can turn it super sharp. Perfect. Now we're going to become less sharp. Going to do a wide turn out of that. And now we can start going up again, I believe. We should have the speed for it. I'm just watching the speed whenever the coaster goes down. Yeah. All right. All right. Now we're schmoovin'. It goes wee. <laughs> okay. I have this little, like, fake coaster that's going on it to, like, test it out. Hey, Haggy's Creations. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome. It's good to see you. Okay. I want to see. I want to make it go through this building here. Kind of hard to tell where this grid goes, but I'd like it to go through here. Let's see. Where does this lead? Okay, it's almost correct. Maybe we can maybe we can move it one more. One more like forward brick. And now it should like go straight through there. Yeah. And I'll give it I'll give it some little some little bumps. Give it some some little bumps for fun. The bumps make the ride last longer and I think people people like it more. Let's let's watch this thing go. Let's watch it go. Whee! 
we don't gain too much speed, so I'll probably have to do... Maybe I'll have to do another chain lift. This is going to be a very inefficient roller coaster. But it's the first one that we're building, so... Okay. So let's see what we're going to do with this building. I don't know if it's going to interact with the paths. <laughs> I don't want it to break anything. Okay. Uh, oh, it's already out. Splendid. So now we can maybe go back down. I'm trying to think about how I want to build this. We can build this one kind of basic because I don't actually have that much money right now. Let's see. Maybe we'll do like another big drop out of this. Can we, can we, can we ever financially recover from this? Yeah, and maybe it'll just go around the castle. It'll give you like a little, a little peek through the windows and you can see the people walking through. It'll kind of mess up this exit, but whatever. Let's see. How much speed do we get out of this? Zoom. I think we get a fair amount. Oh, this ain't quite right. Looks like we're going to run into the building. Maybe we'll make a turn out of it then. How quickly can we turn? Can we go back flap? <laughs> That's a little ugly. Can I do a... Ooh, S-Bend. S-Bend will just push it right out to the side. I hope that that's not too fast. Poor little people. They're going to be freaking out. They're going to be freaking out, but they'll love it. It's a great ride. Okay, we're going to break some stuff. We're breaking it. This is the most ratchet coaster I've ever made. I'm so happy. If people buy enough umbrellas, you will recover. We just have to get them to buy $20 umbrellas. That's how we do it. My day's better now. Aw, Kareem. Your day's better now that we're building some some wholesome coasters. Oh, there are rolls in banking. <gasps> oh, that is spooky. Can we go like straight on a bank for a while? What? How does that work? What is that connection there? What is that? Okay, so rolls in banking are definitely for turns only. I don't think that there's enough G's there for me to get in trouble. Okay, we get, we get a lot of speed out of this. Yeah, we get a lot of speed. So maybe I can afford a bank, but I think that I've got to make it flat if I want to if I want to keep up my speed. It's the Cliffs of Insanity! <laughs> Not the Cliffs of Insanity. I want to just see what this looks like. A, a weird curve. Oh, I have, to, I have to start rolling it the other way. <laughs> That's such a... Uh, I don't know. That's kind of boring, but... This is such an ugly coaster. That's such ugly. We can change the colors later, though. And then maybe we will... Can we afford to loop it all the way back? Maybe. Let's see. Let's see what we can afford. I'm going to let it, like, loop down to the water... Yeah, let's, let's get it right on the water's edge. Ooh, this is cool. Oh, I could maybe go under the... Ooh, if I get it the right height, I could go under the path over here. I think we're a tiny bit low. Let me see what the view options are on this thing. Is it here? Let's see. Hide base land. See through rides. Height markers on land. This is 30 foot up, so we have to make it go back up to 30 feet. Okay. Easy peasy. 30, 30 feet. I think that we can we can make it up there again. I think that we just have to go flat a little while longer. Then we make it to 30 feet. A wide turn. We need maybe one more. And if we're going to go this far, we should make it immediately go back up to build some excitement. Oh boy, we got a, we got a little lump here. And this should make it. So I'll bank it. Can we recover from this bank? Let's see. Is there enough speed to make it back to the station? I'm going to watch it one more time. Definitely worth my money for this ride. Oh, yeah. This this ride is this ride is everything. This will be our money maker. This is what people come to the park for. We should make it a strict rule for people to bring their wallets on the coaster so that they fall out and you steal their money. <gasps> Questionable building practices. Oh, yeah. We got plenty of speed. We got a concerning amount of speed. Pe people might be scared of this ride. I think we're supposed to go up to 30 feet. 
How dangerous is this ride? Dangerous? We don't use that word in this park. We don't use that word here. <laughs> there is no true danger. Do we need to go forward but one more time? Maybe, I mean, it's going to be kind of a boring end of the ride. Let's see how much speed we have left. Maybe we can go, maybe we can use the momentum for one more. Oh, maybe. Maybe I will try to maximize that speed. You need a loop. It's not worth it, if, worth it if it doesn't have a loop. Ooh, I wonder if we could fit a loop in here. That'll be a little tricky. I don't know if we build enough speed up for a loop right now. Loops are also expensive. I'm gonna run out of money. We'll build a loop on the next coaster. That's my that's my Earl promise. My Earl promise is that we will do we will do a loop. We will do a loop in the on the next coaster. Whenever we have some more money. All right, it's all right. We still got some more. We got still some more. We can just go over this and then go back down for a little for a little speedy exit. And maybe we can build some more. What are they called? Station platforms. Now let's see if we can get another bonus car in here. This only has two cars. I wonder, if, I wonder what I have to do to get three. This is kind of cool coaster. I like it. Let's all go to Early World. What? Early World? That's not the name of it. This lump is so silly. Is an Earl P promise like a pinky promise? If you don't do it... <laughs> If you don't do it, I get to break the Earl? What 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 do you mean break? I can't be broken. Okay. Let's see how many coasters we're allowed to have on this. Continuous circuit mode. Oh yeah, we can also speed up the where is it? The lift hill chain speed. We can make it go faster. We're making it as fast as possible. Full load. Where is our options for our cars? We can do three trains but they'll have six cars each all right that seems pretty good i like this coaster you guys i like it i think that we can maybe charge six or seven bucks for this i'm gonna set it to seven to be safe seven dollars for a ride on the early whirly and i will uh let's see delete this ugly footpath we'll build our entrance and exit okay go go away footpaths Construction. We will build the entrance over here. Exit over here. And we need to make... I guess this is a loop, so people can walk around it, but I might I might have to change up how the paths work in a little bit. Okay, we got that. So now we could open it. Just going to make a quick exit here. And this line will be a little bit longer. Because people are going to flip and love this ride. Okay. I wonder if I should give it an actual test. Yeah, we're, so this is actual testing mode. And this allows me to see the stats of the ride. And hopefully it's not too extreme because I don't know how to fix it. <laughs> oh, excuse me, how fun is the ride? Oh, very fun if you put it like that. If you put it like that, this is the most fun ride you'll ever, you'll ever ride. I don't know what most of these stats are. Let's see. Well, it works. It is a working ride. And what are our stats? We want it to be exciting because that's how we make money. Test results are coming in. And they're reviewing, reviewing. People are getting lost or stuck. Okay, so the paths are probably blocking people off. Not available? Give me the info. Okay, it's high excitement, high intensity, medium nausea. Hmm, this is, this is going to be rough, you guys. Is it, this is going to be a rough ride. We'll have to see. We'll have to see what the public thinks about it. Let's open it up for the public. I want to see somebody ride it. Come on, little man. Oh wait, I see some puke on them. Who's puking in this park? Oh, I guess this magic carpet might be a little bit, might be a little sickening. Let's hire a couple of handymen. I just want to set them, yeah, so that they don't mow grass. <gasps> That's automatically d unchecked. This is a great mod. The mod makes it so that they don't mow the grass. The grass mowing mechanics are so silly in this game. They're so they're so unnecessary. Those those graphs are graphs are the chance of money of money falling. 
row of wallets falling. The higher the graphs are, the more wallets that are going to be in this river. We've just got to get... We got to hire some people to get some nets and get those wallets out of there. Okay, I see somebody on the coaster. This little, this little bean right here, Felicity H. What do you think, Felicity? You ready for a little ride? Hmm? Says, I already got a park map. I want to go on something more thrilling than Twist 1. Oh, really? More thrilling. I see that they, they've got two two times that they wanted to go on something thrilling. Now, now we'll see what you think about this, eh, Felicity? Hop on board. Hop on board the... Oh, we could name this thing. You guys got any name suggestions? Maybe we could name it like... Uh, Castle... Let's see... It's in the castle right now, so maybe we can call it, like... Hmm, Kingdom's Raid or something. Zoom! What do you think about it now? Hmm, getting a little sick? The early whirl? <laughs> it's not even that... It's not even that spinny. <laughs> the early whirl. I do like that. Maybe maybe, maybe we could actually name the, mag the magic carpet that. What do you think, Felicity? How was the ride? <gasps> they love it! They're dancing. They're dancing for joy. It said Wooden Roller Coaster 1 was great. They love it. Okay, we're going to name this one the Early Whirl. <laughs> early Whirl. The Early Whirl around. That's probably what's making everybody sick is the Early Whirl. There we go. Now they're spinning. Coasters built. We've only got $600, but we could probably we could probably build another... Um, Oh, I wonder if we need to start fixing all these paths. Yikers. The early world is broken down already? But we just made it. Time to, time to hire a couple of mechanics. Come on, boys. Fix it up now. You go go in there and fix that ride. People, people want to have some fun now. Tisk, tisk. Broken down already. What failed? I think, it, I think it tells you what failed. A safety cutout. Well... I guess safety is important at Earl, at Earl Park. At what? What do we call it? At Earl World. I mean, I suppose safety is our number one concern. Okay, somebody fixing this up. People, people want their rides. Oh, there's a puker. We got a puker. Speaking of pukers, we should probably put down some bins. We should put down some benches and bins for people. Because I don't want them throwing their trash everywhere. We could also build, with some of our money, some stalls. Are these people just standing there watching the ride? I didn't know that they could stay still. I thought that they were in perpetual motion. They were putting trash bins everywhere, and we'll make some food stalls so that they can get some noms. Give them some places to sit down in case they get a little bit tired. You little fellas looking for a place to sit? Here you go. Sit down. Take a load off. Take a seat. Take a seat. Take a load off your feet. There we go. I'm probably accidentally removing some of my trash cans, but that's okay. All right. Let's let's let them eat some food. Let's give them some food. I want to get them off this wall. They're just wasting time on the wall, and they're not giving me money. How am I supposed to deal with this, though? I should have deleted them earlier. Should have deleted them earlier because now we got people up in this castle. Look, they're walking around in the... Dang it. How do I get them out of here? I think it's too late. I think it's too late to stop them from entering here because they're going to get stuck. They're going to just be like, how do I get out of here? And I have deleted the only path out. Oh, oh, I know one way. I know one way to help. I forgot about this. But there are uh, signs that you can put down that don't allow them to enter areas. Perfect. Yes, I w can't be positioned here. Can only be built across paths. This is a path. This is this is literally a path. What are you talking about? Okay, there we go. We'll put a sign there. We'll put a sign here. Put a sign. Uh, I want to build it. Here. Can I not build this? Ah, oh, I don't want to put it there. That's a waste. That's a waste. Let's rotate this around. One right there. Put one right there. These will stop people from walking up there. And they'll slowly filter out, and then they won't be allowed back in. I'll build this back so that they can exit. I've got to set all of these banners as do not enter. This one. 
Oh, not you, Tucker. I don't care what you're doing. Right-click to modify. Okay, I'm gonna set this to do not enter. Do not enter. Don't go in there. It's too dangerous. The castle is still under construction. Who knows what will happen? Okay, you gotta rotate. To... Where's where's that other one? Okay, we got those and one more shine right here. I want to build it right here, but I think that they make you do it in spots like this. No, 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 no. We can't have it pointing this way. <laughs> then they can't go back. That's not what we need. Delete that. Delete that right now. Delete that sign. How do I remove it? Help! Okay, maybe if I click it and trash it. Click it or tick it, kiddos. Okay, rotate them like this. There we go. This is very convoluted, but at least it'll help people not get stuck. I don't want them walking around on the castle. I know it's very impressive, but it's for your eyes only, not for your feet. Don't walk on the ancient stones. Do you know how many people died for these stones right here? Okay, I'm gonna turn this into a do not, do not disturb, do not enter. This is the forbidden, the forbidden castle. It's more spooky like that. Okay, oh down here. Alright. A bunch of no entry signs. This is like just fixing this kind of stinky scenario. They threw us into a castle and they and they just want us to swim. There we go. No entrance, you dum-dums. There's nothing up there for you. I trust me, there's no treasure. Can you ticket the entrance to the walkways? No, 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 no. I don't I don't even think that that's possible. <laughs> Though that is a very funny idea. Okay, we've got a double path leading up the, to the castle, which is kind of inefficient, but I'm gonna leave it. Okay, now they should not enter this path. I think that we've blocked off all the entrances. The doors are shut. <laughs> the doors are shut, nobody's allowed out. Here we go. Safety first, I guess. Mmm, food. Hey, Kuya Cat, a classic indeed. I love this game. How are you doing, Kuya Cat? I hope you're having a wonderful day. We need to give these people some food. They're hungry. Hungry, hungry. Let's make uh, a couple of bathrooms, I guess. I like to keep the bathrooms free because I'm a wholesome boy. I'm a wholesome boy. You can pee for free. At Earl World, you can pee for free, but the but the but the uh, the umbrellas are twenty dollars. So you know, it's a little it's a little give and take. You don't need an umbrella, but you need to pee. Okay, I'm gonna put them over here. I'm gonna see some puke there. Who's gonna clean up all this, all this disgusting uh, refuse? Okay, we need some food. People are hungry. Hot dog stall. There you go. There you go. Weenie, Weenie Central is open. Gonna leave the prices there. You thought it was Wednesday? That sums up my day. Oh no. Wednesday lies. Lies about Wednesday. <gasps> hey, a human person. How are you doing? We're building a little. We're building a little coaster park. I know that I said that I was gonna play. Uh, I know that I said that I was gonna play Pokemon, but we'll we'll probably play that on Thursday. Tomorrow I'm taking off to get some stuff done, and then on Thursday we'll be back. Nothing like a glizzy during a thunderstorm. Oh, you know what? All this rain has got me thinking. I could use a hot dog. Are people not going on here because it's raining? It says, I'm not going on roller coaster while it's raining. Oh no, our money maker. Our big money, big money. We already have $1,000 again. Nice. We have $1,700. So we could, we could build another ride. Which ride would y'all like to see? We've got Crooked House. I think that this is a bad deal. Uh, we've got a merry-go-round. We've got, oh, I mean a Ferris wheel. We already have a merry-go-round. We have a Ferris wheel, bumper cars, a tunnel of horror, or mini golf? I doubt that mini golf makes you much money. Which one would y'all like for me to put there? Hey, Tyrannotaurus, what's up? It's good to see you. How are you doing, Emily? Nice to see you. I haven't seen you in forever. You want a game like this for building Mario Kart courses? Ooh, just export them straight into Mario Kart? That sounds exciting. You say Ferris wheel? Also, hi, Lex. How are you doing? It's good to see you, Tyrannotaurus. I gotta say, I mean, I, I do follow you on, on the Instagram and I'm loving your hairstyle. 
I'm loving the weave. I guess it's not a weave, but it's pretty sweet. It looks great. It's good to see you, Tyrannosaurus. I've missed you. Local Texan. How are you doing? Or <laughs> local Exxon? Man, these Age of Empires mods are getting out of hand. I don't even, I can't even see any soldiers. This is a soldierless mod. This is a, this is the peace and kindness mod. Oh, we got a new ride, a top spin. What is this? Mini golf, mini golf is always popular. Mini golf is cool. Let's see how big it is. One design available. How big is garden golf? It's a little big, but if we wanted to make, oh, it is kind of cool. It is kind of cool. I, I do think it looks pretty neat. Ooh, we could fit it in right here, I think. Ooh, I kind of like it. It, I don't think that it's good for money, but I think we're gonna beat this scenario anyway. It is, it is an easy scenario. You just make your own mini golf designs. I have never built one before. Uh, how difficult are they to make? Lex, you're the, you're the pro here. Apparently, you're, you're the one that should be streaming this. You could make your own, couldn't you? I probably could. Let's let's see what the builder looks like on that thing. I've, I've never... I've, I don't think that I've ever played uh, on a map that lets you have one. There's station platforms. Golf hole A, B, C. So there's just golf holes and walking? Huh. It's a whole new world. A whole new world! So you build a, a line that they stand in? What is what does the main thing look like? I, I I don't think I've even seen one, so I'm not exactly sure how they function. It looks like there's paths between them. They're pretty easy once you got the hang of it. Maybe maybe on this scenario we'll build we'll build garden golf, and I'll I'll like look over it, and maybe I can maybe I can practice building some golf courses later. This is I think that mostly this has like a lot of um. A lot of, like, beautification that's unnecessary. Green! Oh, you're gonna dye your hair green? That's sweet. You might add some blue to the tips. That's spicy! I'm considering doing a hair dyeing of my own. I think that I might dye my hair white. Because it would be really cool to have white hair, and then as it grows out, then the tips will be white. Because I want to I wanna grow out my hair to be, like, very long and metal. So I think that I could have white tips for free. And then I could just, uh, then I could dye it again if I wanted it to be all white. Golf Tycoon, nice. Also, local, local Exxon. <laughs> Do you want me to call you local Texan? No, but wait, it is, it's Loctol Exxon. It really looks like local Texan, but I'm not sure what it is. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Okay, I'm just gonna, can't do it. We don't have the money for it. I'm poor. I'm poor and I didn't even realize it, you guys. We can't afford mini golf. Let's let's do the other suggestion to make a Ferris wheel. I'm gonna put it right. How dare you be poor? Indeed. <laughs> Sound like the US government. Stop that. Uh let's I'm I wanna build them kind of in a block layout a little bit. I want it to be as efficient as possible. People can walk on these exit paths wherever they want but they cannot walk on queue lines unless they are queued. This is going to be a very unnecessarily long line for a Ferris wheel because nobody cares about Ferris wheels. So maybe I should actually build it like that. Because Ferris wheels are not like a crazy attraction. I don't think that people really love it. I should double check just in case I, I am using mods, so it should be fine. But I'm going to double check that all these rides cost money and stuff like that. Let's see. How do I... I guess I could look at profit. Information kiosk makes $6,000 an hour? What? Yo, the the umbrella trick. <laughs> Yo, shouts out, shouts out to that guy that I'm watching on YouTube that told me that you could do that. Holy crap. The early world's making money. The wooden roller coaster's making mad profit. $7,000 an hour. I think that it costs like 6,000 to make or maybe a little bit more. Uh, you think changing the colors of rides can help with popularity? Yeah, let's switch up the colors. What do you guys think about a uh, uh, merry-go-round? Merry-go-round, what color would you like to see? We'll make, uh, we'll make the primary color different. I think the other one's trim. 
Maybe we'll make the trim white. What do y'all think about the main color? Gotta rename all of your rides to I'm poor. <laughs> I'm poor. Oh, I'm poor was very exciting. Uh, I don't want to go on I'm poor while it's raining. You say purple? I mean, I love purple. I like I like your style. I like your style. Are we just make it a full purple part? I actually love the the color of this roller coaster here. I didn't even set it, but it looks pretty sweet. Hey, quick, is Tycoon better than two? It depends on what you want, uh, pasty face. So for one, uh, something that I that I agree with lots of people about is that Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 looks really bad. Like visually, it hasn't aged too well. Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 also doesn't have the management options that are available in these older games. So I personally would say that two is better. Uh, if you wanted Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, there are better 3D modern games that I would suggest. So maybe I'm just saying Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 is not great. If you want, if you want Roller Coaster Tycoon, I'd say do number two. If you want like a really good coaster sim or park builder, there's lots of other choices. So maybe something like Parkitect is great, Planet Coaster is great. Uh, I think that Planet Coaster is mostly based on building the coasters. So like building big coasters and stuff like that. And then um, Parkitect is more about like decoration and stuff like that, like building a beautiful park. So you can get different things out of different games, but I, I don't really see the appeal at all in Roller Coaster Tycoon 3, in my opinion. Thank you for the input. Oh, for sure. Also, this game is $2. If you want to buy it on GOG, this is a $2 game. So really, um, really, really affordable. Like the price of the price of a single Coke. You love this game? Hey, Tay Love. I love this game too. I used to play, I used to play the first one obsessively. Number two, I didn't play quite as much, but still, I mean, they're extremely similar. It's like two bucks on Steam too. I'm, I'm suggesting that you buy it from GOG because it's easier to modify. And also, you don't have to have Steam on to be able to download it. I'm using a mod that's called OpenRCT2, and it helps uh, It helps lots of different things. So, for example, what, I mean, there's a million modifications. You can build uh, paths easier. You can, whenever I put down my, uh, my cleanup guys earlier, my handymen, they automatically don't mow the grass, which is very nice because it's a waste of time. It's a waste of time. Who cares if the grass is a little is a little long? People don't even notice it. Okay, yeah, so we need to change the color here. I, I apologize. Uh, I saw people saying, what, purple? I think I saw somebody saying purple, maybe. <laughs> I can't go when it's raining, because then it, it's be raining and pouring. Oh my god. Tyranitars, no. Raining and pour... pour disgusting i do oh purple and white looks kind of cool we could make it really uh maybe we should just keep it as purple and white that's that's a nice pastel dream we said purple and blue okay well blue is only part of it this like lower part i don't know it doesn't it doesn't look too bad it doesn't look it doesn't look absolutely horrible what about this ferris wheel you guys what do you think i don't want it to be red anymore everything's red in this park I'm seeing red. What should we make the outer ring? Ooh, black. Uh, <laughs> wait a second. What, what's the, the main color should be? The, the spokes. What do y'all think of for a spoke color? Make everything purple Twitch themed? Oh, I think that this is more of a... I guess there is kind of not a Twitch purple. They're not, they're not rich enough. They're not saturated enough to be Twitch purple. Just assign each ride a different color in rainbow order. Ooh, Pride Park. Uh, rainbow order. It would be cool to make ra a rainbow Ferris wheel like line. There's also a cool ride that it's worth making a lot of. Yeah, okay, so the colors of the rainbow. What do they start with? Maybe, let's see, we only have $3,000 right now. Maybe a little bit later, whenever we have some more money, we can make a line of Ferris wheels that are the rainbow. But right now, I don't think we have enough money for that. So let's just make this, um, make everything purple. I'm just tired and my puns get dumber and dumber. 
You said that we're poor. So it's not purple, but poor pull. Poor pull. Oh my god. Okay, well, we can make it purple right now. It's, it's, you guys, you guys are so basic, just like me. We're all basic in this chat. High pride could be the name. What? Instead of Ferris wheel? I'm confused. High pride. Nobody's going to ride on my coaster in the rain, but at least they're buying umbrellas. How many people are still up on this wall? I see we've got a handyman up there, but are my signs working? I only see handymen stuck up there. Can I just set it so that they don't go up there? Red, orange, yellow, blue, uh, no, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. If you want the classic one, the pride leaves out the indigo. <gasps> but indigo is so beautiful. Uh, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's six of these and they cost how much to build? Should probably, they cost 450. So I definitely can't afford that right now. And we're saving up money right now and we can almost build another roller coaster. You can change what the entrance and exits look like. Uh, I don't, I don't really mind how they look right now. I think that they look okay. I don't see the option. It says the most beautiful park award. Hooray. More like in Dubai. More like in the no. Oh my gosh. That's awful. And I do like uh, indigo, indigo away. In Dubai is not even close cream. Not even a fun. Just, just awful. Just awful. Ooh, we have some swinging ships. Should we make a pirate swing or a swinging inverter ship? This one goes all the way around. The other one's a little bit more gentle. Do y'all want to see puke in the park? <laughs> and the park is fun? Or should we use a normal one? This is why I stick to emotes. A whack, Kareem. Do what you have to. Do what you must. I, I'll let the pros do the puns. Puke only. We're making a puke only park. I thought that we weren't going to torment our poor people. Man. Okay, now that everybody's out of the wall, I want to just look around. I don't think anybody's... I don't think that anybody's on the wall now, except for my stupid handyman. So I should, hypothetically, be good to break all these paths. Hypothetically speaking, it should be fine. I can, I can get my handyman out of there. Okay, remove that sign. Okay, now I should be able to break some of these paths. And then my handyman won't get stuck up there. This scenario really throws you for a loop with all these unnecessary paths. Very rude. Hey, Dana, how are you doing? We're building some coasters. We're building a wholesome coaster park. The wholesome coaster park. Okay, all of the paths have been broken, I think. Let's rotate around. This one needs to go. And now I will get my handyman out of there. And we need to make this into a loop as well so that they don't get lost. Because they will waste so much time walking to and from nothing. So I'm going to actually build the path slightly different. I want to do this like that. Okay, that wasn't exactly what I wanted, but this makes it a little bit faster. Okay, so build one there, build one here. Just gonna go around this mountain, because if we build up on this mountain, it'll be... Well, actually, ooh, that would be kind of fun. Hang on. We're gonna go through the mountain. Yeah, that, that would be pretty cool. Yeah, so first I'm gonna build a little... Let's uh, get off of this. Build that path there. After people get off of this path, I'll remove it. Move it, kids. That's not, that's not somewhere to go. Now I need to build this ground up a little bit so that we can make a tunnel. Let's see. Activate that. Remove this tree. So we just bring this up to two, I think, is the height for a path. That should work. And then they will exit through. I'll just delete these. Let's just do it along flat ground so that I don't waste too much money. Because we're still, we are on a scenario. So, I mean, we're, we're trying to actually beat it. But I don't want to waste too much money or time on stuff like this. But this will help our, our entire park do much better. People will be able to, like, get around a lot easier. 
Okay, build a path there. And through here. Bing, bang, boom. Now they can loop around. People are going to kind of get lost in this little beginning, but that's okay. Okay. And then the final, final thing that we have to do... So we need to put bins. Got to put bins and benches. Benches. So that people can sit down. Otherwise, they're going to be like, bleh, bleh, bleh. I've got nowhere to sit. My buns are so tired. Where am I going to plant these buns of mine? These two buns that I was born with. I was born to sit. Me too. So you never got a Twitch end of the year review email thing, but I'd wager your money that you were my top watch channel. What? Darren, I... <laughs> He's so wholesome. We love Darren the Wizard. Can we get a shout out for Darren? Darren plays all sorts of very, very difficult games that I don't play. Darren can do contact juggling that is so cool. He has the chillest vibes. I love Darren's stream so much. And Darren as a person is also excellent. I can't wait to visit you, Beans. You need to... Darren, you, could, you, could you send me your approximate location? I forget which city y'all are in. And I, I was looking up in Canada earlier, and I was having trouble figuring out where you were. Because I do want to visit, and I'm just I'm just curious where you are so that I can start planning. Maybe I can make it up there this year. Maybe I can. Okay. We're going to make a swinging ship because we want people to puke, obviously. That's so much fun. Hee <laughs> hee. Okay, so they should be good to walk through there now. They're just walking. They're loving it. And that means that they can, like, access rides from the other side and from this side. And this is just a loop. This, I think that this is a highly efficient park right now. Like, as far as footpaths go. We also have $4,000. We're about ready to build something big. You want to go to Canada? Are they letting us cross the border yet? I'm pretty sure. Oh, you say it often? You're in Calgary. Okay, I will try to remember that. I was partially saying message me so that I can just read it later. Because <laughs> I'm dumb dumb. Uh... I saw Tyrannosaurus say, Kenny is the true embodiment of the chaotic good alignment. <laughs> chaotic good? I'd, I'd say that's that's pretty accurate. I'd say that's about right. You'll remember Calico? Oh, thanks. Oh, thanks. Cal uh, Calico often functions as my other brain cell. My one lost brain cell. I don't know where... Uh, I don't know how I lost it whenever I was younger, but I did lose one one brain cell. And uh, I, have, I have like a rotating... Uh, responsibility of taking care of that brain cell. Well, here in Ontario, we just went back into restrictions. Oh dear. Well, yes, I would I would only go when it's safe. Okay, we should be close to building a big coaster. I'm trying to remember what it costs to build this thing. What it costs to build. Oh, we need to name this thing too. I'm gonna name it. Uh, I'm gonna name it something. Yeah. Castle Salt. Hey, thank you so much for the sub, local Texan. I super appreciate it. Oi, thank you so much. You guys, could we please get a warm welcome for, for our new friend, a local Texan. I hope you enjoy your emotes. Your emotes and your ad-free viewing. Thank you so much. Is Assault spelled with one S? I think it's spelled with two. I, I'm not a, I am not a good speller. I'm a bad speller. You guys with the hype in the chat. Thank you, local Texan, for the prime. I appreciate it. Let's see. Castle. That that ought to be right. I'm i I'm just gonna I'm just gonna assume that that's correct. <gasps> yeah, look at those cute emotes. I've got more emotes coming too. I've got I've got extra slots that I need to fill up. More slots. More slots. The castle itself. And we still need to change. I mean, this is pretty gauche. I like it. I do like the gauche coloration of our slide but the scrambled eggs are boring b -b 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 boring green green scrambled eggs no thanks same i am Ooh, yellow's nice purple kind of kind of basic looking a little basic sis Ooh, red and yellow is kind of aggressive okay there we go that ought to do what do you guys think about the color for the swinging ship or the inverted ship you think that we should build a... Let's just focus on, like, the main... The main station. What do you guys think for the main station? Th this big... I'll, I'll make them match, I guess. I'll make the... Which, which parts are they? The other... Where's the other red part? Oh, it's that part. Okay, so that's, like, the primary ship color. 
It will set it to... Let me see. Okay, I DM'd you. Thank you. Thank you, Darren. Thank you, Darren. This is so very sweet. Squirrel park theme. <laughs> you guys just like purple. Shaking my head. Shaking my head. Okay, so if we're going to build a coaster, what are our options? We already built a wooden roller coaster. Poor pull. <laughs> I'm not that poor anymore. I got $4,000. Let me see. We've got wooden... Uh, the mouse coasters are kind of cool for super short rides. Maybe... Maybe we can build a super efficient roller coaster within these paths. Oh, I see some puke over here. Maybe I need more handymen. I've already got three. Let's build a couple more just in case. We'll have them patrolling. They're on patrol! A loop-de-loop? -loop? No, no, no. We're not building a loop-de-loop -loop right now. We need to build a loop-de-loop -loop kind of outside of the park. And I'd like to... Let me see. So, spinning wild mouse, wild mouse, and wooden. All of these wild mouse rides are like kind of crappy coasters. I don't think they can have loops. They can't have banks. They're very boring. A mini roller coaster has like a lot of limits on it too. A mine ride is pretty good, but I think it's a little expensive. Classic mini. I've never seen this before. New vehicle available for car ride. What? I thought that I set it so that it doesn't research those. We don't want theming. That's a waste. Okay, it says water rides, thrill rides, roller coasters, gym rides, transport rides. I, I, it's, what? Why did it just research a new... I don't want new cars for stuff. <laughs> That's so many people. Uh, it's going to be much more. We got, we've got to have like a thousand or something. It says you're supposed to have a thousand five hundred guests. So we need more and more, 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 more. Maybe we could build a little miniature wooden mouse coaster. I wonder how expensive these are to build. I think that they're a cheap coaster. Let's, let's build a wooden Ooh, yeah. You can build really cool stuff. Uh, we can make this super compact. So, for a super compact coaster, I think I'll build it on this little part right here. Get rid of that tree. Okay, so... That's one away, two away. And it also, like, turns on a dime, which is very cool. Because it's like, uh... It's a little mini ride. A little teeny tiny ride. But look at that. You can you can just you can make it as big as you could possibly make. And they're like little individual cars, so you basically get as many people on there as you possibly can. So we can go. Ooh, you can go freaking sharp up too. Holy crap. You boys are gonna be inclined. You're gonna be sitting back in your chairs going, hoo, 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 hoo. <laughs> Hey, Lens is here. What's up? Lens, Lens, Lens. How are you doing? How was your day? I'm going to try to make this at, like, the most efficient... Oh, my God! That is so sharp! <laughs> Did I just hit the maximum height already? Holy crap! That's incredible. That is incredible. Wow. Okay, so it takes one to even it out, I think. Yeah, so I can go up one more time. No, I can't. I think I'm at maximum height. All right. Uh, if I want to make this, like, perfectly symmetrical. Well, not symmetrical, but, like, going... Not not going directly over the path. Maybe I will turn it. We can go down. And there's no banks, just like I said. So we have to be kind of careful about building up too much speed. Because if we build up too much speed, then they're going to get freaking sick. Like, this turn right here, I'm a little scared. I'm a little scared about that turn. I don't know about that, you guys. I think that we might be in big trouble if we do that. I am speed. Maybe we should just make it have one little lump down. Take your lumps. Take your lumps, you sorry suckers. And now we'll turn. And now we'll go back down a bit. I want it to, I want it to cut through itself. Like a delicious piece of, of cheese. There's one hole in this cheese. Wait, can't you go underground? Yes, you can. We will build... We will build a ride that goes underground. Maybe maybe we can have one, like, cut into this mountain. It is expensive to do, though, so... <laughs> this music's great for building coasters. Absolute Kirby madness. 
<laughs> this, I want to just be efficient. Can it? Oh, I can't quite go through. That's too bad. I don't think that I can make it through there, unfortunately. Okay, then instead, we will make the chain lift go like right underneath the other part of the track. It'll be, it'll be spooky. And we need to head down soon because, because we need to like burn off all this, all of this speed that we're going to build because we're going to build a lot of speed going down. I'm trying to make this generally in a square so that we don't waste too much space because I still want to build other stuff over here. All of the turns are hairpin turns. What? Not all of them. There's two of them that aren't. There's two non-hairpin turns. <laughs> See, I'm trying with the big drops. I'm trying to not use hairpin turns because they're going to all get sick. In fact, I'm probably going to get sick anyway because I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> oh, on on Goofy's Sky School Coaster. Oh, oh, on an actual ride. Oh, no. That sounds painful. I have been on several painful roller coasters in my life, including... This one that got removed semi-recently that was called, I'm trying to remember its name. I think it's called the Texas Giant. The Texas Giant was a very painful ride to ride, but I loved it and I'm so, gl I'm, I'm so glad. I'm so sad it's gone. Okay, you guys, here it is. Here it is, here's our coaster. Do you have any ideas? Do you have any ideas? Oh, they did rebuild it, you're right. They rebuilt it and they made it super smooth. Yeah, and it has a new drop that's very interesting. It, it's like initial drop is super sharp. I remember that. I've, I've ridden the new one. <laughs> I'm so forgetful. They did rebuild it and it is it is a really cool ride. Okay, uh, we need to test this thing first. So let's build our entrance and exit. If y'all have any ideas for names for this ride, don't hesitate to sing them out. There's an entrance exit. Let's let's give it a test and let's see how dangerous this ride is. I mean, obviously it's not dangerous, but it might be uncomfortable. There it goes. Toot toot. Beep beep. Um, if y'all, if one of you, if one person in chat, the barf bag, that's disgusting. Uh, if one of y'all wouldn't mind looking it up, could somebody look up how to zoom in further on Open RCT2? Open RCT2, I'm curious about how to zoom in further because I know that I can, but I kind of forget. It looks like an amber sand. It does kind of look like an amber sand. That is true. Okay, so the ride is, it looks a little intense. Uh, the nausea rating is, oh God, the max lateral Gs might be too much, you guys. Oh no. When does it hit those Gs? I think that, that yeah, it peaks. Let's see. It peaks right at the at the dead end. Is that this? It's got two, it's these two turns that are making it too fast. Okay, I, I think we got to fix that. To be honest, I thought that there might have been brakes, but I don't think that there's brakes. I can tell you what we're going to do though. I think that we're going to buy a little bit more space by moving this path and we're going to give it two natural turns because that's too much. And I, I, if it, if it peaks like that, I think that, that people really hate it. So let's change. Oh, I want to go the other way on the coaster. Let's edit this part again. Let's make it turn properly and we can fix the path in a second. Okay. So we have to start the turn here. And now we need to go forward with some turns. Let's just delete these paths that people are going to be walking on. And this just should turn around correctly. Oh, no, it does not. I am, I am silly boy. Maybe that one turn would do it. I kind of doubt it. It needs to slow down more. I could make the path go over the coaster. Dang it. I should have thought about this before. I've got it going on like a huge drop. You're going to suggest, uh, you were going to write the up and down ride as a suggestion. <laughs> you sat here laughing at yourself in the kitchen. It's not even funny. The up and down ride. <laughs> oh no, <laughs> not the up and down ride. The most original, the most original name in all of coaster history. I'm impressed. 
<laughs> okay, we're gonna we're gonna waste tons of space because <laughs> I'm a dum dum. It's okay. Oh my god, the mechanics are up there. Mechanic, what are you doing? I need to get everybody off of there. My employees are. Oh my gosh, this is so unsatisfying. Least satisfying coaster builds of all time. Just Google it. This should come up. Yeah, we could call it the waste of space. The unforeseen. Should we? We could call it the unforeseen because. Okay, I'm gonna let it test while I fix this path that I had to break. <laughs> okay, so for paths, they can be they can be brought up. Unfortunately, <laughs> look at all those purple umbrellas. I know, and they're they're twenty dollars each. Twenty dollar umbrella, incredible. What is this Disney World? Okay, so it can go up. And we need to go up one more time. So I'll delete this. Flat. Up. Kind of cool. Kind of cool that the path goes over it. You know, it's all part of the plan. It was all part of the plan. Oh, yes. Very, very cool pathway. Look at that. Oh, the satisfaction. Oh. From what I've understood, further zoom options are only available in OpenGL mode, which you'll have to turn on in the options menu. Okay. Okay. Open GL mode. Thank you, Alchemic. I appreciate it. That might like break the game or something right now. So let's let's first save before I do anything silly. We're gonna name this as what? Auto save? I wanna no, I don't wanna do that. Up. Oh, uh, system. New new file. Uh we'll call this uh Crazy Castle. Well that that's actually fine. Crazy Castle. Okay. Saved. Open GL mode. Because hmm. I want to zoom in better for you guys. Because I know it's kind of hard to see stuff. File. Debugging tools. That might be in the actual, like, game files. I might not be able to do that in this gear. I don't see it. Alchemic, how is it that you know everything about the game? Oh, I asked specifically if somebody could Google it. And Alchemic did it for me. <laughs> Thank you. Um, I don't see it, so maybe, maybe, maybe I'll just leave it alone. Okay, let's see what the test on this ride looks like. What's our test run? Okay, we fixed it. We fixed it. The lateral G's, oh wow, yeah. That's, that's still kind of high, but it's totally fine. It's totally within the limits, and now it's medium, medium, and low nausea. Nice. It'd be nice if it was more exciting, but that's fine. This is, this is fine. This is fine. The coaster's ready to rock, you guys. It's a it's a good coaster. I like it. I'm proud of it. Okay. Now I can build some pals. Let's... We'll wind it one extra time. And we gotta build our exit. So that people can get loose. People are getting loose in the park. Okay, let's open it up. Actually, what's the price? We'll set the price to maybe... I'd say that this is at least a $5 ride. I'll set it to five, and I'll and I'll double check that people aren't like mad at my rides right now. Okay, open that up, and the other thing that I need to do is double check that I got some extra bins around here, because people are so awful at putting their trash in the trash can. It's a highly realistic simulator, you see. People really do just be trashing up the place, and it makes me mad, angry. Okay, first, I'm gonna take all of my employees, as annoying as it is. Yep, we got one on the wall. We go here. We got one off the wall. Good stuff. This one's off the wall. That one's off the wall. And that one is too. Okay, good. So those are all good. And my mechanics. Got one on the wall being a dum-dum. My rides are probably all breaking down because they're not inspecting them. <laughs> okay. Got one there. And the other one's on the wall too. Well, great. Nobody's been inspecting the rides. Okay, let's go bye-bye. And the last thing that I need to do is... Oh, what was I, gonna, what was I saying? Okay, great. Yeah, the Ferris wheel is dead. The other thing that I need to do is double check if people are mad about any prices right now. Let's see. Actions. We want to go to thoughts. I'm running out of cash. That is a good thought. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm running out of cash is a good sign. <laughs> I need to go to the bathroom. Okay, maybe I'll make one more bathroom. This park is clean and tidy. I already have a park map. 
This is great. That was great. Inverter ship is a good value. Thirsty, blah, blah, blah. In fact, wait a second. What is a good value? I'm not pay paying that much to go on merry-go-round. There's only three people saying that. Early whirl is a good value. This is a good value. Okay, if they're such a good value, I need to adjust them and make them more expensive. <laughs> the early whirl, eh? All right. Thanks for thinking that. I'm glad that I can read y'all's thoughts. I'm going to make this $2 now. I'm going to make this $2 as well. There we go. Ferris wheel is looking pretty bummed out over here. People don't like the Ferris wheel. Nobody's riding it these days. These days, it's Garbaggio. Maybe I need to adjust the path because I think that the path might be screwing me over a little bit. I'm going to set it to go over here. Even though the line is way unnecessarily long, I think that it's better to have them access it from the main area. It'll give me more chances. Thank you for the follow, uh, CHKD. Appreciate the, uh, the, uh, the, <laughs> the E. Thanks. <laughs> All my business classes stated that losing cash is indeed a good thing. What? Losing cash is a good idea? You guys remember whenever we built this little coaster here? And it was like, uh... We had like $3,000. Well, now we're already back up to our money again. After we... After we made this ride. I'm gonna increase the chain hill uh, speed. So that it so that it uh moves them up there a little bit faster. I'm gonna I'll slow it down and I'll show you the difference. There you go, there's four. Let's watch one go up and I'll speed it up. Zoom! There we go. Alright, they'll go a little bit faster now. Can I change we can change the color of anything here. So maybe we'll change the primary color to be purple. And the secondary color? Oh god! Oh, gosh, no. Absolutely not. Ah! My eyes! <laughs> my eyes! We're gonna keep it as white. Anything else is kind of ago. You can either make it white or black. Those are your options. That looks kind of gross. That looks like... Ugly, ugly. Blue track? Um, yeah, we could do a blue track. Let's see. Yeah, that looks... That looks nice. I think that looks good. I, I guess lo loosing the cash is better than stapling it. What? Stapling cash? <laughs> you only pay taxes on profit. So if you have no profit, you pay no taxes. Hmm. How to make streaming unprofitable. I'll Google it. Let's see. So we don't... Let's see. We might have enough money to build. Okay, so people love the park. Our park rating is great. Uh, park rating is supposed to be 600. Right now it's 800. And we need 1,500 guests. And the more rides that you build, the more people that come to the park. That's just literally, like, st it's statistics. So if you have a certain amount of rides, then you have a, what's called a soft population cap or a soft, like, uh, visitor cap. So our soft cap is pretty rough. It's pretty rough because we don't have much going on yet. As we build more rides, then more people will be able to come here. So it, it's not, it's not like something bad against our park that we don't have tons of people, okay? Let's maybe build, uh, gentle rides don't bring as many people as thrill rides. So, uh, maybe we will, oh yeah, I need to build a bathroom because I'm a, because I'm an Earl of the people, all right? I'm an Earl of the people. People ask. They wanted, they wanted to go pee pee, and I said, all right, pee then. Maybe I didn't open it. That, that, that might be a possibility that I did not open this bathroom. Nope, it's open. Good, good, good. Okay, pee pee time. Apparently, OpenGL is under the drawing engine and options. It's entirely ex experimental and can could crash your game. Maybe best to leave it off. Um, yeah, may maybe I'll, maybe I'll test it out offline and, and we'll see how it works. I'm gonna break a couple things over here because I want to build the next coaster over here, I think. I think that we'll build the next coaster out over this area. It would be kind of cool. Uh, the wooden roller coaster can have an on-ride photo section. Ooh, I didn't know that they had that option. We must add that right now. The on-ride photo section is a great deal for us. So I am even going to close this ride, kick the people off, 
it doesn't look like it's too uh popular right now maybe we should do some uh what is it called advertisement okay so now that it's closed i'm gonna go back oh i'm gonna go back here what's the most exciting part of the ride that i can fit one on not that it matters but i just do it for fun it looks like there's a flat spot right here maybe let's see Nope, there's no flat spot there. I think that it has to be 100% flat for a photo section. So I... Let's see. We could test it, but we kind of need this. We need the S. Let's make a boring section at the end, I guess. That's fine. This so this is the surprise photo, okay? This is this is the photo that gets you. You didn't know that it was coming, and you're like, "What? I I, I wasn't even I wasn't even looking at the camera." Break that, and we'll build a forward, and we'll build a. There's a water splash option. That's cool. On ride photo section. Sweet. Thank you for that suggestion, Lex. I appreciate it. And that means that we can charge for those. So we'll reopen it and. See. The photos, two dollars. I mean, it's a good deal. It's a good deal. It's a good deal. I don't really know what like the, the price for those are supposed to be, but let's see. We got some puke, but we just earned the tidiest park in the country, bruh. What kind of country do we live in? <laughs> the tidiest park in the country has a bunch of puke everywhere. Ooh, we could build a log flume. People like that. People love logs. People would log in just for this. Should we... Uh, where should we build the log flume? You hate photo sections? You feel like you have to smile in case someone wants to buy the picture? Don't ruin their picture, Lens. If you ruin their picture, then that means that they save money and you're a good person. You're a good person if you ruin them. Lens, also, who cares about them? Writing that right is all about you. It's all about you, babe. Don't, don't, don't let them get you down. Let's... Build a long... Yeah, log flume's always popular. And it can also have a photo section. Nice. So maybe we'll build it starting here. Log flumes also look really cool. So these are individual uh, carts. So we can just basically build this as long as we want it. I don't want to make it too long. So I don't care. So we're going to go up. Up, up, up the stairs we go, and then the tunnel. I doubt that this is going to become too thrilling for these, uh, for these people. Hang on. I want to get out of the park. We're going home! Uh, alright. There, 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 there. There, there, little ones. Okay. Let's do that. And we're gonna, we're gonna build more stuff here at the entrance, I guess. Can log flumes go underground? I bet they can. I bet they can. It seems like a strange, a strange thing to do, though. Kind of spooky. Kinda spooky. We'll try to build some, like, underground stuff a little bit later. Thank you for the follow. Uh, I see you, Cannon. But thank you for the follow. Uh, let's see. Is that... Go go oh, my gosh. How do I say this? Can I call you... Let me see. Zunder? I see a Zuner? <laughs> I don't know how to say this name. Gawk! <laughs> Thank you for the follow. If you want to explain for me how to say your name, please do. I'm sorry. All right. What kind of special stuff do we have? Station platform, S-bins, on-ride photo section, reverse or turntable. Whoa. Oh, it gets you stuck. You can call me Goku. All right. That's what I saw first. <laughs> that's what I thought it would be. I thought it'd be Goku. Thanks for the follow, Goku. I appreciate it. How's your day going? Hope you're having a good day, my friend. <laughs> you could just call me Goku. My goodness. I'm going to make a little lump. We're building a lump because we got to be careful with this wall. Unfortunately, they make it so that you can't build this very high. This is going straight out the wall, you guys. <laughs> We're zooming. We're zooming. Heck yeah. What if you put a Ferris wheel underground? Ooh, that is such an amazing idea. I don't even know if it's possible. All the best ideas in this world are have questionable possibility. Okay, this is gonna be kind of a weird log flume, I bet. 
Let's actually head back up with our momentum. Ooh, I, I don't even know if these things hold momentum, to be honest. Because I, I see that if you go up, it's always rails. I want to watch a test run of this and see if it gains momentum. I want to see if it, if it speeds up this faster. Let me see. Oh, it slows down mega because of the water. No worries. No worries. Looks like you just have to you just have to build a lot of ups. That's a log flume for you. Classic log flume. LOL, all you see during the underground Ferris wheel is layers of dirt. Yeah, you're just like going through and you can see fossils on the side that they've placed. Mommy, mommy, I see a dinosaur or a skeleton. That's fake, dear. That's plastic. Mommy! I see gems in the wall. I can almost touch them. Don't keep your hands in the vehicle. <laughs> Please. You find that water, uh, th that water slides and bobsled roller coasters a pain because they have too much momentum. If they have too much momentum, they fly off the track. What kind of rides are you making, Lex? Hang on. That's genuine plastic. <laughs> That's some fancy genuine plastic out of there. Tell you what. I tell you what, we got some genuine plastic in this park right here. These ki the kids love it. The kids love to see it. Okay. I, I want to build a reverser turntable just for fun. I don't even know how these work. I think that they get stuck and they go... Oh, and then they go backwards. What? Ooh, I'm, I'm actually going to remove that. And I'm going to make them go backwards down this hill. <laughs> we're, making, uh, we're making them go backwards up here. Oh, I'd have to I'd have to redo a lot of the ride. Let's, let's do it here then. Because this is an actual flat spot. I, I didn't realize what that thing did. Do I have to do I have to turn them back though? Can they go back into the station backwards? <laughs> so that the next people go straight down this? You hate rides that go backwards? Ooh, there's some coasters that I've ridden that go backwards that are very fun. Some of my favorite coasters go backwards. There was one that was called the Flashback. I really love that one. And the Mr. Freeze is very cool. I like that ride. This is 25 feet, that's 30. So we gotta go up a little bit in a minute. Gotta get it close to the wall. Go up, 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 up. Let's see, that would go to 30 and, oh, oops. Okay, go back a couple. <laughs> Oopsie. Okay, we can go forward one. And we will put another station platform, boom. Okay, here's our, here's our very questionably... <laughs> let's give it a test. Oh, it's already on test mode. Nice. Okay, let's put our entrance here. Exit here. Let's let it test. Test these. Whoa, why are there so many... <laughs> Holy crap. There's so many uh, flume. So much flume. Too much. There's not enough room for all this flume. Let's see. Whee! Sploosh. I want to see if the... I guess that it can go back in reverse. I love it. Grizzly River Run just spins you the whole time. It's fun. I love spinning rides. There is a ride called Tony Hawk's Big Spin. I think it's been rebranded recently, but... It, it's like kind of... It's a free... It's a free car that just like spins around. It's very fun. I liked it. And it's also so smooth. So smooth. Nice one, Tony Hawk. Dollywood has a ride that your cart just drops down straight. What? Mr. Freeze was cool. Was that a pun intent? Was that pun intentional? Uh, that was pun intentional. <laughs> I mean, it's uh, totally pog. That's what I meant to say. Nardavel, how are you doing? You used to hate scary rides. Then you had a phase where you loved them. Now you hate them again. Oh no. I used to love, I, I used to like want to go on scary rides all the time, but I'd get, but I'd get scared going up the, like getting locked in. The early world has broken down. Oh no. But now, uh, my heart is, my heart has grown cold. So I am not scared of any amusement rides. And I basically like put my hands up and I try to make it as exciting as possible because otherwise it's boring. Okay, I'm going to set this to $4, I guess. Or do you think that this is a $5 ride? I think it's a $5 ride. This this ride, you won't believe it, you guys. You won't believe how amazing this ride is. And this ride's... All of my rides seem to still be relatively popular. 
Wait, does it work that the exit is after the entrance? Yep, it's all good. The game doesn't mind where you put them. What would be better probably is if like this path went back here, but I'll eventually have people going around these loops so much that I don't think that it'll matter. The flow of the park will be fine. It's so weird. Yeah, it's, it's, I mean, it's to simplify. It's to simplify. Bad chronic pain day. Oh no, I'm sorry to hear that. I hope you start feeling better, friendo. Uh, how am I? I'm doing good. I woke up late and now I'm, now I'm playing one of my favorite games. Looping roller coaster, a smooth steel track roller coaster capable of vertical loops. Ooh, we've almost got $5,000. Ooh, I'd say that we're just about ready for that. How much do these normally cost? Like 300, 400 bucks. Uh, let's make a swinging ship. We'll make a swinging ship and we'll start and we'll start generating money for us to build our new, our new ride. Can't construct, it's too close. Okay, so if I did it here, oh, too high for supports because you can build rides on top of each other. Certain rides. Build that. And that noise 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 fire chip Let's start making some cash i'm gonna double check if people like my prices there we go build another ride this should help build up some uh some peeps in this park i'm gonna set this to two dollars and let's see what people are thinking about my rides let's see if they get mad at anything right now running out of cash good i feel sick too bad uh let's pause real quick Log flume was great. They love it. It's clean and tidy. Already have a park map. Well, stop. Well, why'd you go to the kiosk then? We only sell two things. I want to go home. Walk home. Uh, inverter ship is a good value. Okay. A good value, you say. I don't want to be the good value park of America. I'm going to I'm gonna charge them as much as I can. Wooden mouse was great. Okay. Great. Great scenery. Yeah. I uh, planted it all myself. I'm not paying that much for merry-go-round one. How much does it cost? One dollar? One dollar fifty? I'll, I'll bring it down a tiny bit. We'll see if we can sucker some more people into it. I'm not thirsty. I'm hungry. I'm not is not a thought that I want to hear. I'm not doing this. I'm not doing that. Tell me what you're doing. I don't care about your non-life. Uh, <laughs> BRB gonna get a shower finally. Ah, oh, lens. Stinky. Go get yourself a shower. Uh, we'll see you in a minute. You can set the spiral slide to have more people on it. And speed up the queue. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Thank you. You can adjust a lot of these ride things. You can have five people on this slide. They schmoove. They schmoovin'. You can set these things to, like, lower rotations and stuff to make more money. More like, I'm not going to leave constructive feedback. That's what I hear every time. Look at this popular Ferris wheel. Oh, me, oh, my. Okay. I'm going to do some... Advertising. Actually, we could pay off some of our loan. It's 5% per year. It's $10,000, actually. No, I'm going to stay in debt. And we're going to do advertising campaign for the park. And we're going to do advertising for our roller coaster that we like there. The Castle Assault. The Assault on Castle Earl. There you go. More food stalls. More food carts. And toilets. I do not charge for toilets. I will put a another food place here. Lemonade stall. Mmm, lemonade. Lemon lame. Put one there. I'm just gonna like weave them in between these rides where the exits like mess up stuff. It'll make our, our park highly efficient. We'll get some popcorn, one of my favorite snacks. If not my very favorite snack. There you go. Put a couple more stalls in there. I don't want them eating too much! Let's see. <laughs> they barf? What? And then they fill up after? Yeah, they're hungry. We got a new ride, a mini suspended roller coaster. What is this? Mini suspended. Whoa. That looks like the dragon ride that y'all are talking about. Because this is like hanging off the top. This might be a uh, dragon's keep a little bit later, but I think it'll be really expensive. So maybe we'll start with a looping coaster. The Black Panther. The Bumblebee, the Deep Freeze, the Fizzly. Lots of options, but we're going to build our own. The Turbine, that's cool. This can also be a reverse coaster. Maybe we should do that. Yeah, I've got an idea now. Yeah, Lime! 
Thanks for the sub. I appreciate it. Can we get some hype for the chat for my friend No Lime? Oi, oi. I'd like to get off Mr. Bones Wild Run. <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Lime. Lime! How are you doing? <laughs> Mr. Bones Wild Ride, eh? <laughs> Alright, I guess you can get off. I guess. Oi, how are you doing, Lime? It's good to see you. Oh, I, I'm trying to build... I've got an idea, you guys. I've got big plans here. I'm gonna build this coaster starting right here. And if I'm not mistaken... I'm gonna double check. I believe that this can be, you can set this to reverse incline launched shuttle mode, which is super cool. So it shoots it forward and then uh, it will it will go backwards. I'm gonna set it to that. I don't know if it's gonna let me like see an example of that. I'm gonna try it. Yeah, we're gonna do a loop. We're building a loop, a reverse incline shuttle run. Let's see, how many cars can we get? Okay, so we need to build one more. Test, test. Cannot simulate it with more than one station platform. What? Oh, yeah, because it's a reverse. I forgot about that. You can only have one car. Excuse me. Excuse, excuse me. Well, I don't know how long you can make it. I guess I could go backwards. You're going to throw some corn dogs in the air, Friar. Nice. Get your share from corn dogs, my friend. Look them up. All right, so we should have room to make it go zoom. Can't simulate it. Unable to operate it with more than one station platform in this mode, but I don't know how to... Okay, well, we're going to make it loop immediately if I can. I have not built one of these coasters before, but I'm going to try. I think you have to get it started, and then you can make a loop. Yep, and they go in a direction, so we're going to go right... So that should, it should launch it. I don't know how hard it launches it. Maybe, I, I think that it might be adjustable. So I'm gonna make it go straight up. Uh, no, we'll make it go straight with no bank. And then it'll go straight up even higher. And even higher. And even higher. Kinda like this. This is a kind of basic ride that I've seen done before. I kinda wanted it to make it twist, but I don't know if I'm allowed to do that. Oh, that's cool. Ooh. Twisty. The twist. This could be the twisted licorice stick. <laughs> the licorice stick. So I am very scared to test this coaster because it might explode. Um, <laughs> I can adjust the lift hill chain speed. Can I not adjust how fast it shoots off? Powered launch. Oh, that sounds dangerous. Launch speed. Ooh, I'm scared. <laughs> uh, let's give it a little test real quick. See what happens. Can't test it. Unable to operate with more than one station platform. What? What do you mean? More than one station platform? Why? I don't understand. Uh, is it just because it launches straight out of the back of it? But big butt. <laughs> Hang on. Okay, let me. I don't get this. Okay. Guess I'm gonna delete. Why do I have to delete them one at a time? Okay, there we go. So I can only start with one? Okay, let's go back. We'll do a couple of flats, I guess. One station platform? That's it? I don't get it. Why? Why are you this way? Test? Unable to test. Why? Unable to operate with more than one station platform in this mode. Oh, so maybe I just can't test it. I mean, that's not that big of a deal. We don't need to test it. It should be safe. It should be perfectly safe confidence in my building you have to set the mode different what what kind of mode like the the mode of the coaster itself i want to go backward i guess i gotta build it flat and then stations again set the mode try instead of using mode try median or mean oh god 
<laughs> but so you just can't test the powered launch? You're just not allowed to test it, eh? Yeah, it says you can't test it in this mode, but but then how do I but how do I test the roller coaster as it is? I want to double check that people don't explode. You should be able to. I mean, I agree. I agree I should. It's got continuous circuit, powered launch, passing station. Maybe maybe that's it. Maybe that's it. No? That's not it. Use your guess as a test. Absolutely not. Uh powered launch without passing station. I, I think that we should not pass the station, right? Because we don't want to go zoom off the edge. All right, we're about to become the most dangerous park in the country. I want to open it. No, you can't even do it. Unable to operate with more than one station platform in this mode. What the heck does that mean? More than one station platform? I even made it so that there was only one and it didn't work still. I don't get it. I don't understand. These are station platforms. Look, even if there was just one, it still doesn't work. What do you mean? Unable to operate with more than one station platform. There is one. There is one. These are station platforms and there's a single one. I don't get it. Me not to understand. Do I need to make it so that it can reverse a little bit? Is that what the problem is? Let's let's try building a little. Oh, not not like that, like this. Is this is this what you want? <laughs> Does it need like to be able to roll backward? Nope. Okay, I don't freaking get it, you guys. I think I have to give up. I think I can't do it. I don't get it. Without passing station, we could say passing station, <laughs> fly off the end and kill everybody. Yep. All right. I think I give it up because I can't figure out how to do this. I guess I could look at... Let's close this and let's look at some examples of this ride. Because uh, I saw one. The turbine is what made me think of this idea. I mean, that just shoots upward. This one shoots up and goes back. I don't see what the problem is. Huh. It says, well, it doesn't say what kind of a ride it is or like what mode it's running on, but they have examples. Did I see Shockwave? I've ridden this roller coaster. This is a real coaster. That's cool. That's a, this is a coaster at Six Flags over Texas. I, I've been on this. Do they have an, any more real rides? Deep Freeze? I think that this is the Mr. Freeze. No, it's not. <laughs> Definitely not. Um... Okay, I think we have to delete this and let's build a different roller coaster, I guess. That's a bummer. That was going to be a fun idea. Maybe I've got to use a different one to be able to build something like that. That's too bad. Uh, but we've got tons of money now, so we can build any coaster that we want. We need something that has a loop-de-loop. -loop, because that's what the people want. The people want loops. And by people, I mean y'all. You googled a possible fix? Uh, sure. What, what, what is it? What's the idea? Because I probably just built it wrong, right? Probably what it is. Yeah, because I've built rides like that before. Maybe I was just setting it on the wrong mode, but I kind of tried them all. What? What is this possible fix of which you speak? Because I can just build another one of these that's just a normal coaster for now. I'm curious, though. Because if I can make it work, I would. It's long. Okay, well, let's, let's. I'll save it for later. I'll get better at this game. I'll get better at it. It's been a long time since I played it, and I didn't build a lot of custom coasters as a kid, to be honest. You have to restart the game or the map. There's so all sorts of odd fixes. So it's a bug. Okay. If it's a bug, I don't feel as bad. If it's actually a bug and I'm not just being dumb. Okay, we're going to build a new coaster. Something very excited. Or you messed up. That's true. It's always possible. Either one. <laughs> okay. Can we build three? Perfect. All right. Now it's time to build a spicy ride. How much room do we have? This coaster should be able to go very high too. Bugs? Squash them. That's a solution. We've got a new ride. The Enterprise, eh? What is this? A nerd park? There'll be no Mission Enterprise. 
Which coaster is this one? This is the looping roller coaster. So I'm going to try to make it nice and twisty. Da loop, da loop. <laughs> yeah, we're going to make two loops in this one. You can bank a what? You're going to call it lupus? Oh, God. <laughs> Your favorite of the roller coasters. Nice. Okay, I don't think that we can bank upward. Yeah, we've got to we've got to stop going upward if we're gonna bank. Okay, this one's gonna go up to 100 feet, a 100 foot drop, a 100 foot drop into oblivion. Uh, let's see. We'll make that curve. We could go extra small radius or wide. Ooh, that is cool as heck. So smooth, dude. All right, now we gotta even it out. And start cranking up the speed. We're cranking it, dude. Oh, you can do a steep drop? Oh, that is sweet. You definitely can't do a steep drop while curving, but I'll make us an extra steep drop before this loop. To get some bonus speed. Oh, it's going fast. <laughs> Be afraid. Be very, very afraid. Now we're going to go left. Boop. And then flat. And then uh, right. Oh, wait. No, not S-Pinned. Oh, we got to go up again. One more. Boop. And right. Okay. Are we going to have the momentum to come out of that? Let's see. Drop it under the ground. Uh, Very expensive. Very expensive. One. Two. Oh, it makes it easy. Easy. Okay, how much more speed can we get out of this? Maybe we'll build like a little curve in here. <laughs> I love the banked curves. It's so cool looking. <laughs> Whoa, we could loop around again. There's no way it's going to have the momentum for this. No freaking way. I'll watch it, but I don't think so. <laughs> Maybe. I... No, right? Oh, it works! <laughs> it works! I think. <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. I'll build a little bit more and I'll let it I'll let it roll. Let the good times roll, y'all. If we can get this going fast enough, we'll go over the log flume, I guess, and loop around again. This is this coaster is gonna be so long and expensive. We're gonna make this is gonna be a ten dollar ride, you guys. This one's gonna cost you. Maybe we can sneak underneath the log flume. Okay, can it make it up the curve? Oh no, it doesn't make it. Oh no, <laughs> dang it. Okay. I'm going to increase the speed then. We're going to make this coaster so speedy. I'm going to remove one of these bins, I guess. Or I will make it so that it's... I mean, I really love banks, but... I love banks, but, you know, eat the rich and all that. Uh, maybe I'll make it basic. Maybe she's kind of basic. Oh, no, that's, that's a little... Uh, that's not going to work. That's not gonna make it in. Uh, let's let's build up a tiny bit of speed here for Funzo. Then we'll give him a we'll give him a little bit of enjoyment. Tiny bit. Is this even gonna build up more speed? I don't think it is. <laughs> I just need more sharp downward momentum. I think. Yeah, that's not gonna line up quite right. That would line up, but still, the problem with the speed. Problem with speed. Let's see, are there booster tracks in this thing? Let's do this. I'm just gonna look. Does it have boosters? It does have boosters. We're, we're boosting this. We're boosting it, y'all. Okay. We're gonna let them have some downward momentum. We're gonna roll them. Hashtag rolling. Okay, I'm just gonna kind of redo what I did. We're gonna roll them out of here. Nice, nice. And we're gonna give them a tiny bit of time. Let's see. I think that boosters have to be flat. And I I don't think that that's a flat piece. Yeah, it's a it's a curve into a flat. 
Okay, we're gonna just have to adjust some of this. It's all right. It'll be easy to build. Let's go back real quick. And we'll give it a boost. Let's go forward. Two more. Oh, wait. We gotta, we gotta actually build the special platform. There we go. All right. Now that should be enough. I'm not 100% sure, but... Uh, let's go left and then right so that we stay nice and close to the wall. Oh, yeah. We're looping now. Now we're looping. And then we went up with the curve. I kind of forget which way the curve went. Yeah, I think it may have gone the other way. I mean, those boosters get it around it, but... Do I set the boosters here? Maybe the boosters don't have uh, options. Because this doesn't seem to be going much faster. You could set the booster at the start of the drop. Um, I guess I could. Maybe a booster after the loops too? Goodness. This is going to just be like... Vern, vern. <laughs> yeah, I don't even see too much of a... I guess. Yeah, let's... I guess we can boost it out of here. I bet you these... Oh, actually, these boosters aren't too expensive, I guess. Then we... Loop into a uh, big curve. Oh, there's no way that it's going to make it through there, right? Yeah, let's... Let's see how... If it... If it even starts making it up there. Hey, Vonchik, what's up? <laughs> This is way too high, dude. That's obscene. I need to make these sharp curves like this. Yeah, that that is doable. That is doable. <laughs> I am a I am a silly boy. I'm a silly boy, and I apologize for it. Uh, yeah, that's even higher than before the loops. Exactly. It's like the highest part of the ride is after the drop. <laughs> that doesn't work. Yeah, so that should work, and then. Oh, man. I hope people don't get too sick, man. Let's see. Maybe we could put one more loop in there. Triple loop? What did you say that it could be called? Professor Lupin? Oh, my gosh. The pain. Ooh, I could have made it curve through its own loop, maybe. Hmm. Can I do that? I mean, like, am I smart enough? Let's see. I'm pretty sure that you can thread the needle through loops. And we're pretty close. I don't think that's gonna go. Oh, it does go through. That's kind of sick, dude. That's honestly pretty cool, dude. Now the only question is keeping it above the other part here. Can't do that. Stay here. That's kind of a boring section. Let's put a photo right here on the boring spot. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> That's going to be the photo of a lifetime. Whenever you're like, is the ride over yet? Uh, let's see. How fast does it go once it's here? I know where photos should go, old Haggy, but I'm not making this I'm not making this roller coaster actually good. <laughs> Photo time! It's when they don't expect it. You can get some candid photography. But this is Earl World, you see. Okay, so I'm gonna have to loop it all the way through here. So that might be too difficult. It needs to be faster. Yeah, I think that it's maybe these curves that are messing me up. Maybe it's too curvy. Let's test it out with more sharp... More just... Let's just do it straight out. And then just sharp. Maybe I'm overthinking it. Okay, don't have, don't have time there. No big deal. We'll go forward a little bit. Still want to be... Oh, now it's 105 feet. Goodness gracious. Okay. What about now? Sharpies. 
Okay, I want to get rid of these parts here. Doot, 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 doot. Let's go back here. Oh, God. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Gotta make it to 30. Okay. Oh, wait, no. I want to keep testing it. <laughs> Let's see. Linz is a clean bean. You're the cleanest bean. You don't get guest logic. They only buy one roller coaster photo and they refuse to buy it from other roller coasters. That is true. But they only do it from the log flume. That sounds like a programming problem. That sounds like bad programming. Let's let's watch the simulated drop. I want to see you guys schmoo, dude. And it's even got a booster. It looks really dangerous and scary. Oh, what? Well, it's not finished yet, human person. I won't just I won't just launch the people. Uh, I won't just launch it off the tracks. I promise. It's not that much faster, I guess. Okay. So I'm wondering if I can make this curve through there, kind of. So I might have to stop going up, I guess. Eh, maybe I will just, maybe I'll just keep it. Yeah. Let's keep the tighter turn, I suppose. I suppose. I was kind of hoping to make it, like, go through both loops, but that'd be a long coaster, dude. That'd be a long, expensive build. Let's see, is this threading it? Yeah, it's threading it. Now, can we make it back through this other loop? <laughs> Probably. It'll be slow, though. This is not how roller coasters work. <laughs> roller coasters are supposed to be exciting. Not looping through itself just for swag. Just for coolness, dude. Yeah, now we need to, we need to build some more speed. <laughs> some more speed after this lame... <laughs> Way move. Oh, we can already go sharp again, dude. Okay, let's let's just see what the car looks like whenever it goes to the second loop for no reason. There you go. Beep beep. Look out, everybody. Hang on to your butts. Zoom zoom. Okay, that's that's actually pretty fast. That's pro that is pretty dang fast. I like it. Oh. Oh. Too sharp. <laughs> Too far down. What have I done? What have I become? My sweetest friend. Everyone I know goes away in the end. I see we go back up. Oh, now I just need to connect it again, and I don't have any ideas. Y'all got any cool ideas? <laughs> Big more loops. Maybe uh, I boost it here for the final for the final ride. Maybe we just have like a line of boosters. I wonder if they add speed like exponentially, or if there's just like a limit. Once you get enough of them, then that's enough. Yeah, this uh, this is gonna be uh, zooming. Let's do up one more loop. Well, this is the low loop. Maybe we do the loop the other way. Quad loops? No, 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 no. We'll just do these. And then move it backwards and remove the boosters before the loops and make the loops. What? <laughs> make the loops closer to the drop? I could. I could do that. I honestly want to see what these do anyway. I mean, I want to see. Maybe you might get splashed. What if you go under the log flume? Yeah, I think we're gonna. I think we're gonna try to exit through the log flume. But I'm not sure if we can make it under this tiny little 45 foot thing. We're gonna find out. Loop to schloop. Zoom. All right. Maybe we will just make a boring exit so that I stop spending money. Okay. I think we're just going to make a boring exit. It needs to go up to 30 feet. And we could... We, the thing that we can do, though, is that you can make it, like, kind of bumpy. If it has bumps, 
people people like that. People people enjoy that, okay? Okay, now we go like back up, flat, back down. And how are we gonna make it under here? Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. We have run into quite a predicament. Let's see, if we made it, yeah, if we made tight turns, how do I turn on the grid? I want it to be griddled. Let's see, hide baseland, where are my grids at? Hide baseland, hide this, hide that, that's not what I want. I want to see stuff. Okay, well, whatever. Let's see. Maybe we make it come out of the underground. I, because I'm not sure, is that, is that lining up? Kind of hard to tell. It looks correct. <laughs> I'm just trying to sneak it underneath this log flume. Yeah, okay. So we need a, we need it to go underground to get out, I guess. I hope it has enough speed for this. After the third loop, go underground. It's very expensive to build ground. So I don't, I want to avoid it if I can. It is, it is expensive to raise the land, and then it's expensive again to, uh, to go under the ground on a coaster, too. So I'd rather not. Okay. Now, let's see. Let's remove this. Hey, Andrea, what's up? Welcome back. How are you doing? We're building, we're building roller coasters. We're doing the roller coaster tycoon. I'm a tycoon now. Are you proud of me? I'm trying to finish this coaster. We've been we've been building coasters today. Okay, now how do we do this? Uh, it needs to go up to 30 and then flatten? No, no, that's too high now. Okay, does that work? We're about to find out. I will butt out, but why are you telling... Uh, why am I telling you all these suggestions? No, you can. It's totally fine. I like suggestions. I like suggestions. They are fun ideas. I do love building underground too. It is it is very fun and interesting. And I will. I definitely will. Okay, that is pretty sweet. And we can run two, two cars on it. That's not too bad. Couple of cars. I think that is a sweet roller coaster. Does anybody have any ideas for a name? I know that somebody said what uh Lupin <laughs> spelled like uh Okay, let me I'll make me entrance and mix it. Professor Lupin. I almost but I wanna spell it like um Let me see. The Professor. Pro I do like that a lot. <laughs> Professor Lupin. There we go. Felt like a loop. <laughs> I'm testing out this coaster. We'll see what happens. What are the people going to think? It's not the people that we need. It, we just have to make sure that it doesn't pull any crazy laterals or something. We have to make sure that it doesn't have too much lateral or vertical Gs. And hopefully the nausea rating's low. I used a lot of banked. Or did I? Yeah, I did use some bank turns and some high speed areas. So hopefully that will make sure that it's not too crazy. Vertical G is peaking a little bit. Peaking a little bit. Okay. So maybe a little intense. But those are just normal loops. How can you not peak on a loop? Okay, then it gets a kind of bad lateral G here at the end. I think it's going a little speedy. But it's not too bad, right? Oh, God. Okay, I got two big red signs. I might need to deal with those. That's annoying. Okay, maybe I need to remove some boosters. Yeah, let's... Actually, we're going to remove all boosters. And we're going to see if it works. Because I might be just, like, being a little, uh, like, unnecessary with them. Maybe, maybe we don't even need them. Because we clearly have too much speed, if anything. Okay, we'll move those boosters. And I'm, I don't know if I can remove all of these, though. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. Probably going a little slow for that. But we'll, 
we'll see. Maybe let's remove them and just watch it. We'll watch it out of uh, some, like, some curiosity. Okay, let's, let's do a little fake test. We'll fake test and we'll see if it even makes it through the coaster. Because if we can remove the, there's lateral G's here at the end. I'm pretty sure that's where that was. There's too much, uh, there's too many G's on both of these loops and I think on this one. So the less speed, the better. Because this is already very, very exciting ride, I think. I didn't actually look at the excitement rating, but we'll just see if it works. I love how this part of the coaster is still bringing it up. I feel like I should adjust that. I didn't know that this was still considered a chain lift. It's strange. Get down it goes. Oh, circus is in town. We can make a circus if we want to. Okay, one loop. Two loop. Still got boosters there. I forgot about that, but I don't think that it gets really speedy there. Oh, it still has plenty of speed. I removed almost all the boosters and it still works. Let's remove literally all of the boosters and we'll see what happens. If it can make it through, then I'm pleased. I'm extremely pleased. And I guess I, I could curve either one of these turns to like lower the G's, but hopefully we won't have to do that. Okay, pretty much final test. We could, no, you know what? Let's test it with a real coaster. Let's test it, and if it gets stuck, then we can laugh. I will, I will immediately like edit the ride if we have a problem coming in. It better work, because this is a real coaster, you guys, real physics. I mean, the test is, is real physics, but here we go. Hopefully the, uh, hopefully it doesn't get stuck and blow up the other car. I don't think that it counts as a crash if it's testing. <laughs> Imagine you're at a, you're at a park and you see them testing a coaster and it explodes. Is that going to lower your, your trust for the park? Hopefully not. Hopefully you'll come back to Earl's world. This ain't a game. This is real. These are real human beings. One. Two loops, oh my god. Okay, it still works without them. Pretty sure. Easy peasy. And it's probably a much more enjoyable ride at this point, honestly. Yeah, that that, that lateral G might still be a lot. Oh, it is. No, dang it. Okay, we just got to fix this one turn and then we're done. It's perfect. Oh my god. Or maybe not. Let me see up with the G's, man. G oh, G's. Okay, so it's maybe going a little fast on that. Okay, I can lower this a little bit. I kind of wanted to lower it anyway by either one or two because then we can just go straight and then straight to flat. Okay. Let's fix it. This is too high, too exciting. The reviews are in. It's too spicy. Too spicy and delicious. Got a bunch of chicken lovers at this part. Okay, now we go forward, and I want to turn off the chain. Go forward a couple times. Then we go down, straight down. Do you think that this is going to be too much? <laughs> it's at 35. That's still too high. 30? Okay, test it again. What are you thinking? Oh, maybe we should fix this real quick. You've been gone a long time, but you're here now. Hey, what's up? Doggin, Doggin the Proto. Welcome in. You've been gone for a minute, but you're back. And that's all that matters. It's good to see you. I hope that you've enjoyed your time away. Oh, we've got to get started with the bank. So maybe I should make this more basic. We need a, we need a bank into this turn, but it's kind of hard to... Oh, wrong bank, wrong bank, wrong bank. Stop that. Uh, I think we got to build it a little further if we want to bank it. Maybe we bank this part. And maybe that'll slow it down enough. How do I get it into there now? Hmm. I've got to complete the loop. Can we bank it again? Nah, that's janky. Janky banky. That works. Okay, that works. We're gonna go 
This is 30. That's 30. This has to go a little tiny bit lower. Build up some speed. <laughs> some speed. I think that that's fine. This is too low now. Oops. <laughs> Dang roller coaster building. Why you got to be so complicated? Shorty. You want a little shorty there. Okay. Flat. Now a bank. Sharp bank. Straight through. And we're going underground. And that should be connected. All right. Let's test it. Gosh darn, this coaster is, is taking the life out of me. This coaster has turned into the biggest project of my entire life. I'm going to watch it live. Watch it live. Make sure that this doesn't get obscene. You ordered contacts? You haven't ordered them in years? I just ordered some new contacts for myself. Gosh darn it. But if you continue it forward more until you turn around the flume, I could, but this is already a really long coaster, and I actually need to stop building this one and build a new one. Because we can we can build another coaster or a lot of stuff. We have we have tons of money. We have tons of money and not a lot of guests. And it's getting on in years. It's year three. I don't know if we're gonna beat this scenario, you guys. I don't think so. But we've been having fun building coasters, so I don't care. Okay, look at that. Vertical Gs are good. Vertical Gs are good. So far. Last loop. Vertical Gs are still fine. Lateral Gs, good. All good. Looks like it passes. Looks like it passes. Let's see. What does it say? Is it too fast? Is it going to make everybody explode? Nope. It works. No more red. No more red. It's medium. High, high. That's good. That's good. We could have made it extreme, uh, extreme excitement because that's better. But this works. This works. And we're going to make it $10. It's a $10 ride. It's a value. It's our value ride. All right. Time to open the sucker up to the public. We're going to open it up. Money time. All right. Gonna loop this around. We're going to make a spicy queue. There we go. Let's open it up. Who wants to pay $10 to ride the most incredible roller coaster? The most. <laughs> nice shot. <laughs> Good approach. Eagle. Hole in one. It looks good. Are you going to leave it red? No, we could adjust it. Do y'all want to Y'all want to have uh, some new colors here? What do you think about the colors? Let's take a look at a couple of them. We got, we got light. We got purple. Green. We do an orange. Orange. Maybe we'll make the outside like this. Or we could make the inside the cool color. And we could make the outside a black. Or the inside a black or a white. I kind of like the black mixed with a bright color. Maybe like a purple. Ooh, that's kind of ugly. Never mind. Uh, that looks kind of cool, but a little bit ugly. That's too subtle. Maybe we could do dark blue is a little subtle. Red is neat. Red is neat. Orange is neat. Green is kind of cool. I like that. Uh, red is good, like I already said. Pink. <laughs> <laughs> pink's, pink's all right. <laughs> oh, 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 <laughs> gross. Green reminds you of your old gaming mouse. Ooh, Razor. Razor Mouse is in the chat. Fury Coffee. Are you a, are you a Razor Gamer? Razor Gamer. Mm. <laughs> Black and yellow reminds you of a wasp. The wasp. We can name it the Bumble. The Bumblebee. Uh, maybe make these supports like this. And if we turn this into a little, uh, little bumblebee mobile. Maybe instead of all yellow, we could, uh... There we go. Let's, let's see what that looks like. <laughs> I am, I am. Though I don't use any of the MMOs currently. You still have all the buttons ever? Do you have the one that has, like, nine buttons on the side of the mouse? I've, I've got a mouse that has, like... Two buttons on it. Two extra buttons. <laughs> I don't I don't play any real gamer games. 
Ooh, they, they kind of they kind of uh, match. 12 buttons on the side of the mouse. I've seen those. I've seen those. I know. <laughs> that now that's a gaming mouse. Me, I'm a scrub. I'm a scrub. I'm just playing simulators over here. They're like, when does the ride start? I'm bored. Mom, can I get off the ride? It's so slow. Oh my god. Oh. Wow. <laughs> whoa, whoa. This ride's cool. I like it. I like it. Let me see. We're supposed to do this by year four. Not gonna happen, dude. Not gonna happen. Goodness. All right, we got the Bumblebee. Unless y'all can go. Oh wait, no, it's still Professor Lupin. That's that's still a cool name. It. I, I I don't think of a color scheme whenever I think of Lupin. So this is totally fine. Are we at the fun part yet? Are we at the fun part yet? While well, you're rolling through the entire like ride, you're going around a loop-de-loop. -loop. When does it get fun, mom? Mom, is this fun yet? <laughs> Am I having fun? I don't know, child. Shut up. Mom. Uh, oh, okay. So we could put a tunnel of horror for fun. It would kind of match the aesthetics of this park. And it would maybe be kind of sick kind of sick dude uh why why is it all I, I see that there's like paths i guess it already has paths to be able to uh to be able to connect up haunted mansion where would that go here i kind of don't want it to be in the way of everything i kind of want it to feel like integrated a little bit keep struggling building your own designs with the haunted mansion ride they keep flying off oh no it now that really is a haunted mansion haunted by all of the previous guests <laughs> whoops let's see there's no rides over here while they're walking around so maybe i could put it here then you can see them popping out of the ride i don't know haunted mansion doesn't seem like the most exciting like most exciting ride to have around here but i mean we need rides let's let's build it the haunted mansion we've got money and we don't have uh attendance so it's time to get building y'all we need to build some stuff Ooh, that's kind of cool it's in the it's in a cage you get thrown into the cage of madness you'll never escape this ride <gasps> enterprise this thing is cool as heck I like that. All right, let's make the entrance over. Uh, make the entrance here, exit there. I'm just slapping down some rides, you guys. We gotta make some money. Got some make make some money, attract some people. Get that enterprise going. It looks cool as heck, man. I want to ride on that right now. Uh, let's try. Let's try. We can build another small coaster in here. I want to start. Um cutting the coasters through each other at some point that would be kind of cool we got loads of room i initially thought that we wouldn't have much space but in the end we actually have we actually have loads of space maybe we could i i think that i used to build much more inefficiently like as a child roto drop a ring of seats pulled from the top of the tower while gently rotating allow for free fall down Ooh, tower ride that sounds fun these are, this is not the best kind of tower, but I want to put it over here so that it doesn't get in the way of our view. Build a... Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Maybe I'll build a small one and we can build a second one too. What did I set the price of the loop coaster? $10. 10 buccarinos. I think that that's a fair price. You think that I could charge more for this thing? I doubt there's anybody saying this is a great value. <laughs> this is an incredible value, you guys. Everybody try out this ride. Okay, let's build the entrance exit. Oh, uh oh. I made a mistake. I made a horrible, unforgivable mistake. Okay, that's a long line. That is absurdly long. Hey, one dollar make you holla. This is not a one dollar ride. This is God's greatest creation. If you click uh, and hold the Q, you get more options. Hold, Q. Uh, wait for full load, free fall drop mode. 
Uh, the button? If you click and hold the button, you get more options for what? When you add cues in. Oh. Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, this. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know this. I know this. I could make them multiple colors. I think we're going to make maybe... I, I don't know how good and efficient a roto drop is, but I like the size of the ride, so I kind of want to put another one over here, I guess. I know that it's not the best power, but we need we need more rides desperately. I told us the other one, it goes up to 160. We'll make them the same height. Okay, so the, the reviews, I, I don't want the reviewers coming after me and being like, why would they build these rides differently? I went on the second roto drop in the park and it was not nearly as fun. I don't know what they're trying to pull, but the prices are exactly the same. Earl's World is possibly a ripoff. More research necessary. Right at your own risk. Okay, here we go. Uh, when am I going to play Animal Crossing again? I need to collect some tickets so that I can do a Sarah hunt. Or Sarah? Is that their name? Now I'm confused. I, I can't remember their name all of a sudden. Um, but yes, we're going to, we're going to be doing a hunt. Sasha, thank you. I, I knew Sarah wasn't right. Uh, Sasha. We'll be doing a Sasha hunt. And I think that I have to, I would play if I played on my own more, but I'm not playing a ton right now on my own. If I played more Animal Crossing in my off time, I would play more on my on time. So I need to, I need to make my, uh, I don't know. I need, to, I need to work on my village a little bit more because I reset recently, which was probably a bad idea. But it's too late now. Ooh, I want to watch the Enterprise. Can I adjust this to make it more... I'm going to make a little less rotation in here. Whoa, that is such a, that is such a rough transition. I like that. That's got to be a little... That's got to be a little rough, right? You're still trying to hunt for ketchup, Audie, or Rosie. <gasps> Rosie's such a cutie. I love Rosie. Those people are stuck on the ride. <laughs> They're stuck up there. <laughs> Maybe I need to build another mechanic. Let's hire one more. Do I see any trash anywhere or something? I do not. Park looks nice and clean. Build a mechanic. Yeah, we need a we need a birth a mechanic using our. A small stash of mothers that we have buried underground. They will birth some more children for us so that we can use them in this park. Okay, maybe we should build another little efficient coaster. Spiral roller coaster. A compact roller coaster with spiraling lift hill and smooth twisted drops. That sounds kind of cool. This doesn't look that small, but it does have a, a spiral ascension is very cool. Summon a mechanic with the toolbox ritual. <laughs> Oh no, <laughs> not, not the accursed toolbox ritual. Beware, we can build another wild mouse maybe. Hmm. Steel wild mouse, inverted hairpin coaster. Individual cars run beneath a zigzagging trap with hairpin turns and sharp drops. This is a small ride. Maybe we should just uh, build like one pre-built ride or one pre-built coaster anyway, because I have been building a lot of custom rides and it does take quite a while and we're about to lose anyway. Well, it doesn't really matter. Um, I'd like the, I'd like for this park to look kind of pretty though, by the end of it, that'd, that'd be kind of neat. I'd like for it to, I'd like for it to look good, but let's, let's build one of our own. Let's build one of our own. I, I don't want to just, just make their idea. I want to make an inverted hairpin coaster. I don't think I've ever built one of these before. We'll build it right here. Right here where people can get a whole eyeful of this thing. And I wonder what the curves look like. What are they? Oh, wrong direction. <laughs> Incorrect, Earl. Don't do that. Don't do that now. Hey, Lupus is home. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back home. Good to see you. Lufus, how was work? I hope you had a good day. You have new slippers too. Ooh, I'm gonna make this ride long. 
And then you can go straight up immediately. Oh my god. I'm gonna try to make another compact coaster. We're making another one of you guys. The compact ride. Kinda like the wild mouse. Okay. And then it just turns straight around and zooms right back down. <laughs> Let's see. What kind of specials do we have? We got we got brakes, station platforms. Oh boy. Station platforms. I don't see any banks. I'm kinda of, I'm kinda of scared. So is the main like idea of this ride like curves and stuff? So it's mostly vertical? Looks like it's primarily vertical. I don't really see how to make this an interesting ride. <laughs> Maybe if you like... See, cause... Can you bank? You can't. There's no banks. Well... Let's see. <laughs> Maybe a couple of... A couple of rides down. This ride's stuck. Give me a test. There you go. I want to I see this ride go. I want to see what it looks like whenever it, whenever it zooms. I think we'll we'll at least loop it through itself one time to make it look somewhat interesting. It goes meow meow. God, <laughs> Lord have mercy on these people's souls. That's way too tight. Can't do that. This is gonna be an uggo coaster. I'm here for it. <laughs> I'm here for it, TBH. Let's see. And it looks like a ketchup packet right now. <laughs> Maybe I need to put some brakes in some of these places. I'll try to leave some spots open so that I can put brakes if I need to, because I think we might need them. Ooh, steeplechase is a new ride. All right. And then we drop it. Drop it like it's hot. Because it is. Let's see. Okay, I like this. I like this. I'm vibing with it. And then uh, how much momentum can we preserve? How far can you go up out of that? This may be too far. Has science gone too far? Let's find out. Oh, they made it back up. Nice. They made it back up. Maybe, and they'll be super slow at the top, so I should be able to put in these hairpins. And then there is maybe some room over here to go down without making it like too, too close to the... <laughs> oh no. <laughs> this might be going a little low. We'll be going over the people. <laughs> the beautiful people, the beautiful people. Bow, bow, bow. There we go. Look, you get to you get to walk under the coaster. Sweet, dude. This is a goofy. This is a goofy ride. <laughs> I'm not too proud of this one. It's a Mick coaster. It does. It looks like a looks like a French fry. This is called the long fry. Maybe we could call it the bonus fry. The fry that you find at the bottom of the bag that you never expected. The bonus fry. Okay, is this gonna make people sick? I hope so. Uh, how low can we go? Okay, looks like we can maybe go lower. Oh, 40 feet, eh? Spicy. Bonus fry. The bonus fry is first fry. Okay, we need to remove one flat part. No flatties. And then turn it. And now it should be almost ready to connect. Has to go down to 30 feet though. And I cannot hairpin out of this, so I need to lower it again. Huh. How am I gonna deal with this? I'll tell you what's smart. Hairpin, hairpin, hairpin. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, not the, not the triple hairpin. This one's just to uh, rattle them up a little bit. To give them a little, oh, ow. <laughs> God, that looks fast. Can I test this thing? I want to see what kind of cheese we get at the end there. It goes, oh, ow. <laughs> okay, let's, uh, the entrance would be here, exit would be here. Okay, now I want to, I want to see a test. I want to see the test of this. 
<laughs> we might as well. We might as well. Hey, Haka, what's up? It's it's Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. Classic. We can put brakes. Uh, we can put brakes in here, maybe. <laughs> I think it's going to be way too much. Yo, the vertical G's, lateral G's, all good now. Let's see. I'm switching. If we see red, that means no good. Red equals dead. Broken necks, no good. Oh, it's not tracking with the coaster anymore. Oh, the lateral G's. Big G's, you guys. Big G's. Okay, I'm looking at that speed. Yep, we should be able to just put in brakes and it'll be done. Some brakes and then hopefully it can like figure out how to... <laughs> hopefully that little, that little curve will be all good. We'll see. Cut out these and let's put in... I don't know what kind of brakes we want because I don't really normally put these in here. We've got block brakes, which gives me a... Oh, block brake. Does that just slow it down to nothing? I feel like these just stop it. Because the other ones have, like, a speed? The speed limit for brakes. Yeah, let's... I guess put one. Let's see if that works. I, I don't actually know how these brakes work. Yeah, testy, testy. <laughs> don't be testy with me. You're a madman. Madness! No, no, no. I'm not a madman. You are. That tells you what kind of coasters can he build. I don't really, I don't really use these. What kind are there? To be honest, whenever I play this game as a kid, I would often uh, just use the pre-made, the pre-made coasters. Not gonna lie, it's shameful business, but I did generally just um, use the pre-built coasters. Also, to be fair, I think that we have too many stations. I, I, I don't think that we're, ever, we're not even gonna get close to having this mini in rotation. Okay, the lateral G's are now good. It is it is just that one that one break does it. The one break does it for sure. Uh but I guess I can like I could remove some of these. I don't know. I mean this'll this'll work. This'll function. I'd say that this is at least a five dollar ride, but so I think I'm gonna set it to six bucks. Six bucks, dude! Alright. Let's make some entrance exits. The bonus fry gets its inaugural, its inaugural opening. A nice twisty path. Twisties. All right, open it up. It's open to the public. And I just got to name it the bonus fry. <laughs> the bonus fry. <laughs> there we go. The bonus fry. It should be good. People should love it. It's high, very high intensity. Medium nausea. Oh, dear. Intense, you say. Puke master, you say. Well, at least we've got fries. I'll put some fries right at the exit. Do I have a fry stand? Please tell me I have fries. No, no fries. Oh, wait. No, there it is. That just fries really ugly and tan. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like a tan fry. He looks skin colored. Skin colored fries. Trust me, they're safe. Hey, right, there we go. Nice. Your computer is glitching and keeps you disconnecting you from Twitch. Oh no. What are you doing, Twitch? I'm pretty proud of this park. These children need to stop screaming, though. We made some pretty cool coasters, I'd say. This log plume is about as boring as it gets. It's literally just a loop. It's a loop and it turns around and that's it. But I don't, I don't know what you're supposed to do with a flume. I guess you can make it have like a satisfying twists and turns, I suppose. But it's always going to be a slow ride. Are people still riding this one? People still riding this coaster? I see, I see almost a full, almost a full set of people. Let's take a look at people's thoughts. What, what are they thinking about my rides? My... I feel sick. I'm running out of cash. I'm not thirsty. Clean and tidy. Want to go home. Professor Lupin is great. Good value. Good value. Okay, the roto drops are a little too cheap, I think. And that line might be a little too long because there's no way that that's going to fill up. I'm going to set this to like four bucks. I'm going to double the price. We're doubling it. Oh, this one's already four. Oh, oh, it just does the same price across the park for the similar rides. Good, good. Um... 
Okay, so I'm pretty sure that we've already failed the scenario. But we're getting we're getting really close to failing it. We're almost there. Failure is imminent. Let's do another um Let's get some more peeps in this park. I'm gonna do some advert advertisement. Let's advertise uh for one, we'll say campaign for the park. Two weeks. We'll do uh vouchers for free food or drink. Let's see. They can have some free fries for the opening of our new ride. And I'm going to advertise the Professor Lupin. I want more people to ride on that. I don't see a lot of people there. Maybe it's maybe it's a bit expensive. Maybe we could adjust it. Maybe I'll set it to nine bucks. I might be uh, might be kind of reaching into their pockets a little bit with this one. Yeah, we'll lower the price. You know, it's an affordable ride. It's affordable. What are you people talking about? All right, we got peeps. We got peeps coming in. Are they getting stuck in these areas? I don't. I don't see them getting stuck. That's good. Hopefully the pathing AI is better. Let's see. Can I make this more efficient? By lift chain speed, we'll boost that. Wait for full load. Uh, I don't think that we can um, make this any faster than it already is. I think we're already looking at max speed for loading these suckers in. Cool, cool. All right. I think we might build... Um, maybe we will build another coaster. What do you say? What do you say we build another coaster? I want to... Something that I really want to do is mix the coasters in betwixt one another. I want... I want them to, like, either go through one another or underneath or around or something. I want it to look like an interlocking... Uh, maze of, of carts. I could put another coaster next to this one. There's definitely some spots to get through there. The This one might be a little foolproof. I'd have to go over the haunted house, I'd think. And I, I kind of like how this coaster looks. I, I like its compact design. Maybe a coaster that goes out and through this bit. Let's see what types of coasters that we have available. Because there's definitely some really, really neat coasters that I don't have access to yet. Steeplechase, that's new. Uh, it's a track. Uh, it's a roller coaster where the riders sit above the... Tra oh, we just got a new one. Compact inverted coaster. Dude. Dude, this is exactly what I want. This is the one that does the reverse launches that I wanted that I couldn't do with the other one. Maybe, maybe this one won't be glitched. Ooh, let's try to build another one. Let's try to... Let's... Oh, dang it. Yeah, let's let's try to build one of the cool like uh, shuttle launch loops. I couldn't get the other one to work. I think it was bugged. But maybe maybe the compact one will do it. Maybe it's just gotta be small. If it's small, then it works. We can build. Uh, I believe. Oh, they got corkscrews too. That is awesome. Station. Dang it! <laughs> Keep clicking the wrong button. Station platform needs to go this way. And uh, it should be good without um, bonus fry is in the way. Ow! How much room do I? Oops. Okay. Well, maybe, maybe we gotta build it a little further out here. Yeah, that'll make the entrances and exits a mess, though. Can I build it here? I can underneath this. Okay. Well, we'll just start it here. I want to see if it's even possible to do a shuttle launch or if it's just straight up glitch. I'm not sure. But it can go straight up pretty quick. Oh my god, it can go literally straight up. <laughs> Suffer. <laughs> Suffer! Call this one the T pose. I wonder how fast you can launch it. <laughs> I want to see. Yeah, that's not going to work. Yeah, that stops right there. I need to... Um, let's see if I can change it to... Reverse incline launch sh shuttle mode. And I'll see if it lets me see the test. It might still be bugged. Let's see. Launch. No, oh, no. Oh, no. Don't go that way. Oh, now it goes forward? What's going on? I see no launch. Where's my delicious launch? It's just bouncing around. Reverse incline. Where's the... What's the launch? Lift, tail, chain speed, number of circuits, blah, blah, blah. Let me see. Continuous circuit. 
I, I, I don't know how to freaking do these launches, you guys. Reverse incline. You think it's backwards? Might be. I mean, it does say reverse incline. So maybe, maybe it goes up and then forward? I don't know. Yeah, this does look like murder. It would just launch them straight up and to, uh, but they get to fly all the way to heaven, dude. Fly to heaven on this coaster. This coaster sends you to heaven. Uh, you find it funny that the ride's waiting to go in the station. One of the cars will be bouncing. I didn't notice that. It goes, boy, 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 boy. I'll tell you what, though. What if we just create a normal coaster? Okay, let's see. We need a station. So we should be able to build it starting here. Maybe we just build a reversing coaster. Let's see. If it's reversing, you can only have one car. Reverse incline. Hmm. I still don't quite understand how this works, but I can use a chain lift. But you can't chain lift straight up. That's too bad. Maybe I need to study these these carts. Maybe I need to study the uh, the art of the blade. Let me take a look at what these other coasters look like. Because they have to be using the reverse shuttle. But yeah, okay. Well, we'll look at this. So this looks like it goes forward. Okay, I understand now, I think. I think that the way that this works is that you get shot up and then it goes all the way back. So maybe it does shoot backwards and then you go forwards. I can't quite tell which direction it goes though. Yeah, maybe, maybe it only launches backwards. That ride sends people to the moon. Exactly, it's the one way to get up there. Maybe we build one and watch how it works. But I kind of wanted to build everything custom. That fits rather nicely, though. Mm. Mm. Oh, hi there, Bohemian Moon. It's good to see you. I just saw you. I saw your messages, but I but I didn't see the name. Oi, oi, oi! Your boy's back with the popcorn. Nice popcorn time. Let's maybe we build a one of these spiraling coasters. I've never made these before, and they spiral upward. Uh, they can spiral upward as a chain lift, which is a unique, that's a unique property of this ride. Now, if we want to tie this together with the bonus fry, we might be able to pierce through here and come around. So maybe we build this a little late. Let's see. I very much hope that your employees have good health insurance that covers therapy. What? Nobody has died. Not yet. The Earl's guests be like, ah, <laughs> no, nobody's died. Everyone lived. Number one, the most dangerous park in all of roller coaster history is Earl's Land. 17 people have died. Maybe not in the way that you think. There was a pit in the middle of the park where people would get trapped, starving them. Many dead bodies were found years later. Skeletons. Let's see. That was a fun ride. <laughs> that was a fun ride. Bleh. <laughs> oh no. Don't make me laugh. I'm not evil. Um let me see. Hey. Wait, what? Where's my where's my chain lift? How do we do chain lift? Curved lift hill. Okay, so they're their own little thing, eh? And it goes up very, very slowly. It goes left, right. Oh, I see. Number one. Earl, Earl killed everyone. <laughs> I guarantee you this, this ride is safe for the entire family. The entire family will love Earl Land. Earl Land has thrills and chills for children of all ages. And adults, too. We've got alcoholic beverages for mom and dad so that those little brats won't bother you too much. Let's go back up. Here we go. <laughs> uh, let's, let's turn on the tester. I want to see this thing roll. This might be a little slow, though. Number 15, the bathroom, which was to pay to enter. You also had to pay to exit. So many guests were unable to leave, leading to death. <laughs> 
<laughs> you have to pay to leave the bathroom so they're just like no 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 you gotta you gotta trade with people in there maybe maybe they could like trade their pocket watches and stuff to other people that brought more money come on man i gotta get out of here i have kids man oh i should have thought of that before you went into the most expensive bathroom in america i wonder how sh how sharply can we go back up that, uh, that's that's lift that's as high as the other side that won't work right you guys, can you explain momentum to me one more time? How many people do you know that have pocket watches? I meant wristwatches. <laughs> I meant wristwatches. Momentum. How does it work? Uh, looks like it works. <laughs> it's not a matter of how, it's if and when it works. Uh, I don't know how that works. I don't understand, but I'm not a physics major. Not yet, anyway. But this is some major physics, either way. Let's see. Can I thread through the fry? Because I want I want to make this park interconnected. Oh, no. <laughs> Let me see. It needs to be lower. We've got to go down. Maybe we make another sharp drop. I like these people's necks to be in a little bit of pain, you know? You know what I mean, string bean? Let's see. Then it <laughs> runs into the other coaster, killing everyone. Exciting. And then, can we bank them? Banking. I've been banking on this all day. I've been banking with Wells Fargo ever since I was 12 years old. Uh, um, um, actually, let's, let's see how this interacts, eh? I can't believe that that works. I can't believe it's not a real roller coaster. I, uh, do they have boosters here? They've all, <laughs> we got brakes. And we would have to do another spiral. So maybe I will build maximum height that I can with the momentum afforded to me. And then down we go into the depths of heck. Yeah, in fact, I'm just going to build it high so that I can test where the momentum leads. Big brain moment. One large brain, please. <laughs> Oh my god, that would almost fly off the edge. I think that that might kill them. We may have some dead beans on our hands. And down we go. Down we go where the right ends. No one knows. Okay, that is schmoovin', y'all. That might be too many. That might be too many Gs. That might be one broken neck per customer. Roto drop is broken down. Great. Great, that's just what I needed. Let's go down one more right here. And we're gonna try to spin it on the hand. Hang on. We gotta go forward one more. One more? Can that smooth out? <laughs> does that work? <laughs> that doesn't look like that doesn't look like it should work, but it does. Top ten roller coaster two tricks that you wouldn't think work that actually do. Uh, this might also have some issues with the uh, nausea rating. We might have a little bit of... Let's see. Here goes the boats. This is such a strange ride. Is there enough momentum? Bless my soul there is. Oh, it really slows down there. I bet that this is a fine ride. This looks great. This looks great. I think it's going to work good. Okay. We're going to build the entrance on this side. Exit on that side. I see some puke over here. Who's been puking? We need more handyman. Handyman, handyman. Get your buns over here. Get your two handy buns over here. All right. Let's build. Some business. How many um guests do we have? A thousand almost? We're getting there. We're getting there. There we go. And the ride is... Oh, we need to test it first. Let's let let's see what the stats look like, shall we? If the coaster has enough Gs, all the passengers will pass out and they won't get sick. Oh, I see. So your stomach will go to bed. 
your stomach will go to sleep, and then whenever you wake up, your stomach wakes up, and it's all good. I see. I I, I get how that works. Just just knock them out. Everyone's gonna be out cold. Remember, you actually beat one of the six flag sparks. Oh, one of the the campaign scenarios. I'm checking them. Th this should be good. I mean, it goes relatively slow. It's kind of a silly ride. I like it. I like it. I like making these custom coasters that like use a lot of the momentum. That's pretty fun. I think I'm gonna set this maybe to six bucks. I bet we could get away with that. This is a good ride. It's a good ride. I'd pay six bucks to ride on this. Just kidding. Uh, looks looks good. Wait for full load. Uh, can I adjust? I can't adjust the speed of the spiral, unfortunately. Excitement rating is no. <laughs> the excitement rating is high, which is which is good. Excitement is good. Intensity is the concern. Intensity is medium, and it's got low nausea. It's un it's been rated unpukable by the board of uh, the board of directors. <laughs> Remember that six bucks in two thousand one money. Oh what? Two thousand and one money. I don't I don't have my calculator. Can somebody calculate the inflation between 2001 and uh, now? How much? How much is six bucks worth now? I bet that it's worth uh, eight dollars. I bet that that's eight dollars. How much is inflation? We don't know. When the intensity and nausea rating are in red, that's a problem. Well, I mean, also people. I think they're more popular if they're exciting but not too intense. Because everybody has. If I'm not. Oh, people can't get to this Ferris wheel. I broke it. Whoops. When did that happen? Not that people love the roller coaster, or the, the Ferris wheel or anything, but. What? What? Is it closed? Testing? What am I looking at? Oh, I'm looking at the spiral coaster. Dang it. Oops. What about this thing? Why, why, why do I see no entrance? What's, uh, what's going on here? Uh, nobody's allowed. <laughs> it's closed. This ride is closed. I guess. What's what's the dealio here? What's busted? What happened? Okay, well, it's working now. I want it to point the other way. I need this to rotate. Let's see. How do I how do I make it go exactly how I want it? I want it to go this way. Don't don't turn like that. Delete this. Delete that path. There we go. Now that should work. Okay. All right. People can actually give me money now. Good, good, good. I, I need to check around this park to make sure everything isn't broken. You're currently installing a Roller Coaster Tycoon 3 on Steam while you're watching? Ooh, tell me how you like it. I don't like that game. Bye-bye. I'm going to go to bed now because school starts and I'm starting to get stressed. Uh, and I'm too stressed to fall asleep earlier, earlier and it'll literally take hours to fall asleep. Oh, no. I'm sorry to hear that. Human person, get some rest. I hope that you fall asleep real quick. I hope you fall asleep real quick, my friend. Good luck. Good luck with the sleepies. I'm sorry that you're all stressed out. Let me see. <laughs> you just picked up Roller Coaster Tycoon today because I love graphs! Me too. Stats, graphs, uh, it's my favorite stuff. I have been, uh, I'm currently making a YouTube video about um, rating and rating and ranking every Batman movie that's ever been made and I have already run into a bunch of scenarios where I'm like this should be a stat I should make it a stat every time that this happens in a movie I should make it a stat every time that Batman says something like this or this theme shows up I I want it to be stats man I want to have I want to have the numbers I want to have a graph going the Joker started doing this on this movie and it's been copied ever since i'm trying to think of a good way to kind of mix these mix them betwixt, betwixt one another maybe i will make the supports the same now that just looks dumb i should make the supports specifically different on purpose it could be blue but yes stats are very fun orange that's or orang is disgusting I guess blue's not too bad. Maybe white for the coaster. That hurts my eyes. I love it. Uh, 
Maybe the other way around? I'm making some janky, some janky color decisions, you guys. This is just a black and white ride. <laughs> but the cars, cars could be uh, perky, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I'm coming up with all this on the floor. That looks disgusting. <laughs> I hate it. I was laughing when I put in the miniature railway raid and Tinder was bouncing. Oh, bouncing about the bouncy cars. We can make this the lean green bean machine. This is called the, the green bean. There you go. Looks perfect. The green bean. It's the more healthy alternative to the, to the bonus fry. This one's the green bean. This is what healthy people ride. Wait, what? Is there math in the chat? Oh, no. <laughs> okay, I will not add math in the chat in the future. What happened? Did I miss it? Oh, there it is. Oh, thank you. Thank you, One Topic. I just missed it. Um, $6 in 1999 is equivalent to purchasing power of about $10. An increase of $4 in 23 years. The dollar had an average inflation rate of 2% per year. That is unhinged. That is unhinged. 2% per year. My goodness. I wonder what the average earnings on the stock market are. Do, do you have to put money in the stock market just to keep up with inflation? Holy moly. I know that the index is raised like an average of maybe 20% or less. I, I think it might be 15. It did just cut 2% off of that because inflation. Holy moly. That is, that is absolute madness. <laughs> I am disturbed. Uh, color me disturbed. 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 You have, you have destroyed my, you've destroyed my confidence. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you for the information. Oh my God. I have $27,000. We could literally build like anything right now. Um, we could build something super interesting. There's a nice spot right here that we could tie another coaster together if we wanted to. Guests are complaining about the state of the park. Check whether your handyman, uh, what? Where are my handyman out? Hey, do I just need more? I guess people are whining about the park. If you don't keep your park clean, there's a couple of bad things that can happen. Uh, one of the things is that people will start vandalizing. And uh, hiring security guards is kind of just a band-aid fix. It isn't actually very helpful. Much better to just have more handymen and keep it nice and clean because you're already working on it. Okay, let's close that. Wow, I ran off to do adult things and I came back to a neat looking park. Hey, I'm glad that you're liking it. We've got the green bean. We've got the bonus fry. We got the bumblebee. The bumblebee is pretty cool. It looks like it looks like it's got two eyeballs or wings right here. You'd vandalize my park? Oh, thank you, Alchemic. Thank you. That's very sweet of you to say. Very, very sweet. Um, maybe we build a third ghoster in like this, the center? Let's see. Maybe we build a couple of normal rides. Do we have any? Anything for the normies? This is new. Top spin. I bet you this makes people nice and sick. Glad to see it now. Uh, Maybe we built new vehicle is available. I don't want vehicles. What kind of research are y'all doing? Uh, didn't really get any new. Oh, we could make a circus. Circus for all you clowns out there. This one's broke. If Alchemic isn't chatting, I assume that he's playing Cookie Run. I think that's a pretty good call. <laughs> Looks like guests don't like the Ferris wheel. I think that we will delete the Ferris wheel because I'm pretty sure that there is something in the game code that makes it so that newer rides are more popular, which kind of makes sense. I think that it works like that in real life, where like people, people come to parks for new rides. Okay. So doing circus show. I thought that it said doing circus now. Watch this. I'm going to del- Oh, it's closed, dude. It says it's rotating, but I don't see any rotation. Delete. We're going to delete that Ferris wheel and we're making a new one. People don't even like Ferris wheels these days. Kids these days don't even like Ferris wheels. When I was a child, all I wanted to do was go on a big old wheel. 
it was really exciting. You're guessing... <laughs> I am guessing the circus is where we'd find Ops. Uh-huh. Head clown. Head clown of the circus is Ops. Let's see. Are there Ops colors that we can make this? What are Ops colors? I guess blue? Uh, maybe, maybe a light blue. Are those Ops colors? <laughs> light blue and blue. <laughs> Uh, I just chance the ride color and add scenery to make the ride more appealing. Ah, a visual appeal. I see. I don't know how to do, um... I know that you can build scenery, but I, I don't know how to do it, actually. There's a button somewhere. Oh, I just closed it accidentally. Sorry for kicking you guys out. Hope you enjoyed the ride. Uh, yeah, I think that you can build scenery within the ride, but I'm just gonna leave it. You just, I just read your video description for what? <laughs> oh, you're playing Spirit Farrier. Ooh, tell me what you think about it. Tell me what you think. I have not played it yet. Maybe it's time to build a mega coaster. We've got a lot of room over. Is that a duck? What's this? I think there's a duck over there. Um, maybe it's time to build. This is actually a freaking massive coaster. Maybe it's time to build a coaster out here. Oh, coaster to the edge. And I'm about to break. Shut up when I'm talking to you. <laughs> oh, we could also, we could incorporate this thing into a roller coaster too. Maybe, maybe a curve around it. Like it's a little necklace. Maybe, maybe this needs a necklace. It needs some, some dirt. Uh, might be a little tough to fit in. Might be easier here. You like it? It has a lot of time management stuff, which keeps, which, which keeps your goblin brain busy. <laughs> goblin brain? I wouldn't know anything about that. I've got a normal human brain. Totally normal. Totally human. Maybe we should build a coaster that we could charge $20 for. Something that's so long and so thrilling that you can't help but give me all of your money. Uh, we have $31,000. Maybe it's time to build the most epic coaster ever. I just want to look at what we got. Mini, just make it out of a mini. Oof. No, no mini roller coasters. We could build it out of wood, but wooden supports are kind of ridiculous. And this is going to be a long coaster. I think that this is good. A mine ride. Mine rides are pretty neato looking. Maybe we'll make this. Trying to think about how to like make sure that people can get into here. I guess I can build it out here, and I just have to make sure that two, two uh, that it's got two blocks. So one block here, one block there, and then it can go forward. Uh, <laughs> you have a special friend coming over tonight. We are going to watch all four Matrix movies. Not sure how we'll do that, as there is only one, but I shall try. What? Four movies in a row? That sounds like a nightmare. That doesn't sound fun. When building mine rides, you always have to elevate the station since the roller coaster can't have lift hills. What? It can't have lift hills? Thank you for telling me. I am not using this. Appreciated. <laughs> Muchly appreciated. That's a no-go. We need lift hills on this one because it's going to be big. Maybe a mini suspended roller coaster. I don't like the word mini. That makes me scared, dude. Also, from what I hear, the only only the first Matrix is good, like mini movies. Ooh, I I would agree with that. I would agree with that, Random Barry. I personally do not like because the design includes scenery with that's unavailable. Interesting. Okay. I personally only like the first one, but I haven't seen the second or third. I don't know if I want to use my time on something like that. You know, I mean, I'm a time waster, but we all have our limits, right? We all got our own limits on how much time we want to waste. <laughs> I kind of want to do the mini suspended coaster because it looks so cool, dude. Don't bother Kenny. <laughs> don't bother Kenny. He's building roller coasters. Um, but I, I know that people like him. I know that some people like them. Maybe, maybe they are good in the end. Okay, I'm gonna build some big station. I wonder how big it can get. How many cars? I think that they're individual. 
All right, time for the big ride. Yahoo! Oh, that's as high as he goes. Ooh, I don't know if I can use this. I don't know. I kind of wanted it to go really high. I want it to go high. I guess we're going to keep... I guess we're going to keep... Trying out these coasters till I find the right one. I don't know how all of these function. A looping roller coaster is probably good. Because it could probably go very high. But what we really need is a steel coaster. Or something like that. A cheap and easy way to build a coaster. But with limited height. Yeah, what does it say about this? It doesn't say anything about the height there. It's too bad. Uh, can I just research roller coasters then? They're researching haunted houses. Let's let's research roller coasters and let's up this funding. Maximum funding. There we go. Earl, you can still have the safest park if no one dies in the park. Have the coaster launch outside the fence? What? You can still have the safest park if no one dies in the park. What topic? I am I am I am frightened by this. Are you are you trying to mean me? Are you trying to ruin my perfectly good park? If you just launch people off of the map? That's horrible. I won't do it. I won't do it. From the very beginning I said that this was gonna be a wholesome park, darn it. It's gonna be a wholesome park. Yeah, but killing people in the park is what makes it fun! What? <laughs> Nobody, no crime. I have seen somebody, I think it was Video Game Donkey, that made a park that just had a long path that people walked onto, and then it had a looping coaster that just launched a car and just bulldozed all the people. But they, uh, they like, they had physics and everything, and they just bounced around until they picked themselves up. Okay, whatever. Don't kill people, then see if I come to your park. <laughs> One topic's looking for drama. I only want to go to a park that has some controversy. Oh, see, you are a controversial online figure, so I'm not I'm not too surprised that you're always looking for the drama. You normally find it. You normally find it. I'm sorry if this isn't the place for you. Maybe maybe go back to Twitter or Reddit? That's pro that's probably where the danger lies, my friend. Uh we could try a looping coaster. That's probably the best coaster that I've got besides a wooden one. Uh, how long does it take to research stuff? Because I really want like a steel coaster. I like haunted houses, Earl. Make realistic haunted houses. Look, this, it's we're completing the design, all right? We're doing the research. But I, I've put, I've, do you know how much of my capital that I've poured into this park? How much blood? Not any sweat or tears, but how much blood I've poured into this project? Look. Oh, wait. We actually already, actually, we already have it. Actually, we just got it. Uh. <laughs> oh, sorry. Mobile delay. Didn't realize that you were asking me to leave. Ha <laughs> ha. Already you still know. OT. OT, I guess you can stay. <laughs> I've got... I don't think that I can build a bigger haunted house ride for you. But OT, look. There's already a mighty haunted house ride right here. Look, it's just a haunted mansion. Is this not big enough for you? Do I need to make a mightier... A mightier display of fear? I mean, I could, I, look, I could build a little haunted house. It's a, it, they call it a spine tingler. It's been, it's been rated and reviewed by the Board of Education as a spine tingler. Or at least that's what I've been told. Let's, here, look. I'll, I'll put it, I'll just put it down, okay? <laughs> here, let's, let's tingle some spines, shall we? I want to put down a path. Oh, it's raining. Get the umbrellas. Kids, get in the car. We're going home. Dad forgot the umbrella. Oh, wait. Maybe we can buy one. Ah, I see. It is It is merely $20. <laughs> it is merely $20 for a balloon. What a deal. There we go. Look, the spookiest house you've ever seen. No, no. I'm sorry. I meant by crashing your coasters, you'd be making ghosts. I'm not actually telling you how to run your park. <laughs> I'm telling you to kill your guests. <laughs> kill your guests. Harvest their souls as entertainment purposes for others. I mean, that is wholesome in a way. I do like that. I do want to I do want to entertain. I live to entertain and if this is what the people want, it's what the people get. This this coaster is pretty good though. 
maybe I should use this style of coaster because this worked great. This was a looping coaster. Hmm. Trying to get some plans over here. Maybe, maybe we loop out, go all the way around. 30, we do have... Kill the guest, kill the guest, put our service to the test. <laughs> kill our guest, kill our guest, put the rollers to the test. Launch them off the property and then you know the rest. <laughs> kill the marsh, what a loss, here we go, it's a sauce. It's a different song. Uh, no one wants death, so I'm sorry, Earl. <laughs> I'm sorry, Earl. It appears that your friends are the most concerning people. Anonymous! What is that? What is that? Thank you for the huge... 5,000 bits! Good mamma mia. Oh, what? Are you the anonymous person, Alchemic? Are you admitting it now? Your song earned you 5k bits? Or is that a different person? <laughs> anonymous, whoever you are, thank you for the 5,000 bits. Alchemic was just commenting on it. The song earned you 5,000 bits. <laughs> I super appreciate it. Thank you, Anonymous. Can I put some hype in the chat? <laughs> Big bits. <Whoa. laughs> Mamma mia. I need to sing more often. Jeepers. Uh, what was I going to do? I was trying to consider roller coasters. I, I don't feel like it is smart to... Uh... I want to make... I'm gonna make a roller coaster that goes across the entire property, but I can't imagine that that is going to be worth the construction costs. I can't imagine that that is a smart idea. That seems like a very stupid idea. And uh, there's no way in heck I'm making my money back on that. But you know what? In the roller in the roller coaster park business, sometimes you've got to take risks, and those risks look like capital being thrown out the window. We're going to start it right here. This is how it begins. We're going to need a lot of trains. I might have to make adjustments to this in a little bit. Um, I like that they stay anonymous because it drives him nuts. Ha! Excuse me? Why? Why do you love my ping? Why? Why? I just want to know who to thank. <laughs> That's the problem. I want to know who I'm supposed to thank. But they're anonymous. There's no way for me to thank them. <laughs> uh, chain lift, chain lift. All right, all right. Uh, pretty sure he can check on PayPal. I can, Alk, but that's not PayPal. <laughs> if it's done through Twitch, then it's actually anonymous. And there's literally, literally no way to know. There is absolutely no way to find that out. <laughs> So it's a, it's a foolproof strategy of keeping me in the dark. There's no way for me to find out who that is. Ooh, long curve. <laughs> There's nothing he could do except suffer. <laughs> I mean, true. Let's see. Okay, so I want to build up some speed, y'all. I want to build up some speed and maybe, ooh, what if we made a boosted section up here above the trees? Wait a second. I'm going to let it slide a little bit. I want this thing to be testing while I'm running it. Because this hill is going to take a while. Okay, so we got that. Let's see. Julian had an incident a couple of weeks ago when he was able to find out. You can on PayPal. If somebody donates. If somebody donates, you can see that. But uh, I don't believe that bits can be handled like that. Uh, I believe that you never get that information, no matter what. <laughs> Boosters! Can I just make, like, a super flat part of this ride? This could be the flat part, and then it loops a little bit later. Like, this is the loop section where it just goes, Whoa, whoa, whoa! That doesn't even boost it! I feel like the boosters don't go faster than just general momentum. I feel like the momentum is, like, the best thing that, that happens. Like, just... Just general... General momentum is as good as a booster. And a booster is just for keeping it, like, up to that speed, I think. 
I do like that spin. I think I'm gonna make a loop in here. Yeah, we'll have we'll have a downward. Oh, that's sweet, dude. Heck yeah. Heck yeah, heels, bro. Nyom, nyom. Zoom. Sweet. We definitely need to go underground at some point. We gotta go underground. You don't have to. Do, what? You don't have to in chat to gift a sub? I wonder if you have to be in chat to do bits. I don't know. But you can also be in chat anonymously. Uh, I believe that there's a way to block it. You do have to be in somebody's chat to give bits. Oh my gosh. Now, see, now, now who's obsessed with it, eh? Y'all are like, hey, 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 Kenny is, Kenny is suffering now. But now who's doing the investigating? Hmm. Hmm. Who is it now? Not me. <laughs> Everybody's trying to figure it out. Here we go. If Annan wants to be anonymous, then I'm happy for them. We don't know all their reasoning. I appreciate them no matter what. If they want to be anonymous, leave them alone. What do we call this ride? Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. It's got to be something that uh, maybe we could call it the Odyssey. Because it's a long book. The ride's a long book. The Odyssey's not a long book. It's it's just a... Uh, I don't know. It's like a reference. I don't like this curve here. This makes me upset. This makes me upset. And I'm going to stop it right now. It must be stopped. Turn off that chain. Chain. Is that not quite right? Okay, we gotta make it up to... Let's see... We gotta make it up to 95? Above 95? Slow curve? It should work, I think. Uh-oh. Actually, that might work. Let's see. Yeah, that connects, I think. I think that works. I think that that is good. Now, let's see how much speed we get out of here. <laughs> Not even really going that fast. I bet it feels fast, though. Ooh, lots of, lots of speed out of there. Now I think I'm gonna make it just go straight back down and we'll do some, we'll do some speed bumps. Speed bump time. Actually, we could maybe do a loop. Yeah, let's make a loop in here. First loop. First loop, first loop. Can we like bank out of a loop? That'd be pretty sweet. And what's like the widest curve that I can make? Whoa, that is very cool. But if you do it that wide, you can't go downward. I kind of want it. So can I make diagonal track? What? Diagonal track. That's awesome. <laughs> you could still like go up and down and everything on a diagonal track. That's very cool. Yeah, looks like diagonal track works in all the normal ways. Ooh, right on the water's edge. Yeah, that, that kind of hurts my eyeballs. <laughs> it hurts my eyeballs to see things looking diagonal. We're going to need to get back to normal real quick. Here we go. Up should AG. Yum. All right. In fact, I think that... Let's see how much speed we have at this point, and we might do another incline. Another, another normal incline. Do-do-do. Do-do-do-do-do. One. Yeah. Let's see. You're afraid that co of coasters that go over the water? I mean, to be honest, it doesn't matter at a super high speed, but there is more chance that you'll survive a uh, collision with the water. I mean, there is just, it, there's just more of a chance. It is, yeah, it is a slightly softer landing. Are you going to survive it? Probably not. But it is certainly softer. Better chance of drowning, too! Well, yeah, if you can't swim. 
but everyone can swim. Ha ha ha. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. It, see, the diagonal thing is making it so confusing to tell, like, how high the ride is. I love it. What if you can't get out of the seat? That's true. That's true. I mean, uh, I guess, yeah, if it crashes. I wonder what the likelihood of a derailment versus you falling out of a seat. Because I know that there are restraint errors. And honestly, that's what I think of. Whenever I think of a real roller coaster accident, I normally think of somebody falling out of the seat. Because I, I believe, possibly without any basis, that that is more common. Dead either way? Depends on how fast the coaster's going. Unfortunately, that lady did die on that roller coaster that we just mentioned earlier. Uh, maybe we should start bringing it up. Nah, if you hit the water going 70, you'll definitely knock yourself out and drown. Yeah, I mean, at a certain speed, you will get knocked out and drown. Or you will get, you know, just killed. Like, you'll just die if you hit something too hard. Twister roller coaster. Ooh, I hope that's not a good coaster. Though. All right, here we go. Yahoo! How much speed do we have? Imagine if every roller coaster had an eject button. <laughs> How many people would hit it? Imagine a world where every roller coaster had an eject button. I'm gonna do it, Mary, I swear! But everyone had a parachute. Take your life into your own hands in the new exciting film. Uh... I don't know. <laughs> I'm trying to think of a name of that movie. What would it be? It would be called like a uh, parachute of death. Of doom. All right. Oh my gosh. This takes forever to test this thing. I just want to test my momentum. I just want to test how high it goes before I need to put a chain on it. Ooh, we could go into this mountain. We could go into the mountain. We have, we have plenty of money. We got $35,000, which is not at all enough to build an actual roller coaster, but that's all right. This is an all day roller coaster ride, exactly. All right, back we go a little bit. We'll, we'll put the chain on it right there. That ought, to, that ought to catch it. Back up to 100. 100. Oh gosh. And then it goes zoom. <laughs> zoom. I wish that this one had corkscrews, though. That's that's another reason why I'm not too hyped about using this coaster, because it doesn't have corkscrews. It doesn't have helixes, though. What are those? It, that's just a... I'm pretty sure that that's just a full, full loop. Yeah. Yeah, it's just these. Yeah, there are corkscrew rides, but I do not have them unlocked at the moment, unfortunately. Maybe we will make this uh, weave back into the park out of this curve. Curvy. Yeah, let's go straight down one more time. This. And then flat. Then we're going to curve it inward and go upward. Oh, where'd my, where'd my banking go? Where's my bank? There it is. Ooh, I like that. I wish that you could keep it banked like the entire time, but I'm yeah, I'm pretty sure that you have to put a you have to put a curve on it if you do that, I think. No? Can you keep it banked? It 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 wants to turn. But I wanna see if I can force it to be just banked. <laughs> just a sideways coaster where you just everybody loses their glasses. <laughs> Is this possible? Is this legal? Also, I don't think this is enough speed anymore. I might, I might have to... I might have to lower this down. This goes up to 115 and this is only 105. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Go back a couple. 105 is still gonna mess it up. <laughs> this... <laughs> this is not going to happen. Alright, but it does grab there. That's good. I want it to be boosted. I just want it to be so fast. Yum. I do think that we can turn this into a curve up, though. Instead of a glow up. 
Burl had a curve up. Ooh, no chance. No chance. Doot, doot, doot. <laughs> That's way too high. <laughs> Dang it. I don't, don't, I don't believe Kareem. Oh, wait. they didn't say what to do if it didn't work. There was no rules. We could make this higher though. Cause I kind of want to get, I like this weird uncomfortable loop. It does look very awkward. It makes me happy. Ooh, we can maybe make another loop to loop here. I want to see where that, where's that test coaster at? Get over here, young man. I want to see what happened. Weird diagonal ride can't hurt you. Actually, it can. Here it goes. The green bean is broken down. Not the green bean. Curry. Hey, Curry's here. Hello. Curry, look. I made a ride that doesn't work. Yay. <laughs> Yay. Non working ride. Curry. How are you doing? Hello. Hello, Curry. Julie. Let's see. Uh, how, do, how do I. How do I do? <laughs> Uh, I wanna, maybe we don't make it a hairpin turn. Ouch! Owie! Julie! <laughs> oh, we could go, we could do a downward spiral. Wait a second. Upward spiral turns into a downward spiral. Faster than you can blink. Yeah, what if I kept it curved to the side, but I flattened it out, and then I went down with the curve. Instead of down with the sickness, Earl was down with the curve. Bell curve? I don't believe in it. Um, maybe we bank straight out. Hmm, how much speed would one get out of this loop? Out of this loop? How are you doing today, Kuri? I hope you are having a most pleasant Tuesday. A most pleasant Tuesday indeed. I woke up very late, and I immediately thought only of roller coasters. My mind went straight to my my beloved pastime, roller coasting tycoon. Hey, let's build another loopy loop here if we can, if we can do it. Oh yes, oh yes. Also, this ride is getting obscenely long. <laughs> I like it. We could call this one the toilet bowl too, because it's got a couple of toilet bowls in it. Flushed, hashtag flushed. Okay, but hear me out. Zoo Tycoon. That game is so much more boring than this one. When you say you woke up late, is that like 4 p.m.? No. <laughs> I think I got up at two. <laughs> That's one big snake. That's true. Yes, but you can kill all your guests. Yeah, isn't there a version of Zoo Tycoon where you can like, where you're supposed to like shoot darts at animals that get loose? Like you have to take care of the animal control side of things too. And you can try to shoot your guests. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. So much stuff is breaking down. Maybe I need a, a better inspection schedule. Nyom. 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 And then everyone dies. <laughs> okay, so it can go up to here and then a chain. Just a tiny bit higher. Just a, you know, stuff that 120. Maybe we should reach max height over here. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> expensive. I'm a man of expensive tastes. What can I say? Then it goes. And then. Whoa, and sadness. Uh, you can delete all of your fences and fire the employees and then all the tigers go. <laughs> yeah, but don't they just grab? Don't they just grab people and shake them and they scream? They're like. And they'll be like, rrr, rrr, rrr. but I don't think that they actually die. Nobody can die. That game would, that, the game would probably be at least, at least teen if it was that. I don't think that they could die as much as we want them to. Okay. I just, I just got to see if this catches. This could be its own little roller coaster right here, but instead I'm tying together every idea that I could that I can muster. Does it hook? Nice. It does. Okay. 
Now, what do I... What are my final tricks up my sleeve? Should we just make it go as low as it possibly can and see how many loops we can do in succession? <laughs> oh, wait. No, we can't do that. No, 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 no. Wait, that's actually bad. <laughs> that, would, that would be too many Gs, I think. But how fast can you get the coaster going without people getting sick? Like, can I just go... <laughs> straight... I guess? <laughs> this is the most boring part of the coaster. Where it just goes straight. I wonder how fast that loses momentum. <laughs> where's, where's the next car? Oh my gosh, this ride's so long. It'll take forever for that car to get around. Uh, as if my COVID test just came back positive. Did it? I'm sorry to hear that. If, if that is what just happened. That sucks. I hope that you are mostly asymptomatic. The longest ride duration is the ultimate light water valley United Kingdom that takes seven minutes for a ride? Sheesh. Seven minutes to ride a coaster. Dude, I, I don't take seven minutes to do anything. I don't, I, I eat dinner in less than seven minutes. I gotta say, this coaster is pretty clean looking. I mean, it's like, it, I, mean, it, I mean, it's well painted, but also, I don't know. It just looks, uh, I suppose, kind of elegant, possibly. Okay, let's see what this drop looks like. The Enterprise is broken down. I'm shutting down that son of a biscuit. I'm shutting down that Garbo. Great Garbo. I feel like this corner might be... This corner might be too much. Also, the car caught up. Look out. Here they come. Beep, beep. Beep, 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 beep. We're going. We're going. I will have to run maximum. What? Raid? Hey. Bidwell. Thank you for the raid. I appreciate it. Hey. Welcome, welcome. Thank you, Hermione, for the... <laughs> for jumping in the chat. How are you doing? Oi, oi, 3DS Bacon. Thank you for the follow. Hey, Fidwell. Thank you for the raid. What were you playing? Can we get can we get a shout out for Fidwell so that I can see what they were doing? Oh, you were playing Roller Coaster Tycoon too. Sweet. What what were you doing? Were you building building parks? Building parks, playing scenarios, doing custom maps. What was going on? I hope you enjoyed your hope you enjoyed your stream. Thank you so much for for coming over here. If you if you need to bounce out and get some water and food, I totally understand. We are just goofing. I was I was initially gonna try to beat this scenario. This is all from today, uh, but I have decided to just keep building stuff. Uh, doing some co-op scenario play. Ooh, co-op, eh? Interesting. I don't think I've ever seen Roller Coaster Tycoon two. Uh, co-op. That's that's interesting. Now I'm now I'm gonna want to take a look at that. Maybe I can, maybe I can. I'll give you a follow after uh, after the stream. But uh, uh, yeah, okay. This is the first time that I have played this game in a while. I was watching um I was watching a YouTuber that I that I came across recently, and I was like, I now want to play this game so bad. And he was using OpenRCT2. So I've been using that and it fixes so many issues that I had whenever I was a kid. But but anyway, if, if you need to bounce out of here, then thank you so much. I appreciate you bringing your friends over here. And if you all want to hang out with me while I make some more coasters, you are more than welcome. I'll probably be playing for maybe another hour or something. I'm just I'm just building basically a ridiculously long, obscene <laughs> coaster. I was kind of testing momentum here for a second. But now I want to put some loops in here. I'll push some more loops. This is what a man does when he has too much money. This is what I would do if I was Elon Musk. Is this create a free, uh, a free park that everybody can go to? This park isn't free, but... But in real life, it would totally be free. How many loop-de-loops can we get? Who's the YouTuber you were watching? Let me check my phone. Do not, I do not remember. It's literally just his, it's his name. It is Marcel Voss. That's, that's who it is. Marcel Voss. Very, very cool videos. Very enjoyable. Uh, most of his stuff is like breaking down stats and stuff like that. 
breaking down stats and how rides work and stuff he's the one that gave me the idea to uh to charge 20 dollars for my umbrellas because people will buy them anyway <laughs> they don't care ally kate thank you so much for uh for jumping in the chat but yeah it's marcel voss very cool very cool guy yeah marcel is super chill he's a real cool guy let's see i'm gonna loop what left now no i think i'm supposed to go right now but yeah i i'm just a goofy goober uh i i don't know what i'm doing oh okay i gotta go enjoy stream hey ally kate thank you so much for coming over here we'll see you later peace out have a nice rest of your day let's see marcel voss is a good youtuber i agree Let's see if we can we can we have it go straight and then over this. I could put boosters, but I don't think that they're necessary. Oh God, that looks like it might be a little too fast. <laughs> How many loops can we do? There's more. There's more. Hang on. Oh wait, no 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 no. We gotta go up one more. We're going what left right left right. Is another one. I cannot believe how much momentum is built up. If it builds up enough momentum for four loops, I guarantee you this loop is going to be just busted. But I can always slap in uh, boosters or brakes or something. Right now, I'm just trying to make this coaster go all the way around the park for no, for no good reason. No good reason whatsoever. It's because we had a lot of money. That's, that's the good reason. I want to do... I bet you in here I could do an S-Bend... I bet you I could bring down the coaster here uh, nice and gently and then S-bend right into here. Maybe I can make a bigger one. Oh no, not the, co the coaster that kills people. Number one, the killer coaster. A little known fact is that there's a coaster at the Earl of Suds Park that kills people. Everyone who has ever ridden it died. Here we go. Vroom, vroom. You're mining aluminum on the dra on the on a dragon? What? You talking are you talking about Spirit Farrier? I still wanna play that. I wanna play it! Maybe we'll stream it sometime in the future. Okay, okay. I wanna watch how this happens. We might have enough momentum to get back up, but I feel like we're gonna need another chain, to be honest. The voice you do scratches your brain and you can't explain it. Wh which voice? <laughs> which one? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not I'm not paying good enough attention. Is it this one? <laughs> oh, oh, the oh, the chills voice. Oh, you mean the the horrible chills voice. I, I do not like that voice at all. That's why I do it just for you. Okay, we're going to make a curve out of it. Maybe we've got enough momentum. Flatten out. Yeah, we might are we just gonna make it boring over here? We could we could have a somewhat boring end to it. Let's see. Okay. If I how high am I? I'm at 75. We can go down to 30. If we had enough momentum, I would just bring it up further here, but I do think that Oh! <laughs> I failed the objective. <laughs> Dang it! Uh I well. I mean, to be honest, I ended up having so much fun building roller coasters that I really don't mind. <laughs> if I if I had focused on making either pre-built rides or focusing on like all of these little rides, then we would have succeeded. But I don't. I, I do not care. <laughs> I wanted to build coasters. I'm like, what? It's just an ordinary. Oh my goodness, Squidward! <laughs> I still can't do angry. Angry plankton doesn't work. I've got to work on my angry plankton, but I can do the... What? It's just an ordinary Krabby Patty. SpongeBob. Don't be so suspicious. I'm just a happy little plankton. I wouldn't cause any problems for you, SpongeBob. You're my best friend. Merry-go-round is broken. Nobody's riding it. How is the merry-go-round broken when nobody rides it? What? It's just an ordinary... Failing in in two or open doesn't matter much. No content is locked behind winning like in one. Yeah, it's really nice. I, I mostly played one whenever I was a kid. Mostly played one, but I was I was missing out. Well, the Crystal Tycoon is the real darling. I need to... Uh, I need a repurchase 
Uh, whenever I was a kid, I literally bought like the the what are they called? The CDs? Well, they're not CDs. The, the they're not DVDs either. I can't really even remember what they're called anymore. Just the discs, I guess. I had the real discs for one and two that came in like a big pack that I bought. But I have long since lost those. A floppy disk? No, that's that's too old now. <laughs> Angry Plankton never recovered from that concert. <laughs> Squidward! I just know. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that sounds like vocal fry to me. Squidward! Squidward. <laughs> Let me see. You do care, Squidward. Oh, you still have the disc for one? That is sweet. If I, if I looked around, maybe I could find it. But yeah, I bought it at like a book fair or something. But yeah, I, I the bonus fry is broken down. No, not the bonus fry. Everyone's favorite. The green bean and the bonus fry are both. Well, actually, green beans not looking too good. Inverted impulse coaster. Oh, God. Now we unlock the spicy coasters right as I'm finishing up this one. Looks like we might have another coaster on our hand. Coaster on our hand. Get it off. Disgusting. Uh, looks like we're one square off of actually lining it up, I think. So we're two? Kind of hard to tell. No, it is two. Okay, so maybe we'll go... Hmm. If we do a banking turn, it's not enough. Maybe a wide one? I think that that is the... Yeah, but we need it. We need to get rid of some of this height. Honestly, I think we might be... Uh, might need to start heading down very quickly. Otherwise, we might be in a who bunch of trouble. Maybe we could do a... Another, like, corkscrew around or whatever they're called. The, uh, the helixes. Helix down small. No, 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 no. We want a helix down with large. That's how you lose all your, all your height. Oh, wait. Nope. You need one more. One more. Helix down. Ah, uh, no. It, it, that's a full helix. We just need to turn out of this. We do a little custom piece there. And this will probably gain speed, right? Am I running into my own track? Oh, I think that this last piece has to be still going down. Huh. It wants to do another helix, but I have to, what, get flat out of this? The music is perfect for me trying to figure out how to build, like, the most basic roller coaster. <laughs> you could never get the expansion disc working? Oh, what? What a mess. The expansion disc is where it's at, baby. Yeah, again, I mostly played, um, is this going up? This looks so strange. I did mostly play the first one scenarios. I think that I played maybe more custom maps on this one, but there's so much of this game that I have not discovered and lots of rides that I've never got to build before. Like even today, we've, we've built like several coasters that I've never, never seen before. Still a lot of content and I didn't even know. All right, we, all right. We got this going, and it's time to start getting getting a little bit lower. That the test car for this takes so long to get over here. All while I've been building this helix, the test car has been trying its best to make its way over here. Okay, this I think that this is gonna work good. So now I just need to make sure that I am above the paths. I don't remember how high they have to be. This ought to work. And I'm all right with it being a little out of the way because I can do some S-bins. We should have lost like all of our speed at this point. Most of it. Kind of hard to see with the, with the bonus fry in the way, but that's all right. Castle Assault is broken down. Oh, there. Okay, let's do maybe in here a couple of these S-bins. <laughs> How many in a row can we do without it looking like complete garbage? <laughs> oh no. Oh no, what have I done? Maybe we start uh the scream is every couple of seconds. It's a very exciting park, okay? Ooh, custom has been I like that. 
that gonna get in the way here? Uh, <laughs> yep, that's gonna collide. Um, maybe right here we start going down. I like the screams that happen whenever it, they're in the haunted house and then just like... <laughs> so pitiful. Okay, we're almost there. Almost there. Let's see. What does that spin look like? Oh, that's not going to be enough. Maybe we got to do another one of those custom ones. That, I mean, build it. <laughs> we're not done yet. Uh, one of these here. Is what, one more? All right. <laughs> All right. Another station right here. Sheesh. Oh, boy. Are we going to test this? Do an extra wide turn instead of S-bins? Oh, nice. Good suggestion. I literally thought of that, I suppose, as you were on the same sheet of music, my friend. All right. It is testing time. It is time to figure out what kind of horror and terror we are inflicting upon people with this. But if it's there. Okay. I'm pretty sure that we're going to have to change those loops because this is going to be broken, dude. This is going to be broken. Oh, Ahsoka, welcome back, by the way. Welcome back. Oh boy. Is it going to be the laterals or the verticals? It's It's got to be the verticals. Okay, we're going to follow this car. How do we do that? Okay, there we go. No, I want it to be like tracked. Follow this on main view. Okay, there we go. Nice. Cool, cool. Let's ride the, let's ride the coaster. Hypothetically. Here we go. We just finished it, Alchemic. What? It's an epic coaster. I think I'm going to name it the Odyssey, like I said before. It's just such a basic coaster, but I'm I'm learning, okay? It's basic, like me. Oh wait. Oh, I want to check the la the verticals because I I don't think that this is bad laterally. I think that most of it is um most of it's got nice bends, nice loops. But I'm betting that maybe right out of the like the steep drop towards the end. And I probably need to adjust that. The the Odyssey? Like by Homer? Yes. Long book. Long book, long ride. Can I rotate while we're tracking? Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Bob. Here we go. Now for the drop. Now let's see what the verticals look like here. It almost it almost was too much a minute ago. This ride's two minutes so far. Which is not as long as I expected, to be honest. Okay. I'm nervous. I'm nervous. Here we go. And... Oh! That's fine. Too much. Dang it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. All of those went too high. Holy crap. Oh, dear. Okay, well, we're going to have to put at least one break in there, I guess. I'm just going to watch the rest of this. Finish this up. Those are, those are some lateral Gs, but not too many. Okay, that's the only part that we cannot do. That will literally, that, that will kill somebody. When you took AP English in high school, you did both? Ooh, nice. I'm surprised that it's so short, to be honest. Well, it's a fast coaster. You could purposefully build this as a slow coaster if you wanted. Max positive, that's the problem. Excitement is very high. Intensity, very high. Nausea, high, high. Hi. Let me see. Where's the where's the button to go? Okay, there we go. All right. So let's let's fix these. Too much. Too much. Uh, I need to actually shut it down. Hang on. Close it. Close it. No one's allowed in yet. It's our little secret. Uh, you gonna head out? Have a nice stream. Thank you, 3ds Bacon. We'll see you later. Thanks for chilling with us, my friend. Have a good rest of your day. Let's see. I said that we build a break in here. What is going to happen? We got a normal break. Break speed down to... Mm, what's the max? 67. I wonder what this coaster gets up to. Does this ruin my stats and my page? Oh, it does. What? You have to retest it every time? Sheesh. I kind of just want to slow it down a little bit. I don't know how fast it gets going whenever it goes down this hill. Maybe. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe that's too fast. 
40 miles an hour that sounds way too fast i'm just gonna set this to test and uh i'm gonna look around our park really quick and see see what we got going on because we've got still plenty of room we got loads of money forty-one thousand dollars. let's look at my uh new coaster because i i saw that i got a new one we got a twisted roller coaster a wide roller coaster train glides along a smooth steel track traveling through a variety of inversions i i would love some corkscrews we don't have any corkscrew coasters there's also an inverted impulse coaster inverted trains are accelerated out of the station to travel up a vertical spike of track then reverse back through the station to travel backwards and yet another vertical spike of track that sounds pretty cool we don't have any any reversing coasters yet no reversers yet we could try it uh how far has this test gone goodness yeah so i could test the velocity it looks like it gets up pretty dang high what oh loop-de-loop -loop. oh loop-de-loop -loop. how smooth are your inversions that really that really flows just like the original oh loop-de-loop -loop. oh loop-de-loop -loop. how lovely are your inversions <laughs> Invert so good and flip so well. Send these people straight to uh heaven. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Oh reversing coaster. <laughs> Just like at six flags. <laughs> here we go. Alright, how fast do we go? Oh my god, it gets up to 70 miles an hour. <laughs> And then everyone died. Actually, we could get more speed out of that. Because <laughs> it gets stuck here. And then they crash. Oh no. <laughs> did I just save it or did it blow up? Oh no. I think I saved it. Nothing happened. <laughs> Nothing happened. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, hey, Hermione. Thank you so much for the follow. I appreciate it. Thanks for coming over with that raid. Hope you're enjoying the goofiness, the concerning, the concerning tests that are going on. I almost blew up some cars over there. More speed, more power. Give me, give me power. Give me speed. Okay, let me... What are we going to do next? Let's maybe, maybe we'll slap down a couple of normal rides. Hmm. We've been researching roller coasters for a while. Last one that we did was a stand-up roller coaster? What? Stand up. Uh steel. Let me see. Where is the stand-up roller coaster? Does the roller coaster stand up on its own two legs? Where is it? <laughs> I don't see it. Oh, there it is. A looping roller coaster where the riders are in the standing position? What? What? <laughs> They're standing up the whole time? Don't they get tired? Let them sit down. They're tired. Okay, where's where's our coaster at? Oh boy. Okay, well. Here they go. Time to watch. It's about drive! It's about power! <laughs> oh no. Not the, not the memes. Give me speed, give me power, give me that which I desire. Is that what it is? <laughs> oh no. Okay, here we go, here we go. Are they, are they gonna die? You would never ride a standing coaster? <gasps> Coward. Here we go. Is it gonna make it out of here? Is it gonna do it? It's about drive, it's about power. Mm. I'm scared. I'm scared for all the humans. Here we go. The music is so jaunty. Oh, a little too much. But is it actually going to make it, though? Okay, but at least it's like... Oh, but it's not even going to make it, dude. We got too many loops. That sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no! Does, does that do something bad? Oh, here comes another one! Stop! Stop! Close! Close it! 
<laughs> Are people gonna get upset at me like that? Is something bad gonna happen? Um, it is really riding. If you is it really riding if you're standing though? That's true. When you sing that song, you do the Jameson voice. <laughs> it's about drive. It's about power, Spider-Man. I want pictures of Spider-Man. It's about drive. It's about power. I thought it was about teaching the people about. What is he? Uh, maybe we just. <laughs> it's flat. Is that legal? Is that legal in the in the U.S.? I delete this. <laughs> there we go. Let's be fully legal. Oh wait, no, 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 no. One more. Little more. Ta-da! <laughs> Ta-da! It's a totally cool ride. It's a totally cool ride with a 100% flat section. Perfect. I just want this thing to work. All right. I'm getting tired of testing this thing. I'm tired. I want a new. I want a new fresh ride. A nice scenic coast through the forest, indeed. Maybe I'll hit a bird or two. Who knows? We'll have to see. Maybe you'll see a deer in the woods. Don't worry, it's an awfully quiet coaster. They'll never hear you coming. Boom! We've got a windshield on the front so that you don't get a mouthful of feathers. I did want to build another coaster that, like, kind of loops within here. Hmm. Interesting. I am starting to kind of waste the the middle here, but I want to see about this inverted... Oh my god, what the heck is these? These coasters are wild. These look like, um... These look like the new Joker ride. This ride? <laughs> what is this? Who made this? <laughs> Who made this ride? Look at that. That would, that'd fit right in there. I'm tired, Grandpa. What's well, too dang bad? I kind of want to just build a couple of these just to, just to loop them between stuff. They are... This is a really cool ride. No forest decor for the center. Oh, yeah. Good point. We should build some trees. Do a kind of... Whoa. That's jungle trees. That's that's not forest trees. Let's see. That's... Oh, that is just straight up jungle theming. Okay. What kind of tweez we got? We got some thickies. Any thickies in the chat? Let's see. We got... Who's the tallest tree you can build? Mm, here we go. Oh, heck, you're still here. Look at those coasters. Heck yeah. I'm having a good time, Tyrannosaurus. Welcome back. We got so... We've got one coaster that runs around the entire park. <laughs> we just... We just are testing it. Uh, I think... I think that it's about to give me a rating. It's about to give me a rating. <gasps> Murray. Uh, let, let me see. Let me see. Miranda? Miranda! It's you! I saw you from Frulio's stream. Oi, oi, oi! Frulio Frendo! How are you doing? We're building some coasters. This is the tour guide coaster. It's a me! It's a me, Miranda! It took me a second. I'm sorry. You missed this game? Wow! It could be yours for the low, low price of $2.50. Ah, uh, not yet available. How exciting is it? But, but you have to tell me, it's high excitement. How is it high excitement? Boy, this, get, this is a crazy thing right here. Are you getting commission from the game sales? No, I'm not. <laughs> I just, I bought it today. <laughs> I paid for it. Okay, I'm going to set this as like $15. <laughs> but it's not even exciting. Are they going to pay for this? I hope they do. They better pay for it. <laughs> they don't pay for it. I'm gonna have a conniption. Okay, we need a long line. Lines looking long. Long Johns. Ooh, I kinda like that. I kinda like that twisty. The twisty nature, dude. Twisty nature of the ride. Uh oh wait. We need an exit. Un and or exit. And I will uh, open this ride to the public. Uh oh, chain speed should be up. Speed it up, boys. No, no, boy. Don't touch that stuff. Uh, maybe, actually, I'm going to turn it off. And I'm going to look at these cars. If I make it less cars, can I have more trains? Because I want to have more trains, honestly. Four trains. Five trains. 
five trains, five cars? Hmm. I feel like it would be wise to kind of split it up more. But I don't know. Be dumb dumb. Uh, yes, less cars means more trains. That's, I think that that's what I'd prefer. And maybe Schmoven. Let's see. I, I kind of like the white color scheme. Maybe we'll make the supports more interesting. Ow, my eyes. <laughs> this hurts the boy. Red's pretty good. Blue, I don't like that. Herpy. Herpy derps? Hmm. I don't know. I'm pretty used to the red, to be honest. I don't know. It feels right. It feels right, but if we're calling it the Odyssey, is there a better... Let's see, looping coaster trains. We got that. We got that. Hey, Cashman, thank you for the raid. How are you doing? <laughs> thank you very much for the raid. Hey, hi, raiders. Welcome in. I hope that you enjoyed Call of Duty Warzone. I am playing uh, the sister game in that franchise. This is the sequel. Uh, they're very, very similar, but uh, yeah. Welcome in. D doing well, RCT to R R T C two A T baby. R two D two. Yes, we are playing R two D two right now. I love this game so much. My childhood. Oh. But I hope that you enjoyed your your streamings. Thank you so much for the raid. I don't know how to spell the Odyssey. Please help. Odyssey. Odyssey. Yes, and the Odyssey. Jump up, super stuff. Is it two Ds? Or is it one D? How many Ds is it? Is that right? Oh, it's E Y. Is that all that I missed? No, nope. no, not. I put a, I put a, a D instead of a Y. Sheesh. Boy, I don't know how to spell at all. How embarrassing. Uh, just kidding. Let me see. <laughs> Everybody knows how to spell except for the streamer. And unfortunately, he's the one with the keyboard. Okay. The Odyssey. Adventures on Odyssey? Uh-oh. Um, let, let's open it up to the public for the mere price of $15. Odd OC. <laughs> oh, no. That sounds like a suspicious fish dish. Suspicious. What do you guys think? They're like... I can't afford the Odyssey. What? You're poor? You've only got $2, boy. Get out of my park. <laughs> Get out of my park. He looks happy. He says, wow, a new ride is being built. What? They can notice you building rides? That's kind of cool. I like that. Suspicious. <laughs> Suspicious. Oh, boy. Uh, I'm going to actually make an advertising campaign for this ride for many weeks. Oh, wait. Actually, that takes loads of money. We're going to try to get suckers to ride this ride. And then we'll also do an advertising campaign on the park for four weeks. Boom. Let's see if we can drum up some business. You can add ATMs in your parks. Uh oh. Oh! <laughs> oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, well, no, they didn't break though. That's good. <laughs> um, it appears that the smaller trains made the ride not work. I should have anticipated such a thing. I thought that that might happen, but I... But I just went ahead and did it anyway. I just went ahead and did it anyway, and now we've got 13 dead human beings on our hands. Their blood is on your hands as well as mine. Oh, boy. Okay. Three trains. This ought to be safe now. God. Oh, no. If there are ATMs at a park, I take that as a red flag. What? Lens, there are ATMs at every amusement park in the United States of America. I guarantee you. Yeah, let me see. I've never built ATMs before. Oh, restrooms in a log cabin style. We got first aid room. A place for sick guests to go for faster recovery. What? That's awesome. Open her up. Safety first. Oh, might as well bulldoze, bulldoze the whole ride. They'll never ride it now. What? What? Really? Even with my advertising campaign? It should be fine. Uh, <laughs> it should be fine. People are excited to try it out. Uh, I don't actually know how uh, broken rides work in this game. He says, I'm hungry. He doesn't care about how dangerous the ride is. Look at these guys. They say, I can't afford the Odyssey. They didn't say anything about it being dangerous. You, 
You said you wouldn't kill anyone. I tried. Toyaki san, I really did. I really did try to not the haunted odyssey. I really didn't try to kill anybody. I even tested it a bunch of times. I tested it a bunch of times and then I changed something and I didn't test it. I'm Boo Boo the Fool. People, I can't wait to try out. Look at this fool. <laughs> Look at him. He says, I feel sick. I should get on a roller coaster. All right. Go for it, buddy. Let's see. Uh, where's the ATM? Maybe I don't have one. Let will see one. We could, give him a, we could get him a hat stall. Hey, guys, buy some hats. Buy some hats on the house. Just kidding. I'll make them uh, poopy. Perpendicular hats. Or maybe I'll make it something really annoying looking like yellow. Let's see if we got some banana heads in the park. Look, we got one guy riding on it. Let's see if he survives. <laughs> we'll see if he makes it. Wait, did he not get on the ride? Maybe he was just uh, wandering. He might have just been wandering. Because all these people are not interested. I'm not going on the Odyssey. It isn't safe. You aren't safe! You're not safe from my park. How do I... um? <laughs> Um, well, I wonder, I wonder, I suppose that any, I don't know exactly how this works, but is any track portion of this ride, I'm guessing that every portion of the track counts as the Odyssey and that you can't delete anything. The ride must have crashed. Yes, I, unfortunately, uh, it did crash. The Odyssey is broken down already. Great. This ride sucks, dude. I hate mo uh, I hate with most rides, guests have to come two at a time. Oh, two at a time, you say? When it crashes, no one wants to ride it. I know. It's, uh, I'm guessing that that's just a track thing, but I mean, to be fair, it was mostly fun just to build the big ride. Uh, and I think that we might be... Well, hmm. I do kind of want to fill out the middle here, though. The purple ride is amazing! Maybe I could... Uh, <laughs> it reaches a point where I had to delete and rebuild it. Yeah, because I don't think that there's a way to trick them onto this ride. Uh, I could delete it. And basically, the only thing that would have changed is that I have to rebuild it. Like, it, it wouldn't be a pain to, like, move anything. And I wonder if there's a more interesting coaster design that we could use. A twisting roller coaster is interesting because it has inversions like corkscrews. Um, mini roller coaster, spinning wild mouse. Let's see. Uh, I still don't have that big steel coaster that I want. But the twisting roller coasters are very cool anyway because they have, uh, like I said, corkscrews, which are very neat. But these are generally, I guess, not long, but I could make a long one. Ooh, that's cool. Look at that. The Liberty Loop. Since when do we, uh, since when are we able to paint individual, uh, track pieces? Oh, that hard work for nothing. I mean, everything's for nothing, Lex. Oh, let's not, let's not be too dramatic now. <laughs> or is that more dramatic? Uh, <laughs> the, the, the park is still fine. It's thriving. We're thriving, babe. Are you thriving? Oh, that was weak. Wait, what? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> everything's for nothing i mean but there's there's a freedom you can do whatever you want essentially there's a freedom in thinking like that i mean if everything's for nothing then nothing's for something isn't that isn't that a more encouraging way of looking at it uh maybe maybe we will try building one of them corkscrew coasters because i don't think any of these sorry suckers are going to be hopping on this ride anytime soon and vandalism i see some vandalized benches hey hey who's busting who's busting benches out of here those benches be bussing. That's no good. Well, time to delete this. Uh, <laughs> the Odyssey. Uh, you were you were a beautiful ride. Uh, do, 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 do. What would be the point if it's all for nothing? Uh, the experience, the doing of the thing is worth it. You have to. The game is worth the candle, if that is the saying. Is that the saying? It's all about the ride. Exactly. Life's all about the ride. And that's why you shouldn't stress too much because you should just be trying to have a good time. Just do your best to have, a, to have the best life that you can. And I get $20,000. What a deal. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, inversion time. Let's, let's see what kind of track pieces we get on this thing. 
Let's start it back. Yeah, kind of like the beginning. Easy money. Just sell off your parts. Exactly. If Elon Musk wanted to make some real money, he should sell Tesla. Uh, okay. So, we have S-bends, vertical loops, half loops, half corkscrews, helixes, uh, launch lift hills, large half loops, quarter loops. We've got pretty much every barrel rolls. We've got everything. This place has got everything. And it's time to get up in the air. Uh, I'm most curious about, yep, the max height. I was wondering if it would have the same max height as our other coaster, and it does. Or at least uh, close enough. So I'm going to build generally in the same structure, but I'll be able to do much more interesting things with this ride because we've got quite the, quite the variety of track pieces you see. But I am frightened that I'm going to take advantage of these track pieces and uh, I'm going to um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> make the ride too intense. It's very possible. It's perfectly possible if you really think about it. For example, I'm going to try to make this loop not too powerful. All right, here we go. And I'm not going to change anything. Here we go. When you change the options and change colors, there should be a paintbrush that lets you change the parts of the track. Oh, sweet. We will take a look. Imagine that you're in the second car and everyone in the first car dies. And then all of a sudden, God's hand comes out of the sky and he grabs you by the collar of your shirt and then drops you back in the park because that's what essentially could happen. The most intense ride in the world. Park reviewers are calling it the most intense experience in all of entertainment history. Your mom can't ride this ride. One reviewer was heard saying, "Wait, what? Corkscrews? Oh yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go up for the loop. Can we do loops? Oh my god! It's the most dangerous park in all of history, created by a madman. This is 60 minutes, and today we're gonna be talking about Earl Land." The ear of suds, as he's known online, murdered 17 people on his concerning ride, the Odyssey. Controversial. <laughs> Killing people is controversial. <laughs> okay, that, that should do. Did not, exactly. I, I didn't kill anybody. Uh, <laughs> this does not look like a roller coaster. This loop. Looks like somebody pinched the track. That does not look like a full loop. That looks like it's way too tight. But I can't, I can't actually adjust the size of that. Uh, can human beings, like, survive these types? These types of G-forces? Possibly. It is a little baby loop, I'm telling you. Let's do an extra helix. Just for kicks. I'm doing helix just for kicks now. You need to have a secret grave in the woods. Yep. It's all part of the ride experience. Getting buried is part of your ticket price. <laughs> We're saving you money on funerals. Why are you complaining? Okay, here we go. We're going to be moving through the woods now. The loop-de-loop -loop looks like someone's trying to cut off the water to the hose. But they can't do it because the pressure's too strong. We've got a candy apple stall. What? Candy? Apple? Candy fruit. Mm. <laughs> uh, I kind of want to... Yeah, I think I'm going to adjust some land. He's a land adjuster. That's how I made my money initially. Land adjusting. Then what if we straightened it out and then we banked the other way? That'd be pretty sick, no? <laughs> I feel like this is going to be sickening. I'm excited. And then again! <laughs> Wait, the other way, yeah. There we go. <laughs> this is what you do whenever you don't have corkscrews available. It goes... Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know if that's a good idea, but that will be easy to change if I want to. <laughs> if everybody gets sick. Okay, now it's time to uh, go upward, and maybe we shall create some corkscrews. There we go. We're going to go. <laughs> Cut off all that momentum. There's no way that they can ascend that. 
There's no chance. I'm putting, I'm putting my, I'm putting all my money on the table. All of it. Every bit of it. Here it goes. We're going to call this one the neck breaker. Oh, honey, look out. <gasps> they did it. Never mind. Looks like I have to give away all my money. Okay. Now we're going to go. Should I go for slow corkscrews or does that make it worse? I feel like a super slow corkscrew has got to be painful, right? Oh, that's a big one. Ooh, that's not what I expected. I thought that that was a barrel roll, but that is a corkscrew, son. Holy moly. Okay, so out of the corkscrew, can we keep going down? Kinda. But it's banked? No, it isn't. So I should be able to go down and then do a barrel roll. <laughs> God, the twists. Okay, one. This looks like a looks like a pipe cleaner. This guy's making rides like pipe cleaners. This is dangerous. Your neck is going to be gone. Oh, Ahsoka, you're going to go to bed? Uh, time for me to head out for the night. All right. It was great to hang out with you. We'll see you later, Ahsoka. Get some rest. Get some rest. Rosie's laying on your mouse. <gasps> your pet mouse got out, and then Rosie's, Rosie has attacked it. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to hear about Mr. Mousekins. Mr. Mousekowisk. 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 Okay, where's my test coaster? Here it comes. Wow! <laughs> and it can keep going. Sweet. There's more speed to be built up. All right. It takes forever for the car to get here. I want to see how far it can make it with its momentum. Oh my gosh. Come on. Here we go. A date? Kelly, congratulations. I hope it goes very well. I hope you enjoy. Let me see. How high can it go? I could generally like guess based on the other one. But this is a very different coaster. Come on. <laughs> chop, chop. <laughs> this is a great ride though. If it takes this long, it's a great value. I feel like I'm gonna break people's necks on that part. I don't like that. Zoom! Okay, mix it up to about 80. Nice. All right, now we bring it up. And we are going to do what? Maybe a, like a toilet bowl? That's just kind of, you know, we're moving down a little bit. You know, it's, it's getting exciting. It's heating up. It's heating up. This coaster is going to be a bit more spicy than the last one, I'd say. Now I can do... Uh, <laughs> maybe we'll do... Uh, oh, I think that actually instead of corkscrew, we need to start a bend. And you just click down and then... Oh, God. <laughs> Sweet, dude. All right, that'll do. That'll do. Down the toilet, the entire park goes. No. Ooh, that is a cool design. I do like that. Then we should keep it. Can we keep it bent? I, I was testing that earlier. Yeah, uh, we'll we'll even it out again. I can't see. Where where are we? Where are we here? Go back up a little bit. Even it out. That's going through the trees. I could, oh, we should make it go through the mountain. Yeah, 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 yeah. If we're this low already, we might as well make it go through the mountain. Woo, woo, that'd be my favorite part of the ride. Spin me right round, baby, right round. Okay, let's raise up some ground. We're going through the mountain. You just gotta make sure that there's enough ground to stick out of. <laughs> and we should be able to get out of there. So we can continue our coaster. Just got to make sure that it goes, yeah, flat, I guess. Oh, I need uh, one more. I missed literally one little, one little corner of it. 
Ranger. That should be close. I think I might have to do one more adjustment. Yep. Final one. Nope, it's not. I'm gonna lower this one instead. Okay, and we're out. Let's see, what else can we do with this coaster? Uh, it kind of depends on how much speed we have out of this. But we'll go back up as far as we can and then maybe go down and do some corkscrews. Oh, good. All that, uh, all that land adjustment has had them come around. You know, they've, they've come around. This is a really great way to descend without gaining speed. If, if that's what you wanted. That's, that's not what I was looking for, but... I mean, if that's, if that's what you wanted, then this is how you get it. Still plenty of speed. So I'm going to bring it up to maybe 65. Even it out. Let's go down a bit. Build some speed. And then a half corkscrew. Or we can do a full corkscrew. Might as well. Barrel rolls. Oh, God. <laughs> can I just do another barrel roll directly after it? Is that twisting the same way? Yeah. How many barrel rolls can you do in a row? Without everyone dying. Uh, there we go. Hey, Awkward IRL, how are you doing? <laughs> We're building some sadistic roller coasters. I hope you're doing well. Hello there, Awkward. We're making the most mighty coaster. Oh my gosh. Here they go! Here they go! Up the up to the Mount Mount Doom. Maybe we should raise up some ground right here in the middle and put a little tree. <laughs> put a tree straight in the middle. Let me see. Just the middle. <laughs> ah no! I should have stopped! I should have checked! I was way off. Oh no. <laughs> Back down you go. Jeez. What a waste of money. Okay, well. See how these corkscrews work. Let's see. Let's see. Here it goes. I just want to keep that up for a little while. Okay. So it should be in here, right? Okay. Okay. Oh, Linz. We'll see you later. Hope you enjoyed uh, some roller coaster madness. We'll see you later. Get some rest. Get some rest, Brendo. I missed it again, dude. Where is it? Can't raise the land. The roller coaster's in the way. Where is... What? Can you not put things in the middle? Or am I just super off? Now how's it in the way? <laughs> it's so hard to figure out where the middle is. Is it here? Aha! <laughs> there it is. <laughs> okay. Oh, -ho. I just love the little screaming voices. Ah! Let's see. How many blocks can we fit in here? It looks like there's more on the front face that we can do. This is what happens whenever you give a man too much power. Too much power. A man will build a park filled with madness. No rhyme or reason. He does it because he says he likes it. I can't see anything behind this behind this castle, but it's fine. Okay, let's just finish out this roller coaster. Oh, Lemonberry, you're off to bed. All right, we'll see you later, Lemonberry. Hope you enjoyed some madness to end out your evening. We'll see you later, friendo. Okay, let's make it back to the corkscrew. I think that we might finish this coaster and maybe we can find somebody else that's playing this game. I'd be down to watch. I'd be down to watch for sure and see how they make stuff. Because I am a goofball. And I'm kind of curious what people do in this game. And we got raided by somebody that was playing this game too. We could, we could keep up the roller coaster energy. Okay, we're not going to need a chain lift immediately, I don't think. It doesn't seem like it takes too much momentum to get out of a corkscrew, actually. Which is pretty cool. I wonder if this is going to ruin the ride. Is this Is this going to be like... Is it going to raise the stats too high? I don't really know how some of these uh, parts go. You're going to sleep so good tonight. You slept like two hours last night. Oh, my gosh. Alchemic. Good sleeps are coming. Here it comes. Here it comes. I can hear good sleep running down the hallway. 
Its bare feet are slapping against the laminate wood. <laughs> Look out! Here comes good sleep! <laughs> okay, let's see what these corkscrews look like. I'm losing guess. I can't imagine why. I wonder what event could have happened recently that would have lowered my guest count. <laughs> God. And then it goes all the way up to about 90. So we can put a chain on that or it looks like we're starting to get into the zone where we can reconnect. So I think that we can maybe use enough momentum out of that to do maybe a wider S. Yeah, let's actually just do a, a... This would be a turn, and then this one's supposed to be super wide. And where are we at? We need to get lower. I can't even tell where I... Oh, okay. I feel like this is going to be too, too high, too fast. And we don't have to go this high either, so let's go down to maybe what we think we can get over that path with? Not sure where that path is going to get in our way. Oh, I think we're way above it. Let's stay nice and low. We'll do a wide turn. And we'll lower down as low as we can. I think that's as low as you can go right now. And this shouldn't be... Ooh, I don't think that we can put a S-Bend in here. Oh, well... We can, but that, that might not be good for your neck. Uh, crikey, long stream! Wait, is it? Oh, five hours? Yeah, I guess so. It is a long stream on a... Tayaki, what is that? <laughs> Tayaki! Thank you for the five gifted subs. Hey! Yo, can we get some hype in the chat for Tayaki gifted big brick subbies? I appreciate it for for uh for Heidster, for Fluffs, for Take My Money, Tatted Cat, and Andrea. Hey, for Andrea and also for Tatted Cat and Take My Money. Nice. Thank you, Tayaki san. So generous. I appreciate it. <gasps> Cashman's still here. Hey, Cashman, you gonna stick through to the next raid? That is so wholesome. You raid me and then you stick till, till the next raid. That's so awesome. Awesome sauce. All right. Let's give it a test. You've been lurking? I, I, I only lurk. I only lurk. We are the same. We are literally the same. Okay, okay, okay. Here we go. Kareem, you're going to get some sleep. Going to get some sleepies. Rest up, friendo. Can't test it. Interest not built. What? Who cares about an entrance? You don't need an entrance to test if a ride works. <laughs> We don't need test subjects. You don't have to bring the dummies to the entrance. Okay, here we go. Hey, Fluffs, you got a gifted sub. Enjoy your emotes. They're all very, very cute purple squirrels. I hope you love them. I hope you love them. We're going to be watching train number one. Let's, let's watch train number one on the main view. Here we go. First ride. We're going to be watching mostly, I'm guessing, lateral G's? I don't, I don't remember what corkscrews cause. You just made me install the game. Hopefully I can get it to run. Yeah, Um. what you need to do, Cashman, is that you need to get the mod known as uh, OpenRTC. I believe that you can get it at OpenRTC.io. Uh, and that will help it work on modern computers. It like unlocks things like resolution options and fixes sound issues and fixes bugs and pathing issues and changes AI. It's, it, I would say it's necessary. I would say that it is necessary, but yeah. It's running totally good on Windows 10. I don't have Windows 11, but I don't know. Should work the same. Should work the same. There we go. Up, up, up the stairs we go. Actually, this ride looks totally reasonable, to be honest. Looks like it's totally fine. And this is also a real world test. There's no crash. Is this a standing one? No, this is a twisting coaster. Uh, the standing coaster is literally called a standing coaster, but yeah, this one this one is called a twister roller coaster. You get to sit. You could you could you can ride on this one. No worries. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Oh, I do like this. Okay, so now I know that at a decent speed, it's just not it's just not bad. Everything looks good. I think that this is going to test well. Good, good, good. 
you have such a hard time building coasters, honestly, Jebby, it is pretty tricky. I've made uh, loads of mistakes this evening. I have to keep like uh, deleting stuff. And the last coaster that we built in the spot that this coaster is in, it um, it killed a few people. <laughs> it was an accident and I had to delete the whole thing. Nausea rating is high. Sheesh. Nausea rating's high, but none of the, but the G's aren't horrible. Huh. I wonder why it's so intense. I hope people love it because uh, we're keeping it because, uh, I'm not getting rid of it. Let us, uh, give it a price and get some people on here. You know, last time was a big, a big failure, but now I'm going to char I'm charging 15 bucks for this ride. This is going to be our money maker. You guys, we're going to open it up and we're going to make a Let's get some people on here. I want to advertise this particular ride for a couple of weeks. It's a twister. Let's go. I want to see, I want to see people ride this. I want to see if they love it. Your intense rating is always super high. There are lots of ways to manage that. There's lots of ways to manage that, and I don't know what they are, so. <laughs> uh, I know that, for example, uh, banked turns help you out. But uh, yeah, I mostly make pretty intense coasters as well. I still have a lot to learn about this game. This is an insane coaster though. How long is it? I didn't even look at that. It says that its max speed is 57 miles an hour. Average speed is about 20. The ride time is two minutes, 25 seconds. The ride length is 5,500 feet. I guess that's big. Highest drop is 62 feet with eight inversions that those inversions are probably why this is rated very very high in nausea <laughs> look people are riding it fools fools don't they know what was built here last time don't they know what they're doing you want to climb on this ride see if you enjoy looks like we've almost got it one full one full cart look at that <laughs> You hate roller coasters? You get motion sick really easily? Aw, oh, that sucks. That is too bad. Best avoid them then. I... I am the kind of guy... <laughs> whenever I was younger, me and my uh, friends, we went on the teacups ride, and we all worked together and spun those teacups as fast as we, as, as we could possibly spin them. And they went so fast that... Whenever they tried to uh, close, like, uh, to stop the ride, the brakes or something on the ride could not stop us from spinning. And the employees didn't want to stop the momentum that we had built up. So they let us ride again. And they... <laughs> and we obviously did not spin it uh, that hard the second time because we wanted uh, to be able to get off the ride. <laughs> and... We decided to get back in the line for a third time, even though a couple of us were feeling sick. And uh, we we did one more round of that. And uh, yes, we unfortunately made one of our friends puke. But that is, you know, <laughs> that is the price that we pay for teacup rides. So <laughs> I would say I'm like anti-nausea, I guess, or not. Probably not anti-nausea. I uh, do not get nauseous <laughs> very easily. My poor little brother. There was another uh, amusement park that was really small, kind of a mom and pop amusement park. Very concerning. Uh, but they have a, a Ferris wheel that is the most interesting Ferris wheel I've ever seen in my entire life. It is, you know, standard spoken wheels or whatever. Big, big wheel, big spokes. And it would just spin around. But the catch, literally the catch, is that they had a bar that you could pull backwards. You could twist the bar. And whenever you twisted that bar, it basically was a break. And that break kind of tied your little cart, the little cart that you were in. It tied it to the, um, it tied it to the spoke or the, or the big wheel. So basically, instead of like spinning independently, if you break, if you made it break, then it would not spin independently of the Ferris wheel. Like you see how these are rotating, but they're always remaining upward. Well, if you pulled the brake, so essentially at the top, if you're at the very top of the Ferris wheel and you're sitting normally, if you pulled the brake, then whenever you made it to the bottom of the Ferris wheel, you would be upside down. 
And uh, if you pulled the brake, say, like halfway through going up, then whenever you were halfway on the other side, then you'd be upside down. And you could do all sorts of things. Like what, what I would normally do is I would freeze the brake almost at the top. And whenever you make it to the bottom, then you let go of the brake and the cart would go like, yo, 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 yo. <laughs> but if you, if you just held it and were upside down at the bottom, all of the blood rushed straight to your head and it was uh, intense. So yes, I, I <laughs> that's how I earned my stripes is on, is on that ride. The insane uh, Ferris wheel that I, I did my darndest to make it like the most miserable ride to ride with me. And uh, one of my friend's dads was there too. And he was like, oh, I, I love exciting rides. And I was like, oh, well, if you want, I can I can run the brake. And he was like, okay, sure. And after he got off, his eyes were bugging out of his head. And he was like, my God, boy, you're about to make me sick. Uh, so don't ride rides with Kenny. Oh, what? Just, ri just don't ride rides that I can control. Those are very few and far between. Also, it looks like this coaster's working. And also, full cart there. I mean, we did advertise it, so we're kind of cheating. But yeah, are we making are we making mad moosh on this ride? How much is it worth? If you press the demolish button, then it tells you how much it's worth, right? It might take a long time. It says the income is $28,000 per hour. Whoa! <laughs> $28,000 per hour. I don't think I've seen a number that high before in this game. Let me see how much this old bumblebee's earning. This one's earning $7,000 an hour. You know, pretty good. What about this ride? It's it's earning $8,000. Not bad. Uh, the, print, the, the, the fry is earning $0 per hour. Why? What is happening? Why is this ride broken? And why are these people T-posing at the edge of it? Okay. Well, we made a pretty cool park, you guys. Pretty cool. We failed this scenario, but you know what we, you know what we earned? Friendship. We based, we traded, we traded the scenario for friendship and made a pretty, some pretty sick coasters. Had a good time doing it. I say that we should move on out of here. Actually, I'm going to, I'm going to save this. We'll save this game real quick. <laughs> we'll save this scenario again. We're failures, but that's okay. You got to fail at something. Might as well be Roller Coaster Tycoon. Anyhow, we should search for somebody. Maybe there's another person that's playing this game and we can go say hi. And we can watch, uh, we can watch and see what, see what they make. But uh, thanks for hanging out with me, guys. Thanks for uh, watching me make uh, Madness Park. Madness Park. It was lots of fun. Uh, thank you for, <laughs> I mean, I know that you can't choose games for me, but still indulging me in a game, even though I said that I was going to play something else. <laughs> let me, let me see. We could, let's see if I can find somebody else. <laughs> it's not a failure. It was fun. Exactly. That it was for fun. Therefore, I cannot fail the scenario. There's only one other person that is playing this game. <laughs> <laughs> there is one other human playing this game, and that is probably why I was raided by somebody else that was playing the game. <laughs> Maybe we could raid. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Oh man, I slept through most of the stream. Oh, what? You're playing but not streaming? Oh, well, that's what I meant. I mean, there's loads of people playing this game right now. You slept through most of the stream? Well, awkward. It's all right. I'll be back on Thursday. More people playing than Nickelodeon. More... More people than are playing Nickelodeon Brawl? Are you serious? Are you kidding me? No, you are, is that a joke? Nick Nickelodeon All Star Brawl? Oh my God! You're right. Why did Why did you know that? <laughs> That is so funny. That is, I, I, I mean, that's what you get for copying a really popular game, I guess. That is so funny to me. I don't know why, but that game is new. That's so silly. Okay, well, it looks like we can basically, uh, if we all work together, if y'all guys, you know, pair up with me and we work really hard, 
We can literally boost any game past Nickelodeon Brawl. What game deserves to be uh, better than Nickelodeon Brawl? We get to choose. That's our decision. We can do whatever we want. Uh, sounds like a failed game to me. Uh, yes, that sounds like, I mean, it, it's yes. It's it's very much just a copy of Super Smash Brothers. Uh, so, Frog Detective 3. Is that even a game? Is there a Frog Detective 3? Because we've already played the first two. Is there one? Spelunky. I can't believe that you still like Spelunky. I can't believe that you want me to watch that. So is there is one? Frog Detective 3? I mean, we love Frog Detective. Puzzles? <laughs> playing playing pixel puzzles live? I mean, we could. I bet you that there's plenty of people playing puzzle games. Oh, it's coming out this year. Okay. Well, Frog Detective is most excellent. And we've already played two of them. You, you're a detective and a frog. And it's time to solve a mystery. <laughs> This game's uh, dialogue is absolutely ridiculous and is very funny. Frog Detective 3, Corruption at Cowboy County. <laughs> I love Spelunky and it's been months since you've played. You ain't even got it installed, I bet. Well, who cares if it's installed? It's a small game. I can, I can, I do have it installed. Thank you very much. But I could download this game in like five minutes. It's game. It's uh, big games that you have to keep installed. Freaking Grand Theft Auto takes forever. <laughs> yeah, since uh, May, since May 2021. That's true. That's true. We'll play it sometime soon. Anyway, I'm not gonna. <laughs> Cowboy, what? Sounds like. Uh, sounds like it's based in your hometown. It says what? Corruption at Cowboy County. We got some suspicious fellas with their cowboy hats. Oh wait, that, that sounded more like an announcer than a cowboy. Um, well, maybe, uh, we could maybe raid uh, Eerie Coffee if we wanted to. Eerie Coffee's been hanging out with us a lot and they seem like a nice bean. I haven't watched uh, any other streams yet, but they've, been, but they've been chilling with us in the chat and they raided us a little while ago. So I don't know, they seem, they seem pretty cool. Time Sage and Caffeinated Friend. I think that they're a VTuber and they're playing Pokemon. Uh, again, I will not be playing tomorrow, but uh, the next day I might get to Pokemaning. Um, oh, I can see my, I can see me myself lurking. I say that we go. Let's go say hi to Eerie Coffee because she's been hanging out with us and is a is a very nice bean. Let's uh, let's see. I'll make up a message maybe with Bleppies. Hey, Splat! You caught me at the end. It's good to see you. Thanks for jumping in. Oi, oi! See you, boss man. Yep, I got one. I got one day off, but I'll be right back. All right. I'm just going. I'm just going to take this one day off. Okay. I'm taking it for mental health. Okay. It isn't because I need to because my mental health is failing. I'm doing fantastic right now, and I do not want to take a break. And that is part of why I'm taking uh, one day off because. I guess I need to get used to that, or I need to be better about that, but I don't want to. I don't want to take a break. Okay, we're gonna go say, uh, we're gonna say, can I have a sip? <laughs> can I have a sip of that coffee? <laughs> Stupid messages. <laughs> LOL, you don't need to explain it, bub. You're entitled to break. I know, I'm just, I'm just struggling with it because I don't want to take a break. <laughs> I'm complaining. I'm not I'm I'm not explaining it. I'm complaining about it. I'm whining about it because I don't want to leave you guys. But I do have somebody to hang out with. Ow, ow, ow. Uh makes sense. Create a schedule that includes days off. Exactly, because otherwise I'll just be playing all the time. Uh <laughs> I do I am really wanting I think I'm gonna stream on Saturday though. I think I, I, I think I might stream on Saturday because I want to, I want to stream because I'm about to leave. I'm about to leave. I'm going to leave on the 10th, go to Florida. So maybe, yeah, I'll take that. Uh, no, I'm leaving on the 11th. I should probably not stream the day before. Maybe, maybe I can take a break on Wednesday and then go Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and then I leave. <laughs> we'll see. I'll make up something, but you guys, thank you so much for the support hanging out, mostly chatting, honestly. I super appreciate the support of subs and bits and uh, raids and stuff like that. Uh, but most of all, 
I mean, thanks so much for talking with me and just uh, goofing off with me and <laughs> making my brain go burr. That's that's the best part is hanging out with you guys. That's, that's my favorite part <laughs> is getting to share uh, games that I enjoy. And I freaking love Roller Coaster Tycoon. So maybe we'll play it if uh, if the mood if the mood is right. The jig is up uh, or whatever the lyrics are. But yes, thank you so much for hanging out with me. And uh, let's go say hi to uh, to one of our newest friends, Eerie Coffee. They're real nice bean. They got a really cool, uh, really cool VTuber avatar. And we can see if we vibe over there. You guys could tell me what you think about it. But yeah, let's go hop out. Let's hop out. Go, 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 go. And I'm going to say goodbye to some specific people. Thank you so much, Alchemic, for, for being an incredible mod. I mean, an incredible uh, friend, mod, you know, everything else. And uh, Lens was also here watching over the chat. Jedi is always, always lurking around somewhere. Die made it to the chat tonight. Oh, yeah. Calico, thanks for hanging out. I'm glad you're out there doing stuff with people and not sitting in your apartment alone. I didn't say that I was hanging out IRL. Anyhow, uh, awkward IRL. Thanks for being here. The King of Squirrels been here since the beginning. Thanks for hanging out. Tayaki san, much love. Thank you so much for the for the uh, <laughs> for the gifted subs earlier. Mushroom gal, get some rest. I hope that you have a wonderful evening. Thanks for hanging out. Toronto Taurus, I was so glad to get to see you. See you later, Emily. Bye. Uh, Fate shine, peace out. Hope you enjoy your evening. Bye bye, fun chick. Bye bye, splat. I'm glad that you made it till the end. Or uh, we're at the end. Okay, let's go say hi to Eerie Coffee. I'll put the message like a couple more times. Here we go. Can we have a sip of that coffee? All right, charge. Get out of here. Shoo, shoo, shoo. And thanks for watching the videos. Appreciate it. I want to see uh, what Eerie Coffee thinks about this raid.